Hey, how's it going? Gonna do one of these again. Yeah, seemingly, well, not seemingly, I enjoyed it. I did enjoy it. I'm telling you I did. Why won't you believe me? And uh, others did as well. So, combined with the fact that I liked it, others liked it, means why not make more? Basically. Uh, so yeah, we're going to, well, why don't I hop right in, clean a submarine while watching things. So, I, I gotta figure out, like, a name for these and, like, get it a little more organized, as is my want. Um, get it down to a science, as it were. But, uh, basically what it is, is I'm just sort of recording what is a lazy Sunday for me on this lazy Sunday where I would, uh, you know, play a relaxing game of some sort. Hey, we're starting with one of the most relaxing, uh, while watching, you know, I'll watch some streamers. Uh, we're going to watch, uh, uh, Doughboys right now and just sort of, uh, you know, typical, uh, on in the background type content is what we're doing. Content, content. Um, yeah, so why don't I start by starting the Gum Podcast. In 1924, Dutch settlers founded the city of New Amsterdam. Some Nick Wagger here to if start that us name off. sounds unfamiliar, you may know it by the name assigned by the British Crown right. after assuming control of the good. settlement in 1664. New York. That looks good to New me. New York City, also known as the Big Apple and the City That this. Never Sleeps, uh, yeah. would go on to become the most <laughs> Excuse me, so we're going to... I decided I wanted to do the submarine first, the just as to sort of warm up. And then Frank once Sinatra we're warmed up Beyonce a bit, we'll go into the aquarium. The center of habitation and yeah. culture and beloved song. But what if a resident of New York City were to move all the way across the country to the city of Los Angeles? This unprecedented Los Angeles, the windy app. was exactly what Nick Andresano did in 1979, trading the subways mm. of New York for the freeways of Los Angeles. All right, what's the game? Andresano yeah. quickly noticed something Start was the missing front. in the Southern California metropolis, also known as the City of Angels, or simply L.A. Italian food. <laughs> L.A. New York City boasts a thriving Italian culinary scene, most notably pizza, served in a signature New York style due to its sizable population of Italian immigrants and their descendants. But Los Angeles, a settlement that borders the Pacific Ocean as opposed to the Atlantic, and is historically linked to Mexico and its Spanish colonizers, has far weaker ties to the European nation of Italy. So I actually Sonic, didn't look at what restaurant they're Italian doing. American, whose family operated a pizza restaurant yeah, just sort of pizzeria in New York, opened an upscale Italian establishment in Los Angeles, which quickly grew to three locations. After partnering with fellow Italian-American Angelo Filato, the duo opened a fast, casual version of the concept, which today has 40 Ooh, restaurants seagulls. not just in Los Angeles, but across California, which is the most populous of the 50 United States. Today, <laughs> I think there's more people in California than there is in Canada, in if I do recall. But in other, perhaps even more significant ways, the two cities are alike. And one of those ways, thanks to trailblazers like Nick Andresano, is the availability of pizza and pasta. Mm -hmm. This week on Doughboys, Amici Pizza and Pasta. Amici Pizza. Okay, so if you're unfamiliar with Doughboys, it's a podcast where, you know, if you want to boil it down, they review chain restaurants. Now, something I've often said of Doughboys, and probably a lot of examples Welcome of this. Welcome to Doughboys, the podcast about but chain it, restaurants. I'm Nick White. If you're watching... Uh, host or listening Cream scenario. Uh, to Doughboys for Mitchell. the Cream sole scenario. purpose of After recently seeing the film where uh, Cage food restaurant reviews, you're doing it. It's just a sort of It's a canvas down under. for Nido's. comedy. Nido sent that for in. funny Nido's. people Nido's. sitting around shooting the shit. A Having a, a topic to fo focus on. I can't really do the Australian accent, it turns out, um, I'm finding right now in real time. Down under. Down under. Which, you know, Let's say that if you've ever jacks, tried to... Big pick. Big pick. Big pick. Mm, I got uh, more of those. Oh, you know what that reminds me. Jacks. Down under. Like Set timer for one hour. <laughs> you sound like the guy That's so I remember like to have a sip of water something. every hour and don't die. <laughs> These pets are coming back to life. Speaking Hope the of... lobsters don't. 
Speaking of Stephen King, uh, yeah, so yeah. if you ever try to write anything, guess. it's like, uh, it's got some balloons on it. This is our I don't know if it's sort of like a famous thing, but has his own clothing line. it's actually usually much easier to um, write something and with some constraints in place. Like write about yes. uh, so a dog having a bad day versus write about anything you want. Usually, it's actually almost yeah, surprisingly going to be easier to um, then, uh, write about that dog having a bad day uh, the, uh, than just a quote, anything you uh, want. Also has a food stain on it, and then they got this little uh, balloon hat. Just and I find you know, that's with comedy podcasts. <laughs> you know, you have a that loose base, <laughs> which is just an excuse for <laughs> funny people getting together and <laughs> shooting the shit. Uh, what's the Will Smith Hang Lee movie? It's a uh, it's a fucking uh, 120 FPS. Uh, what the fuck's that movie called? Gemini, oh, Gemini, Gemini Man. Man. It's a Gemini, Gemini Man. Gemini Man. Never saw that one. <laughs> Gemini Man. Two eyes. Oh shit. You would be able to beat me. With two of you would be able to. You could take me down. Yeah, easily. Easily. Oh, I don't know about easily. Oh, no, we need both of us. <laughs> Look, you, you say you need neither. <laughs> um, <laughs> I gotta say something before we start. Yeah. It was a big moment. Uh, Mike Dorman, our, our, uh, audio, our video, video editor. Audio editor, sorry. I know, I know, I know who is who in this. <laughs> I know who does what in this damn outfit. I know what happens here. Who's that? Frigger. That's not his name. Frigger the mouse man. He, he clicks around. Okay, all right. You know Frigger the mouse man. All right. <laughs> the Story mouse man. Uh, hey, buddy. I try not to remember that guy. Uh, he, so we were in the kitchen. We, had, we, we were going to introduce our guests. It's weird for me to be telling the story, but we were in the kitchen. We had just eaten great bread for a double. That's right. Alert, for a future double. Uh, Patreon episode. For a past double. double for a yeah, I wonder how their so Patreon does. I assume probably good. We did sourdough boys. We did sourdough uh, actually, it's and, funny because uh, we I've and, never uh, really been tempted by uh, a Patreon just because that's right. he says, there's so much there? content out bread? there that... I'm already overwhelmed by it, so to add more is <laughs> nerve-wracking enough that the thought of paying for adding those nerves, yeah. it doesn't make sense. I, I, I do like the idea, of course, of supporting the artists, but not at the, uh, not at the you know, sacrifice of my brain. <laughs> it did. It did not. It did not. It, he loved the. He loved the whole idea. Oh, yeah. And here's and, and and I give it actually to him because I said I said you know I said he said this Hawaii is very nice and I said actually Hawaiian rolls are actually made with pineapple juice. I said that. That's to right. Him. You did. And he had well, no actually. idea. I actually huh. did. I didn't know that. It was a great. Was, I, I've never had one of those Hawaiian rolls. Like, they, they usually come in those like square boxes, but they always look pretty good. Uh, we like Adam. We have yeah, good time love Adam. here. But, good uh, he did the thing. It was he very the exciting. He did the thing. It was very exciting. Emma, let's hit him with the drop, because I wasted everyone's time. <laughs> Is this what you do on every episode? Wendy's oh. has gotten real... I, like, I love Wendy. Is this what you do on every episode? <laughs> Wendy says, they, well, they, they, they changed their fries. Is this what you do on every episode? I uh, submitted a drop like, once. Didn't do make it off. <laughs> Wendy says... They, well, they, they, they change their fries. Is this what you do on every episode? <laughs> what are we on, Doughboys? What's going on? I like the piano the great there. Tim Heidecker. That's right. Uh, hmm. Of Tim this, and Eric fame. Okay, let me say something of Tim and Eric. And I only say this because I know there's no way that Tim or Eric will ever hear this. Because I don't like saying unkind things to people in general. But I just never got them. I mean, I tried too because uh, I tried on multiple, many multiple occasions to get into Tim and Eric because people whose comedic uh, opinions I, you know, appreciate and respect are seemingly fans of Tim and Eric. But every time I tried to watch them, it just it, it didn't penetrate. Like they're weird, 
pitch, picture attached. Which Thanks, I often we got a picture. You can look at this dog. Oh my god, this is a The whole comedy photo. side of things. It's, it's just photo? never, uh, oh, never okay. hit me for whatever all reason. Naked, they're all sultry photos. They seem very nice. You guys will see it and you'll agree with me. Oh, that's a bedroom photo. Yeah, that's uh, People love them. The one belongs to the I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Uh, Jamie? I the little TV. <laughs> Jamie, lower your sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> We've got like a dog in this, they're a little, I, I describe them as splayed. Jamie lays like this. Yeah. It's very, very cute. What a cute dog. I lay like that sometimes after the shower on a hot day. <laughs> I, that's a great move. You gotta do it. If you've that's got a great. box fan, you angle that right, you I'm, dry up in no time. <laughs> I'm a never do man. Uh, I have a feeling uh, this uh, submarine's like gonna be, be a pain. Of what's mm. going on with me. Uh, so, you know, most mirrors in my house are covered with the black sheets. Uh, sure. Like, it very much looks like a Dracula's home. Mm. You've been there. A Dracula's home. <laughs> or a Jewish in mourning home. Anyways, Don't think over the mirrors like fairly <laughs> sure, like you For reasons that are poorly understood, the bedrock we'll on the break. slopes no, no, of no, Rushless no, are extraordinarily All right, fertile. We're back. Uh, mm. is still texting. <laughs> Our guest today, a writer and comedian from the other two, and Twisted Metal, Gilly Nassim is here. Hi, Gilly. Oh, yeah, because Mitch is on Hi, Twisted Metal. I, I do want to watch that. I, did, I haven't watched the first season. Yet. I've heard it's not bad. Well, I got a second season. Long overdue. Long overdue. We've known you for a long time. Yeah. Thanks for admitting it. Thank yeah. you for admitting it. <laughs> it is true. There's, there's people, there, are, there, there are many funny people that we are friends with that we haven't had on the show, and it is, oh, I... And there's some that are like, there's even people, I will, I'll, I will say this, you've never asked to be on, which I also think is a good thing. Yeah. Uh, Imagine. <laughs> have you ever asked to be uh, invited to a wedding? No, yes. I didn't That's know that. Weird. I have heard of people doing this, and it is just so bizarre. Of just like, if you were meant to be invited, you would have gotten that piece of paper in the mail. That's a great point. <laughs> and, yeah. Yeah, you know, that's uh, a. I don't think you can do that. that. That's like, also what would be the reason? From my experience, because I, I'm not. How could you justify? It's almost a punishment. Yeah, exactly. So yes. Asking to. Didn't come to somebody's wedding. Happily <laughs> <laughs> asked. I don't know. Yeah. That's so, like, very funny. Things were moved around, like things, you know, like concessions were made, and then like they didn't, they didn't go. Um, I, God, I wish I had a little bit more of that in me. My brother came up to. <laughs> this was this was many years ago. I, I think I could tell the story, but he came up to stay with me uh, because he was going to a wedding near where where we live uh, the next day. Um, and uh, he came over and we hung out and uh, he got really drunk and then the next day he's like I'm not going that way <laughs> <laughs> I hope he still like gave a gift paid for his plate as it were that's what they say your gift should you know at minimum here's a gift that covers my Cover, you know, yeah. the plate, or, or as they say. No, no, and no, and Nate. Uh, I got drunk at my brother's place and I decided not to go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I haven't been to a wedding in a long time, oh, like a couple God, of years. I well, I guess <laughs> there was a time for some reason where not a lot of weddings <laughs> happen. I don't know. It's crazy. If you met him, uh, I haven't met him. I've heard yeah. obviously. Last wedding I went to was, <laughs> well, yeah. it wasn't yeah. lesbian yeah. themed yeah. because that's ridiculous, Catch but it was a lesbian wedding. It feels well, weird to say I went to a lesbian wedding because, again, show, it's, it's not, not like the theme was lesbian. It I, I was just a wedding this, in which two like women were getting married. Socially, is this correct? Was at Tiki Mirage with our buddy Farley Elliott. We yes, went to a Tiki right. bar, which we talked about the Dope Boys double with Farley. Uh, but that was that was a hoot. I had a great time. I had an absolutely great yeah, time. I feel like a Tiki I thought we were in transit, uh, but it Tiki turns bar out would be we fun. Stationary the entire time. Okay, yeah. I think I'm just gonna do sort of, uh, the back of a box you know, right. large so strokes of, of this, of, uh, and then we'll some, narrow like, it down. The accoutrements, like you know, little dangling uh, shell strings and like wind chimes and stuff that were swaying. What do I and have to we work with here? Do I have a ladder? That I straight up just thought this we little... were slowly driving around the streets of Santa Monica. <laughs> and when I found out we weren't moving, I had to kind of like take a night to be like, well, did I like this? <laughs> I don't oh, know wait, can I like why, but it, like, raise and lower it? It really sucked a lot of the magic out. I had such a good time. I was very conscious. I was a late ad. I'm a, I'm a late ad a lot. Uh, sure. Which this I is think. fucked up. Uh, I wasn't referring to you guys. Stop apologizing. Yeah, we're sorry. We're I sorry. really wasn't referring to that. 
I think it's a compliment. I think I it's like... We should have had Gillian earlier. She's fucking roasting us. I know. I... Hey, I, 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 I... Look. Uh, you... you. It was me who got you on here. <laughs> okay. The truth comes out. I, Nate would have asked sooner. <laughs> I, I get added to things late of like, oh, our actual close friends couldn't make it. And then... Or someone dropped. Who would be fun to ask? And luckily enough, sometimes it's me. And that... I didn't she know takes I it as a compliment. Until, like, Why, though? That day. Wow. So it was kind of a quick turnaround. Yeah. And that is also something. Also, I would probably never. I mean, I guess it means people are thinking of her, you know, no, just not, not right do. away. I'm usually, I would probably more likely be the person who fails, who someone else is going to. Thank you for that. I, yeah. I, I, my social calendar is simply booked cleaning up your messes. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, it was sort of like an intense thing, right? We had to like have cash. We had yes. to have a thing to. Uh, sacrifice to the gods. Or yeah, something. so, so it's, it's like an experiential thing. Like you were saying, it is a it is a parked uh, box truck, but you know there is the illusion of that perhaps you're in motion once you get on board. <laughs> and as part of it, you have to bring yeah, you, you you're, you're, there's payment. There's a you can tip in cash, and then also they want like an offering, some sort of like gift that you're going to give that they'll maybe oh, add to the tiki bar a future. Uh, and they make it clear like you're not getting this back. So it's no, like, yes. What is something I've both kept around but don't? want anymore right. like I, I'm, I'm pretty good at pairing my, my I recently down cleaned like, out, out my office and I have a bunch of like around. little knicky knackies like, that I can like, do like like I'm trying to uh, uh, that stressed me out that whole part of it I, yeah. I didn't like um, like it was like you have to give something that means the way I sort of framed yeah. it in my mind yeah. was like when we're doing my office here is less Funko more art Yes, so, basically, yeah. so I purged a lot of, uh, I believe you, gave a minion you know, I did. I gave them. I had a minion wearing a real plasticky skirt, uh, from stuff. The, the first Minions movie. And and it was pretty fitting. Uh, it was down between trying to find more, you know, dirty <laughs> stuff. They actually gave the more sentimental thing. Yeah, yeah. I may not know art, uh, but, I, but I know what I like. Sat next to me. It was just right. my like favorite how art. Walked into the box Same. truck, and it was like. Uh, singles. Like, the draw sucks on that one for you. <laughs> no, I felt bad because it was your friend group and then you had to sit next to me. We had a great time. I had a great time. <laughs> also, by the way, friend group. I, a little loose? I mean, yeah. I, mean, I don't know. Was that what? Was that was like one of our one of our few hangs last year outside of Doughboys, I would say. Hang out? Oh, we turned it into content too, so it was within yeah. Doughboys. We, it wasn't even a what, fucking. The intent wasn't to make it. Like, content but like i guess we, we turn every fucking thing into content yeah exactly i got a colonoscopy next week it's gonna think we're gonna content. talk about it it's gonna be content <laughs> i'm excited about it we'll see what we're happens live it. <laughs> i feel like that's been done before yeah. You're gonna do the didn't uh colbert yeah. <laughs> and like conan and is John Stewart, don't they all like I know from get colonoscopies and like throw anything away that came from your body? You have to sign for it. Oh, it's man. like one of the many signatures you will sign on the day. Is there a world where you can be like, let me see it? I would love to see it. If they cut something out like polyps, I guess are the only things that this is horrifying. <laughs> yeah, sure. Like I'm sorry, it never occurred to me. But that's, a, that's, I think it would be polyps or something. That uh, I think this must right? be an older crazy? episode or recorded yeah, old Papa John's Papa longer ago because I know we already had it. <laughs> I shoved it up my ass. <laughs> I didn't the corners. It, like, it went fine. Quick. He had a pull like up. I think that's what I was it. more thinking. Yeah, it's more of a whale scenario. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Just in case you were worried. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, to just like know what out of there, because other people in the room are gonna see it. Right. And you know what's, you know what's funny? Gone. The first time I did it, I the. I was awake when they put the camera up my ass. Oh, okay. Maybe they, um, maybe it's another one. My dad was in there. I totally made that dad joke of like, oh, he said he was full of shit. Yeah, he very funny. Like, Good job. He like loved it. <laughs> and he was so proud of it. And uh, it was wild to see a camera going up inside of your body. Uh, it was very it was I'm not very looking. I, I, I don't know if it's like universally true that every one like, like, has to do like, that at some point. There. Basically, look, but I know I'm getting to that age here, where Mario I'm supposed on? to have it's things like checked up stage. my butt. <laughs> but you're I'm supposed to have, have butt stage, checks. It's a, tough stage. it's a really tough stage. You get to the bonus worlds, it's, it's it's special. Special. and I have yet to have any butt-related checks, world. but yeah, yeah, yeah. I am it's not world looking world. forward to them. Uh, do you know of it? I've heard of it, yeah. I just hope I can, like, joke with the doctor. you get all 96 exits, you get a little star next to your save file. Somehow, like it, we, we don't take it too yeah. seriously. That's that's my hope. 
Nature's friend. This famous residence. Oh, Nautilus. Nautilus are cool. You can see how you you can see how it was for my sister who was having a high school party with her like friends and me being like, what happened? Like going downstairs and being so pissed off. Why did she delete that? Because it was a fucking dumb. He was like a like and he like just wanted to start a new file. Wanted to play himself and accidentally delete your file. That sucks. Fucking idiot. So it sounds like your sister didn't do it. My sister did, it was, but I mean, she's still responsible, she's responsible in a way, yeah. you know, she's responsible in a way. I haven't spoke to her since, so I don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, but, but it is, it is, it was very wild, and you, and, and you get, you get big, and there's no way around this, but you're, you fart the air out, basically. You're basically sure. like, like, they're like, you're just going to get the air out of you, you're just going to kind of fart it out of you, that's what happens. Uh-huh. And so, like, you just go in a bathroom, you're, like, laughing as you're, like, shooting air out of yourself. That's fine. I just felt so relaxed thinking about that. Like a medically induced fart. Yes. Yeah, right. I mean, it was. There was. Yeah, I guess that's a way to look at like, it. You're farting and sometimes shit is blowing out of you and you're just laughing. You, all you can do is laugh. Why? Well, yeah. You gotta laugh. You know what else is a, is a big fart? An artichoke. You guys artichoke eaters? I, gotta I do tell like you an artichoke. I don't know if I've I, ever I, had an artichoke. I mean, dip. Uh, like <laughs> Does that count? Me and Sus do walks. We do Los Feliz walks. Walk <laughs> Whenever I hear about Artichoke, it reminds me of uh, there's this Three Stooges uh, short. Would you call them shorts? I guess. Yeah, short. Where there's like a like a baby trying to eat an artichoke, or a toddler trying to eat an artichoke, and he's having a tough time of it. <laughs> I think he starts crying eventually. Because he's trying to like peel it and get to an edible part. It was sort of the original three men and a baby, really. On this fucking podcast. Sorry, no, let's talk specifically about little dogs in the Los Feliz neighborhood. Except something more universal on our chain restaurant podcast, Hillstone, a nationwide chain. No, let's keep it specific to little dogs. I'm sorry, Mitch. You ever get air blowing up your ass? Yeah. You ever drink the artichoke water after you boiled an artichoke at home? I actually haven't. The uh, Mitch and uh, Weiger. Sometimes get a little angry at each other. And those sometimes seem to me to be more and more frequent. And I do believe eventually they will end the podcast because of anger towards one another. And it just like called me like this. And if it wasn't TV, so I profitable like, to chug this. for them to do so, the they would have already stopped. <laughs> but I think, you know, <laughs> between the podcast and sponsors and probably the Patreon, they're probably making a good living. Let me tell you, I'm a diarrhea connoisseur. And it was, uh, <laughs> diarrhea I connoisseur. It, that's, that's two yeah, words right. that should not go together. It sounds like a. It sounds like it could be useful, like in some yes. ways. Uh, there are situations that come in handy. Yeah. Yeah. I've suggested it to backed up friends. I uh, uh, uh you're, I'm a, I am a backed up friend. I I uh, I got that <laughs> artichoke from Little Dom just this last week. Yeah. Um. Back on Little Dom. I, I just on the note of poop. Right. People would probably kill to be, to be as regular yeah. as I am. And they grill it up, and then they put a I'm like a poop every no day. Poop once a day. Poop like at the I same time every day, I mean, practically. It's a fat. No, it's a not universally 100% of the time, there? but pretty much. No dipping sauce. Wow, you just having it like That's that. Just, no, don't they have drawn oh. butter? So, you know, I got that going that for me, which butter. is nice. It's, it's, it's red wine vinegar and olive oil. There's no butter. I could have sworn it was butter. I know. And That's it's how nice good it to is. be at a restaurant and to be able to use your front bottom. Okay, so. Yeah. This is kind of not how I normally do. Like, I would normally focus on one area and get it done. But I figure with this thing, I do it a little differently. Try to get like using your front bottom teeth. They don't don't think about that. Yeah, they they don't. don't don't Like a a lot of the Uh just like obvious parts done, and then we can start pinpointing. Yeah. Oh yeah, I do like a dog with a big underbite though. Jimmy, can you show us your teeth? Love it. She's got green teeth. Does she really? <laughs> yeah, they're every t- every time they get checked, they, everyone says they look healthy and beautiful, and she can chew a perfectly straight line into her toy. Call her the wow. surgeon. What? <laughs> yeah. Good for you. <laughs> a good thing. The uh, surgical pup. Yeah. I'm not gonna stick my fingers in Jimmy's mouth, but she's I... never bitten any of uh, any people, but. 
be a first always. <laughs> There's always a first. <laughs> Uh, if she bit me, then I've never allowed her back on the podcast ever again. <laughs> she would never yeah, right. bite. She, she would never bite Uncle Mitch. People would be no, mad at you. Also, if she did bite you, she'd still be allowed, don't you think? Yeah, I think I'd be out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get rid of Mitch. Jimmy was right to bite Mitch. <laughs> uh, okay, so uh, you like me, you're from California. Yes, sir. And I'm curious, uh, you know, uh, growing up out here, growing up in L.A. County, do you have any childhood favorites? We're always going to talk about Amici in a second, but, like, are there any, uh, you know, like, chains where you're like, ah, that was a thing I, lo- I loved to get as a kid or I still love to get? Absolutely. We were a very healthy family, so me getting my license was, like, an explosion of fast food. We didn't really have too um, much of that, like that chains. Against my parents. My like mom worked at a restaurant, I know, so I know we just it's an did Italian this restaurant. As a bracket, but Taco Bell was so massive. Yes. I watched a friend of mine who was now a doctor. I lived in a town that was so small that, like, we didn't have a McDonald's when I was a kid. We, they were no longer serving cheese. What did we have? We had a Harvey's. Wow. Um, that's how much time it, do they have those in the States? In Harvey's? The Taco Bells. My car uh, in high school constantly had shredded lettuce. Uh, yeah. You know, classic. Whose yeah. car doesn't? Yeah. Whose yeah. car doesn't? Sure, They're different. Yeah. Like, uh, and then we had, than your typical uh, fast yeah, food. Oh, they, yeah, they always remind me of like if you go express. to a, like a express, summer barbecue. And we still uh, are lucky enough in Los Angeles get a to have one in Glendale. I've never done Panda That's Inn. kind it's of a Harvey's good. burger style, like and, a frozen uh, frozen yeah. patty. They have the same items. I went with a big group of friends. We ordered a bunch of stuff, and we all agreed it is more expensive. Sure. But it is a, and I love Panda Express for the record. Still a family-owned business. Still a family-owned business. You mm. get to learn a lot mm. about the the growth of the business on the Never back had of the Panda Express. Uh, it is a little more expensive, but it is a little better quality. Like it's exactly uh, Now I live in a small town where we have a I'm subway. Right. Oh no, and wait, we have a pizza hut. I now. literally have plans with Becca and Alyssa, two other writers from Twisted Metal, wow. to do a bang bang of Panda Express. Muck to bang, Panda in, I think she means. Night. I love it. And we will be ordering the exact same items, of course, to do a proper comparison. The Crab Rangoon. Bang Bang made famous by Louis C.K., correct or no? Oh. Um, you think it's Scott Ackerman? <laughs> <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang? Yeah, you, haven't you been? You've probably been on it. Louis? Yeah, yeah you've been on Louis C.K.'s yeah, yeah, yeah. Bang Bang. <laughs> <laughs> I've, been on, I've, been, I've, I've eaten with Louis. We've done Bang Bang. It, Still, we uh, like... Uh, we, I think they must I mean Muck Bang. Like, the, I split time between him and the Rogan crew. Yeah. yeah. Play. You guys all play cards. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They don't eat fun, but... Oh, the a Rogan crew? Bugger. No. Yeah. It's a bunch of Soylent drinkers. <laughs> That's the thing I've never been able to understand is, that I, and you know, I've, I've known people in the periphery who have d- you're, done you're Soylent. You're co-hosting another podcast. Yeah, you know what, I've, uh, has, has I did, I don't thought I did so. But for a while, while I, I had Soylent for lunches. It actually, I feel like it did help me lose some weight. This was in the before times. Performed improv uh, for hire. We do that all the time at different companies. Yeah. Um, lucrative. Extremely lucrative. <laughs> <laughs> Me quitting a full time job to do that was very smart. <laughs> <laughs> but I, it was at a some kind of like coding hive. Okay. Um, like they weren't a specific company. They were uh, like a group coding of coding hive for hire Ooh, for different like, like the apps board. that would come to them and stuff. And um, terrible improv. <laughs> Let me tell you that. But they were Soylent drinkers, so we were able, uh, I just felt comfortable just straight up afterward. There were like stacks of boxes of Soylent and just asked straight up like, why do you hurt yourself like this? Yeah. Like, why are you so sad? And the guy was like, <laughs> I forget to eat. Wow. So at the end of the day, yeah. when I realized I haven't eaten, which like, I've never gotten eaten in my life. No, I'm thinking about it first. I, uh, I'm I've planning my s- sometimes when like I record morning, long plays, like, uh, like certain games. Manner. Uh, I'm not as bad as I used to be, but like in my, probably in my teens and, and early 20s, there was definitely some like gaming sessions where, you know, you'd look up and, the, <laughs> and you six hours has passed and you, you haven't eaten or drank anything. I thought it was. Like, oh shit. It tasted as gray as it looks. I'm not as bad as I used to be. But I do still set a timer to have a sip of water. I have one of these shakes and it's my nutrients for the day. Wow. That sucks. Bummer. But he's really smart in other ways. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sounds like a dumbass. I, I, uh, <laughs> I, uh, I can't wait to not care. I'm gonna, once I'm on those, I'm not going to care about food anymore. It's going to happen soon, Lugs. You're going to go on the big O? Yeah. Hmm. yeah, yeah. 
I mean, I am curious about that, but I, I feel like I don't think I could do it until... Like, I feel like it's one of those things where we're going to find out, like, people who did a Zumpik or, like, you know, get this weird disease or cancer or something, I don't know. Breaking juice. Is this from Samoa Joe? So this will now, it's Samoa Joe. It's <laughs> okay. going to be some you know, um, unforeseen uh, consequences okay. that we're, we texting. don't know about. Yeah. Yeah. I, I wasn't texting. <laughs> I, was texting Drew, I was texting Samoa Joe. Drew yeah. McQueen texted me while I was texting Samoa Joe. Rumor that Taco Bell is going to get rid of the potato items. Oh Weird. my God, um, Betsy's going to lose it. Yeah, I don't love that. Betsy said, oh, you mean Judas is going to lose it? Judas, who turned her back on the fucking cheesy gordita crunch for the potato soft taco. So I don't know if you know this uh, controversy, Gilly. Why would you? But uh, for our live finale of Munch <laughs> Madness uh, 2024, um, uh, what the fuck Betsy is and Mono. Do Quiero Talk O Bell. Uh, Betsy and Mono uh, and me all voted for the uh, the spicy potato soft taco as uh, we voted it for it over the cheesy gordita crunch. Um, and uh, Mitch I mean, lost his shit. Jesus, how far was it? Thirty? Th was it thirty dollars? Pieces of silver. I mean, I don't think I don't think it was thirty dollars. Thirty yeah. US. <laughs> uh, I didn't know there was like a. a I don't think money that there maybe was. There was no. Yeah, yeah, I don't, there I don't was know. no. No money. He sold Jesus out. Uh -huh. Yeah, how does thirty what pieces of silver, there, right? Um, I, I would have voted with Mitch. Yeah. However, if we're talking Thank lifestyle, you. of course Betsy voted for the potato. Like it's it's a weekly order yeah I, I stand by my friend. if you're unfamiliar with betsy sadaro she's hilarious you made me really scared when i said bang bang and you said that louis ck invented it I'm like what else am i saying that louis, louis ck invented <laughs> <laughs> what about just out there just saying like you did come in singing it? uh <laughs> comedy bang the bang which is yeah. scott yeah. Ackman, which that, was used to and I guess <laughs> maybe still <laughs> does on a rare occasion play a game really called you would you rather you ate, you ate uh, half and I was a uh, frequent uh, in fact you know, according I, to Scott Augerman I was a would you rather superstar yeah that's a that's a quote I had a baker's dozen thinking uh, yeah, would you rather scenarios over the uh, years I gotta tell you this. used we on the show? Speaking of Taco Bell, so that's speaking fun. of Betsy, we had heard from Betsy that I think on the Taco Bell. Actually, oh, I, can bring up the, the, the I don't text. know. Um, like they kind of stopped playing it a little bit. I, and I don't know but if I sort of slowed down I'm submitting them. I want to be a part of it next time. Or putting a crunchy taco inside of a uncut. If I stopped nope, I want to be a part of that. Dude, submitting that them great. because they oh, stopped playing it. Uh, this was, uh, this was I'd Betsy's, like to think uh, that I stopped uh, submitting uh, and they just realized, eh, we can't really play anymore. Uh, you know. Uh, Mono already knows this, but last night at three in the morning, we're Gilly not getting any good submissions. <laughs> Taco Bell for three people. It was incredible. <laughs> she, also yeah. put, she also put Gilly in all caps, which. Um, yes, I did. There we go. Um, I tried so hard to be like, it's okay, I'm just gonna eat it for dinner the next day. Yeah. Um, I like to be fun. Yeah, that's fun. That's a fun thing to do. <laughs> yeah, it was really fun. And um, they were convinced, oh, this is Alyssa again. Uh, I made really good friends with my last uh, group of coworkers. It was really nice. Uh, we. What's that like? I, <laughs> <laughs> I think question. I wanted to impress her. Yeah. Like Betsy and I order and over order. Okay, no, and this isn't my That's way. something we already know about done. each other and it's lovely and I'm very happy with my living situation. But with a new friend, I was like, how, how do I seem cool? <laughs> um, yeah, I did that once during COVID too. Uh, a bunch of friends were, I'm sure we all attempted sad moments like this of like, let's have a hang tonight, but it's on Zoom. And me and my boyfriend at the time, and a bunch of friends were on Zoom together hanging out, and we all were, like, agreeing that it felt really good. Yeah. I think this was early Zoom, so it was, like, the fact that we could all see each other at once actually was novel and, like, important. And we were drinking as we were all hanging out separately, mm -hmm. and I, towards the end of the hang, started ordering Taco Bell, and I'm ordering things that the people on the screen would have wanted, but they were <laughs> never in my house. So, uh, and I'm like getting drunker and drunker to the point of like almost blacking out. And then everyone like turned their computers, like closed their computers, and it was just me and one other person. And I had ordered for like twelve, but it still <laughs> felt good. Right. Ordering as though my friends. Were uh, I think I've only that. done it. That's nice. I, uh, 
once that, or that twice I had, I had the hangouts zoom hangout people on zoom where we would block and it was fun until, what a time well, I, I think time. the trick was we played now, a game like we played a jackbox game like if you're just sitting there yeah, staring at each other i bet but all, like it was, it was strange because I do remember. Maybe it can be fun, but I, I feel like you need something <laughs> to do while you're. I do remember specifically like getting drunk on a video call and looking back. It's like that was far, that was a weird thing to do. It is weird. Yeah. yeah but yeah. I guess you're just trying to have anything approximating, you know, human contact. We were trying our best. A bunch of us uh, watched the Jumbo's Clown Room. Clown I our, sneezed. Uh, dancers would put on uh, pole shows. Oh, that's right. On Zoom. Yes. I saw one of those. <laughs> It was awesome. It was awesome. We got to see what their living rooms looked like. A wow. shocking rate. So of you cats. like some so like diagram of uh, talented, flexible women who can pole dance and cat owners is tight. How the hell was I not watching this fucking video? <laughs> it was so awesome. Cats and, and, and pole dancing. And it you could great. tip them. They would put Two their favorite thing. We were wow. tipping like crazy. And yeah, it was really smart. How'd you miss this? Krager was watching. <laughs> Gregor was on his mouse, clicking away. <laughs> uh, okay, I want to, because uh, since you mentioned, uh, yeah, yeah, since you mentioned uh, yeah, your your recent job, you mentioned writing. Um, I want to talk about uh, the, the, uh, the question I like to ask, which is, you're eating in the writer's room. Mm -hmm. That's a big thing. The like, twisted metal writer's room. Yeah, the room, twisted metal's writer's room specifically. Season she two, any... she knows all the things. She's got everything <laughs> in her head. Mitch is my little puppet. <laughs> <laughs> you know nothing, and I know everything, and you're gonna dance. Man, I can't even. Oh sh. <laughs> that wasn't a bit. No. <laughs> I was like, oh, I thought no. you were doing a bit. <laughs> I got a, I got a real sneeze can. That's Man, weird. Allergies. <laughs> the, the allergies got me. Is that weird that I sneezed and then you sneezed? I can only imagine what it is to put words to paper for. Seems a little weird. <laughs> Say okay, you know what? I'm gonna be honest. I pre-watched this and timed my sneeze to coincide with Mitch's what are your, sneeze. What are your, uh, all right, all right. Snacks and you what caught are you me. Hoping to get on a lunch order. Oh shit! So. Uh, <laughs> oh wow. I so we're taking this question seriously. Uh, on, uh, in a room at all that you can't order like you would on the weekend because right. that yeah. makes me want to go to sleep. Yeah. So it's not. <laughs> Like, I remember my first season of TV, I ordered, like, a ramen burger, which yeah. is, like, beef. Uh, I've always wanted to try one of those. That's, silly. That's an insane order <laughs> for a work a ramen, a ramen burger is wild. I love it. Someone else is paying. Yeah, sure. And it's, a, like, I maybe wouldn't order it normally, so here's my shot. I'm not... Looking yeah, for the salad I get that too. Like, now, it, when it's not your money, I'm, I'm more likely to and, experiment. Like, I, I hate that this is my answer. Yeah, yeah. I'm I know, furious. It's a but, uh, Which I'm I'm a, I'm a big I have, I have believer in, you know, food experimentation. Try everything Not once. If you don't like it, you don't have to have it again. But try it. That's like sure. totally different. One where you're sort of forced to be there, and one where you're lucky to be there. But it will happen in this episode. You'll fall asleep. I feel like it's rare too <laughs> that you're gonna and I also fall like, with my eyes totally open, hate and so, uh, what you wait, get. Really? Yes, I think I'm taking a big. It happens. And then I you know, one I thing the conversation that always and sounded so no good and kind of looked good, and then I tried it and really didn't like it. It was wow. uh, no way. <laughs> it's it's pretty wild. Um, I, can, I right. do also sometimes do the full like Mole. slow nodding. Yeah, I which that's gonna upset time, a lot of people. I realize. So I, I, to, like, really I just really didn't like it. So and it was at a like a family-owned uh, restaurant. So, yeah, it's just like a half like a sandwich authentic, and a salad is you know. the ideal. Yeah. Like we did Mendocino Farm. And lot, so I felt so bad that I like ate more of it than I had like a, wanted to. Yeah. And then I just kind of felt sick. And I remember the restaurant also. wasn't air conditioned and it was we summer and it was just so hot. Mendo was right next door, so we did it. And it was just a horrible experience. Oh, yeah. Everyone makes a fair share of Mendo. I think Mendo's gone down a little bit. Never liked it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's practical. It it's practical for me. I think the couscous is good. Yeah. It's one of my favorite flavors that they have. It's like the only flavor that they have. There, I said it. It's so mild. Yeah. The bon mi doesn't have pate. Okay, should I go underneath? Oh, yeah, no. And pate. I love pate, but I will say I do like that they they have like a vegan bon mi that you can get. That's nice. I you think don't want to eat maybe so I... Yeah. They got rid of the chicken prosciutto salad. Oh, I thought I had the salad. Right. They got yeah. rid of like a lot of their like... 
they, it feels like they're becoming more chain like, which I think they just are. That's my bad. I should have um, had this but, on the one side. But I was going to say this in the writer's room, in the week, you can do one or two sandwiches a week, right? Like, you can still do a sandwich. I, I'm always doing a sandwich, but it's got to be half a sandwich if I eat. I can, yeah. for dinner, I'm eating a whole sandwich and I feel good and fine. But I'm drifting off to Dreamland shortly after. Sure. <laughs> so, yeah, in the room, I, I sandwich even sleeping? if I get a whole sandwich. I only eat half and then I want something else. I'm not just going to stop there. Like, uh, maybe uh, wax go. Yes. will uh, turn yeah. any of their sandwiches into a salad. Yeah. And I don't want to, but I was doing that. And what I learned, the Audi Cornish, which is my favorite, uh, has like a sweet, salty butter in addition to a really nice ham and then sort of like dressed greens. They put the butter in the salad. A brick of butter, like what? I have, like the size <laughs> of my fist. Wow. Butter salad. And I have no problem with it. It's easy to remove. I've heard it. of butter it's chicken. Why not butter salad? Shredded yeah. cheddar, which is a little sad. You can't sit there and pick every piece off of the butter. And I did it once, and everyone like I showed it around. We all laughed, and it was like some new person probably just like thought I don't want to like skimp on the ingredients. So give her the butter. Ordered it several more times. Every time it came with a fist of butter like so, that's wild so much butter on a bed of lettuce they're really they're not they're not they're not thinking about it at all they're just like here's all the components of the sandwich we're just putting in the salad i think i think because they charge the same yeah fact, right. i think it's even yeah. up charge which is wild uh, you know what if they didn't do it people will compl would complain would yeah. complain right? I, I guess vegetables are expensive more greens more yeah. greens i love those greens but yeah that, I love all green. that's a great way to like hey we're hitting the flavor yeah um i have I had the audacity to get a full Italian sub as a lettuce wrap. Wow. <laughs> wow. And coworkers, <laughs> you know, in a writer's room, like, people can get up and leave for lunch, but if you like each other, a lot of times you just keep talking, except now it's not about work, it's about anything else. And so you're, like, making eye contact with all your coworkers, and they're having to watch me struggle through, like, a brick of Italian cold cuts uh, <laughs> between two big pieces of lettuce, and they dress it. That's what's important. I, I, I'm gonna love when I go back to my doctor and he's gonna be like, You've been eating salads? I'm gonna be like, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna be like, Is there big chunks of butter in the salad? I'm like, Yeah. Because you can't get the sandwich and take the bread off because then yeah. you're taking any sauce, any dressing, you're, that's just coming off. You gotta order it lettuce wrap so they put the sauce lettuce in wrap. between. Uh, <laughs> Mitch little, doesn't let us wrap. Don't, don't, Mitch. Don't do it. A uh, wax paper for our listeners not in LA <laughs> is a it, he does a lot of wrap. There's a few R. locations. R. Onions feta. I'm a freak. What I just ordered, it's called a Greek lettuce wrap. It's the lettuce wrap. <laughs> <laughs> I told you not to do it, Mitch. Then you did it. Now you feel bad. Yeah. <laughs> the lettuce wrap. All of their all of their oh, sandwiches. Saying, like, hey, good job on your lettuce wrap. <laughs> All of his sandwiches are named after NPR <laughs> personalities. So they've got, like, I'm looking at the menu, you know, the Ira Glass, that, fake the news. Lakshmi Singh, yeah, fake-ass fake news, <laughs> NPR, um, the Audi Cornish, which you mentioned, the Terry Gross. It's a little twee in that way, but they're good sandwiches. Agreed. Yeah. Very twee. They're good sandwiches. They're good. They're good. Yeah. Good. Uh, I, I, okay, I want to talk about... A, I mean, Terry Gross, uh, a, a, a great news reporter... <laughs> How much I know. Uh, um, but <laughs> I am unfamiliar. The, the, the gross in Don't it watch too much NPR. Yeah, you have to be. Like, Although I do uh, uh, watch every yeah. is not itself gross. Uh, NPR yeah. Tiny Desk concert. NPR names. I think you can get away. You with have gross. the pattern at that point. Yeah. Which uh, yeah. I, I would highly recommend doing because yeah, it's such a <laughs> wide <laughs> variety <Absolutely>. of music. <laughs> probably like a mishmash in um, one way. Like yeah. A, but you're going to hear things you've never heard before, the way, and then speaking, you're going to find out you like I mean, things you didn't think you liked. It's a fat salad. Yeah, it's a fat salad. Uh, I'm a Jersey Mike's fan. I've, I've, I, I'm a firm I, believer I in it. Food experimentation and music ex That's You know, what experimentation so for, uh, in general. Uh, food, uh, restaurant we're talking about. I was gonna say uh, this. Uh, music, you rugs, you name it. Lunch and being tired. It's exactly what we did today. We, 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 and, and, and not only that, but we had an appetizer of bread. We did. Box we and I ate like, a, like, ate like a loaf of bread before you came. We're really weighed down with carbs. Good. So yeah. that's what we're powering. Carbs and carbs. Hey, I didn't notice if that helped. I expected oh, this that? little from you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's always good I, I, like, when a guest like I gets into it and like starts making fun of them a little bit. 
they like it. The audience likes it. It's good to have. I feel like it shows that they're comfortable. Uh, it might just be because my love language is, you know, making fun of <laughs> or getting made fun of. I see. I probably shouldn't say that. By people who I love. <laughs> By people who I like. By people who I know. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's probably really good. Right. No, strangers do it. That might not hit quite the same. Yeah, maybe it would, depending on uh, if they're good at it or not. Shania Twain, I guess, just got uh, supposedly got a lot of work, and it's fine if she did, it's fine if she didn't. And she also dyed her hair pink, so the joke is like, yeah, we all know why you dyed your hair pink to distract from wrestling. Yeah, so, sure. Are you gonna like dye your ass hair pink? <laughs> <laughs> dye your ass hair? Dye my ass hair pink. <laughs> What's up with the ass? He's got pink pubes. I can see through his white pants. <laughs> she can read Shania Twain. Still can't see her he doesn't have a lot of pews. <laughs> Should I try and get a Brazilian bubble? BBO. That does impress me much. <laughs> 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 yes. 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 Um, I have always wondered what it's like to sit on. Like, what is the. Uh, I don't. I, you know, I keep hearing about them, but I don't really know, like, technically what it is. Is it literally just, like, lifting your butt cheeks up from their current position so they're higher? Or is it adding uh, volume as well? Yeah. You might have to get spread before you sit. Exactly. You cannot get a Brazilian butt lift. That you're, it would be disaster. You'd be getting stuck in the chairs and shit. You got a big <laughs> ass already. I do already have like a pretty healthy uh, ass. I don't get the Juicy fascination double, with the will. gigantic ass. I guess. Oh, I'm like, oh, Mitch, I can explain it to you. <laughs> <laughs> I have, um, no, I have a uh, Hank Hill butt. If you know, you know. Sure, but also, like, some of these Brazilian butt lifts, they're, they're gigantic. You don't want to go too extreme, yeah. but, I, but I, I don't feel like that's, like, you know, that no some people shame, are getting... No shame, no shame. People can do whatever they want no with their bodies, but I, I feel like a lot of times it's a procedure where you're maybe not even... No, like, if it's well done, you're not even noticing that it's, it's something surgical, you know? It's just like, oh, wow. There, there's more than we know. Is, is exactly, that. right. My ass looks like uh, like a like a Tyson's chicken, basically. It's like two big Tyson's chickens back there. <laughs> what, do you what does that mean? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> basically two whole chickens. <laughs> <laughs> looks okay. like shit back there. It doesn't look good. <laughs> okay, I'm well, that, I guess we'll I'm, I'm gonna get the colonoscopy. We'll see what happens from there. Do, what does it feel like to sit on your butt? <laughs> 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 I know that's hard to answer. No, it's a great question. Because you've only ever had your butt. Yeah. Right? I feel comfortable when I'm sitting down. I don't know your if your butt never hurts. Your back is always hurting more than your butt. It's my back more, yeah. But and my back, it, it usually, but that's usually pain for my lower body that's radiating up. Okay. Or you gotta get a fat back. <laughs> I gotta get a back lift, man. Brazilian back lift. Brazilian I have back lift. Butt, yeah. And sometimes if I'm sitting for too long, I'm like, this hurts. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I, I got a sore. I got a sore butt as well. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you, uh, yeah, what, uh, I do have that issue. Small to no butt you know, sitting you get, for a long time a will hurt. Yeah, Sounds like you're walking around with a couch. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we'll get into this more on the episode where Wager sits on me and I rank it. And All right. Like, uh, it's going to crush me. It'll be nice. I used to like use my leg muscles to help so that I wasn't sitting all the way on boys' laps. I didn't oh, want, because I was scared I, my, like, razor sharp. I don't know what this bone is that sort of would cut through your cheeks. Cox. You're just bringing back, oh, like, no. such a... It's going to say like coccyx, yeah, but... Yeah, the, 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 like, being aware of every moment of, like, someone sitting on my lap or I'm sitting on someone's lap. Yeah. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, I, I used to, like... It wasn't uh, so that they wouldn't feel my weight. It was so that I wouldn't cut them with my butt. Wow. That's... I, I, I had a very similar experience, like, when I would film stuff or something, and it would be like, this is, like, an old chair or something like <laughs> yeah. that, and I'm just, like... There's so much going through my legs to like hold me up without breaking something, yeah. you know. I remember on birthday boys like they they were like we like rented these cots. They're actually like old military cots, and I got in. I was like, went right through it. Thanks. Sucked. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Yeah, you break one thing and it's with you for life. That's yeah. Right. I don't That's think I've ever broken a chair, but I do or, or near, just that like sit. pay yeah, attention to like, hyper aware of weight capacities on chairs. Relaxed. 
Yeah. Right, uh, right. I'm 240 pounds. <laughs> now, I'm also 6'1". Uh, it's for you. And I've weighed you got that 240 pounds since you. high school. Um, uh, when did you first notice that But you still, yeah, but on. still. Right, well, first off, I don't, let's, just, let's, let's hold it on a huge ass. Dad bod <laughs> minus the pesky kids. I, think, I, I don't know. I think I have a... a, 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 a Dumper. Door, a, I got a bit of a dumper on me. Dumper. I'm not gonna, I'm not I mean, they say ass that, ass but ass. it it I'm doesn't like gonna, feel like he does. I wouldn't even necessarily say uh, like I have a good ass, but uh, yeah, I have a, I have a fairly sizable ass. Yeah. And I, but but part of that, that that's, that's probably not just, evens your weights weighs you out from the front to back if you catch my drift. <laughs> I think a little. I think there is a genetic component, but I also like I do you know I do some strength training. I'll do squats. You know, I'll do lower body work. So I think that's part of it too. And and part of that was also a response to back pain because I had to strengthen my lower body so that they had. Ride a bike. And they read a bike. Oh, yeah. Right. So I, I do. I do get my lower got body a dumper? stuff. My dad's gonna, my dad's gonna get an ass. What do you want from me? <laughs> <laughs> it's like my dad's ass. I'll talk about it. You've got your dad's ass. That's so nice. <laughs> it, looks like, it looks like you're wearing your dad's hat. Fucking clown ass, dad. Don't call my dad a clown. Also, we don't know when sequentially when this episode's gonna come out. Maybe uh, a very, a very old. It may be a callback. It may be coming in the future. <laughs> that, that one will come out first. Okay, got it. You can call back. I love your dad. It's great to hear. He's a good ass. Yeah. It's nice that you checked it out. Um, <laughs> I. Uh, <laughs> Can we, can we, oh, what were you going to say? I want to hear it. Uh, I, I was going to say that I was doing, like, uh, I was paying for a thing, and it was, like, trying to check if I wasn't a robot. And I was like, click these stairs. And I was like, this is, like, I'm the oh stair boy, guy. It feels yeah. like it's getting rubbed. I was like, which one of these are stairs? And I was like. The algorithm knew it was The algorithm you. fucking knew it was me, or some fucking listener runs the fucking <laughs> robot thing. Or you did your Google's your last Google Yeah, people make fun of Mitch stairs. because he has so they're like, okay, apparently an stairs. abundance of stairs in his home. <laughs> well, maybe we're thinking of putting a few more in. They make fun of me because I have stairs. Um, should I just go full <laughs> extension here? What are you, What's going on? <laughs> this is the issue. Um, what were you gonna say, Wax? I was gonna I was gonna bring something up, which uh, I uh, Susser was telling us beforehand. Uh, one of our mutual friends, who I won't dox. Uh, was asking Susser, yes, is, is the rumor funny. true that Mitch and Weiger aren't friends anymore and they just keep doing dope boys for the money? <laughs> <laughs> that we hate each other in real life? <laughs> and, the, and my answer to that is, we never were friends. <laughs> yeah, no, come on. <laughs> it's all a fiction. This is when were we ever friends? <laughs> Didn't that happen to the Jerky Boys? Like, wow. Yeah, I think they did. The jerky boys. Well, I don't know. Didn't they have a movie, yeah, too? I'm pretty sure they did. That's, there are no more. That's so sad to think of the jerky boys not being buds. I know. I know. I'm sorry to break the news. It's kind of sad to they think of these two like, are not friends, but I kind of don't... Well. <laughs> yeah, <sure>. Like, <laughs> we don't hate each other. they may have been joking when they just said that, but men? also, if you told me they weren't joking, I would believe you. The foundation of a successful podcast. <laughs> Does it make you feel good that people are thinking about you enough to just start a rumor about you? I guess so. He probably mm-hmm. doesn't like yeah. that as much. That's a way to look I mean, at it. As far as rumors go. Put a positive spin on it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Snopes is not going to deny this one. Okay, good. I mean, like, it's, it's like, what, yellow, you would say, on Snopes? Uh, sure, yeah. Yeah. Two Pinocchios. Yeah, what yeah, a fact. Yeah. I don't know what the gate, what the... We still like each other. We still We're like friends. each other. We are friends. The Doughboys are oh, friends. <laughs> and also, <laughs> that was like not convincing. Sort of, uh, if you get one hundred fifty dollars worth of Taco Bell again, bring in the closer. yeah. That sounds. That's all I, I will. I will invite you guys. But if I invite two more people, that means I have to get three hundred dollars worth of Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> the ratio has to remain the same. But I can do that. Yeah. Howdy ho, hosers! It's the oh. Spoon Man. That's right. Wait, I'm a hoser. The Spoon Man's up here. Oh, yeah, they just did a show in Toronto. And I'm going to announce that the Doughboys are live Sunday, September 29th at Toronto's Dan Forth Music Hall. Oh, coming to Toronto. It, but I'm going to announce it again. Get excited. I mean, I could we'll potentially go to it. Canadian but Tim Forth, I would have to go to Toronto. Guest, Stephanie Beatrice, it's like late Atlanta at Johnson. night. Wow. Plus, a surprise guest or two. There'll be at least one. Maybe. Or maybe none. But maybe one. I think one. Be there. Tickets at birdfuck.com. Uh, I did see on, I think it was Mitch's live as well. Instagram, What's up, maybe, it's where he boy, was with uh, one of the guys from Letter Kenny. That's right. You know, the I television program. So I wonder if God, they are now. 
for Six years, potentially a uh, surprise guest. I love my mattress. Wally and Irma love it. My family loves it. And it's because it's a Helix Sleep mattress. Helix Sleep is a premium mattress brand that provides tailored mattresses based on your unique sleep preferences. The Helix lineup includes 14 unique mattresses, including a collection of luxury models, a mattress for big and tall sleepers, and even a mattress made just for kids. So how will you know which Helix mattress. mattress works best for you and like your body? A, is it it's dimensionally? Take the Helix sleep quiz and find your perfect no, mattress make in under two minutes. Then, wow. it would, and your personalized mattress then it wouldn't fit right a bed door. frame. Free One of these charge. seagulls sounds... Um, sounds a lot like my uh, phone ring, phone ringer, uh, and it, I keep thinking my phone is going off. Uh, my uh, my ringtone, rather, is uh, what is the song? It's like the the whistling song from Kill Bill. It's been that since I was like a teenager, so I can't change it now. And, I was and also, I never have my ringer on, and, and I guess I do when I'm working. I went with the Lux because I want something that felt like a cloud. And I sleep on my stomach, I sleep on my side, and sometimes on my back. But you know what? The Moonlight Lux is perfect for me. It cradles me like a little angel on a cloud. That's right. I love my mattress. It's the truth. The next mattress I'm going to get is also going to be a Helix. I'm a Helix man for life. Don't want to take my word for it? Helix has been awarded the number one mattress pick by GQ and Wired Magazine. It is even recommended by multiple leading chiropractors and doctors of sleep medicine as a go-to solution for improving your sleep. And now Helix is offering up to 20 right, lower hall. all mattress Come on. orders and two free pillows. For our listeners, go to helixsleep.com slash doughboys. This is their best offer yet, and it won't last long. With Helix, better sleep starts now. Do it. Hey, do buddy, it, can it. you name every single subscription you have? I know I can't name all of mine. Doughboy's Patreon. Cable. <laughs> I know there's more. And I'm not alone. I just learned that over 74% of people have subscriptions they've forgotten about. With Rocket Money, yeah. I don't have to remember every subscription or worry about forgetting any because I can see them all laid out right in front of me. Kind of put the emphasis on laid a little That's actually not there. like how much uh, is this okay. service? Rocket Money is a personal finance app that helps find and cancel your unwanted subscriptions, monitors your spending, and helps lower your bills so you can grow your I don't savings. know, like I, I, I'm pretty good at keeping in track. One place and know exactly where your money is going. For any you don't want anymore, Rocket Money can help you cancel them with a few taps. Rocket Money's dashboard gives you a clear view of your expenses across all of but your I also accounts. Think, uh, you can easily create a personalized budget depending on the cost of Rocket Money. Spending on track. It See your monthly worth it. spending trends in each category to know exactly where your money is going. Get alerts if bills increase in price, there's unusual spending activity, or if you're close to going over budget. The new goals feature automatically saves money for you without you having to think about it. It's With funny your because you're you spending, spending money to money save money. House, build your savings. Rocket money Is the easy. money that Rocket you're going to, to negotiate lower bills for save you by up to 20 percent. They automatically scan your bills to find opportunities to save. Then you can ask uh, them to Going to be more you. than no whatever Rocket Money goes. Service. Rocket Money is over 5 million users and has saved a total of $500 million in canceled subscriptions saving members up to $740 a year when using all of the app's features. Wow. Stop wasting money on things you don't use. Cancel your unwanted subscriptions by going to rocketmoney.com. Oh, the colors are going to be a pain. No boys. We're talking to Michi Pizza and Pasta today. I want to ask generally what are your pizza preferences before we get into it. Uh, I am always an advocate for olive, mushroom, and garlic as the topping on top wow. of the cheese. Mm. And I don't That's have very bad. many friends I can order that with, yeah. so it was fun to really? get to order my own pizza. Like, I, I actually don't get to get it a lot because of compromise. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I'm making no, a lot a of good compromise combo. when I order pizza. Uh, you know, I like a meat lovers. Uh, and I do like uh, a non pizza pizza. Crust, but a not thick crust. I don't really know. Sure, yeah. I guess you know, I, I, I don't know necessarily uh, know what's like available. Do they have that in the U.S.? I'm not sure. So uh, it has one called a cheeseburger pizza, pizza, which is really good. I like a huge slice, but I don't like when it bends you like crispy over. A crispier slice. Or, or just, just, just a little thicker, maybe. Not crispy, but yeah. Th yeah, thicker, a little firmer. But again, I'm not talking about a thick crust. No. I guess I'm, I'm looking not for a, like... Not a pan. Not a pan. I'm looking for a lot of medium points here. I like a lot 
of cheese. I have traveled to Italy and I hated the fucking pizza. Wow. Come for mm. me, Italy. I went to Italy too and I did have some good pizza at one spot, but it is it's it's a toss up. Is basically. it not? If you're so... in it for the cheese, it's yeah. not an Italian pizza for me. Yeah. I yeah. Was studying abroad. Uh, I went to. UC I was Denver, unaware of the uh, the uh, lack of cheese on Italian pizza. And happened to have a lot that's of other. Is that the slugs? No, uh, that's, that's Santa, Cruz. Santa Cruz. Santa Cruz. Okay. Oh, yeah, Santa the, Santa Cruz. the banana slugs. I wish. But wait. The, the like gauchos. The gauchos. Right? Santa Cruz is way more laid back, right? It's like a very. Santa Barbara's also laid back. Very They're laid back. Beachy, hippie. Santa Cruz is a little crunchy, hippier, and Santa Barbara's a little more uh, like babes in bikinis, yeah. if I'm being honest. Yeah. Um, <laughs> look at me, look at me. I'm, a, I'm sitting here, a babe in a bikini. <laughs> but uh, it was this other girl from my school was also in Italy. We didn't know each other before. And she had her boyfriend, when he came to visit, bring a suitcase full of Hidden Valley. So that ranch. <laughs> ranch? So that she could have it in her purse when we went to a Italian oh, that's restaurant. that's very American. And I actually was in, <laughs> in, not quite embarrassed, but I was a little bit like, like, cool your jets. Emily. Sure, yeah. <laughs> cool your propellers. But now looking back, I'm like, I totally get where she was coming from. She wanted yeah. to enjoy the pizza, and this is what she needed to enjoy it. Wow. I really didn't think Italian pizza because I'm in it for the cheese specifically. They're so skimpy on the cheese. There's like a, there's probably a few places, yeah, because they, because they do a lot of um, margarita style Ooh, pizzas. Color. They do a lot of, but like. I had the, I had like the Italian kind of like square style. What is it, like a? Oh yeah, uh, I think Sicilian. It's, yeah, Sicilian. Thank you. It's, and they have like places you can just walk up, and it's called a tavolo caldo, like hot. Tavolo caldo. It's like point to how much you want them to cut off. Yeah, Whoa, yeah. that's very fun. Yeah. Like, very fun lunch. They do it at the Nancy Silverton place here too. The uh huh. What is it called? Mozza. Uh, no, not Mozza. The one. The, what's the one that's the. Uh, uh, no, the one that we're, this the Nancy Silverton one where you cut the, it's, it's in Silver Lake, uh, what? I feel like, uh, Italy would be a fun trip, I have but I have an Italian <laughs> aunt, too. Damn it. So she no. would probably we'll out. tell the ins and outs. I think she Triple still B. has family over there, too. I didn't know that was Nancy Silverton. That's Silverton, that's a Silverton yeah. joint. I don't ah. think it is, Mitch. I, I'm no, telling it is, I'm looking at it. Well, well, well. Oh, I'm gonna eat the microphone. I'm so sorry. Um, that's yeah, that's a fun pizza. Yeah, they, they, they cut off. We I love quarter sheets. I've been to quarter sheets multiple times. I love quarter sheets. Uh, quarter quarter sheets. sheets, triple beam. What's next? <laughs> Double plate? Double? <laughs> yeah. I you were going to car with that. <laughs> Did we swap bodies? <laughs> 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 That's Order funny because normally Mitch tells bad yeah. quote unquote what jokes. What's his name again? Like that. Craiger? Craiger, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, thank you, Craiger, for in, 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 in Emmer and Craiger and Emmer. I gotta thank both of them. Craiger didn't do shit. <laughs> yeah, I know. But <laughs> he didn't know it in the end. <laughs> I, look, uh, he, he almost remembered it, so that was helpful. Okay. So I guess uh, more so Emmer. <laughs> <laughs> Nope. Uh, Gregor, though, it was the I, first fi the game I finished got, cleaning something I there. I, was about that. I, had, I, I had something that was so hot. Wait, were you there for a semester in Italy? What happened? Yeah, uh, yeah I studied abroad for six months. Mm. So that was a long time I for studied a lot abroad. And, and <laughs> yeah. oh my god, privilege yeah. up like the wazoo. So cool to be there. A thousand. I, I really enjoyed this. Like, I was in Rome. Uh, so I guess that's specific too because they hmm. regionally. Did she do as the know, Romans Italy's do? One of those you think? Places where it's like we think of them as one country, but they think of themselves as their regions. Like yeah, a, sure. A Roman is like I'm Roman. They don't call themselves Italian. Like a All Sicilian's right. like I'm Sicilian. They don't say they're Italian. I have a question for you. Yeah. Your, your roommate wasn't Foxy Noxy, was it? <laughs> I was like the year before. Oh my God. Or the year after or something. Wow. I'm right around there. Yeah, we're we're about the same age. Wow. Foxy, Foxy Noxy. Yeah. Well, you don't remember that they called her she, Foxy Noxy? <laughs> I'm crazy it together now. She yes. and I both had a lot of sex and did a lot of cartwheels in Italy, but <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. I, didn't I don't know what they're referencing. One, and that's knowledge. disappointing to me. But, uh, yeah, I, I was like normally, I'm very good at references. And I, uh, got rid of my virginity like I was like getting my passport ready like I was <laughs> I like needed to shed it real quick to prepare for Italy Damn. so I was not so they really should have shipped my virgin ass over there <laughs> it sounds helpful they would have taken oh it was very difficult for the men it was like 
totally unequal on everyone's experience. Like women yeah. were getting like. Someone's finally saying it. <laughs> <laughs> it is difficult for the men. But I, I wasn't there for the cuisine. I also yeah, didn't sure. have money for it. So yeah. I hope to go back yes. one day yeah. and give Italy or Rome or any region its like a redemption arc. But yeah, that, that's what I look forward to. Do you guys ones. have pizza requirements or, oh, or nice. preferences? Okay, okay they're a little lenient on them. This is going to make me oh, seem like so much man. But when I went to private school, there was a trip wow, to Italy. Wow, that hour so went by quick. My first time in Italy was in ninth grade. And it was like, I think it was kind of, here's the bonus of sending you to a school where See, you that's my problem. yourself and want to jump like... off a building. And I was like, great. And I went, I mean, it wasn't, it was nice because I always want to go to Italy, but it was like a cheap school trip. Yeah, and it was like, we're eating and like, we're like, I think we had like a taste of wine or something and like, nice. you know, snuck some stuff like that. Yeah. But I think it was very like basic, all right, all right. but that's the crazy thing. And, and uh, you go anywhere and it's, and it can be really you know, you're good. playing these games and suddenly an hour has passed and you don't even... Hey. And uh, and I picked out. I was kind of the food guy in charge, and we went to we we. You don't even know Rome how it passed. And Florence, and, uh, that's my uh, issue. So, uh, Venice. I was gonna say what's okay. The, I think we're on? ready for yeah. glowy times. Venice. I retained a lot of stuff by going uh, over there. Um, you know what's? But Roma Spirita. Can you change the color of the glow? There's a lot of great restaurants that were like. These are some of the thing, best meals of my life. Pizza though was a little trickier, and we did find because a normally it's yellow, in Rome, and there's, I guess, a place right <laughs> yellowy next to the orange, Vatican, which is just so happens to be the color. I went to a really McDonald's good... right next to the Vatican. That's of fun. this, uh, I my first time having mayo with fries, and I really loved it. Yeah, I love that combo. Good really, combo. I just really like the idea of the Pope being like. Mm. Dirt like, that's fun. It's fun. It's fun. It is fun. Yeah. I don't know what it's that funny. is. It is. It is. It is funny. It's like, excuse me. I asked for the honey mustard. You gave me the hot mustard. <laughs> I thought he was gonna sound German because he is German. He, there is. There is. Oh uh, well, the current one is is. Uh, Susser and I were talking about the, about, right? oh, I'm, about I'm the popes. A yeah, we're thinking of working about Ratzenberger. There was like the Nazi pope. There was like all these. Like there were like. There was the Nazi Pope, there was the cool Pope, and then like the Nazi Pope isn't even the worst Pope. There's like a worse Pope before that. Yeah, there's there been the some two bad popes, popes, young Pope. Right. Uh, what was the other one? The Well, there's the new Pope. The young the pope, pope became the new Pope. Young yeah. Pope and new Pope. Yeah. Hot Pope. Yeah. Uh, but that's the TV show. But I think the but but I I think what Mitch uh, is doing is kind of like the generic. I'm like the it. president of the United States. <laughs> it's like a generic sort of like improv. Like I'm a, I'm a pope of Rome. Tank. You know, you're like like a, just like general Italian stereotype pope. Super size. Can you give yeah. me super? Oh, oh, oh I'm a Morgan Spurlock. Oh, you can ruin everything. Oh, Morgan Spurlock. I'm ruin everything. Recipes, Morgan Spurlock. Uh, what? Uh, I don't know. He, he's kind of a bad guy. We think we don't know, but rest in the peace. Morgan's the Morgan's for None the same. I need the one, the more nugget, but it's completely the collect. There we go. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable. We gave a lot of shit to Morgan Spurlock on the podcast. This is gonna be so dated. I know. I don't know I'm why sorry. you're insisting on doing this. I gotta get it off this. my chest. I feel because I I I know that he wasn't a you know, but I don't like when anyone dies when they die young. I feel he's bad very young about to it. Die. Yeah. And also, I want to be clear when I say. The Nazi Pope wasn't even the bad Pope. <laughs> we might have to edit some stuff around there. <laughs> Emory, let's just mark all of this for edits. Okay. Uh, okay, you asked me pizza preferences. Yeah. I've never crossed an ocean. I've never been to Italy. But I, ha I, I do, as far as pizza get, goes, get, what, what, we'll see. I, as far as pizza goes. What if, what if we transport you like Nosferatu or something? <laughs> In a big crate. <laughs> he doesn't like wooden travel. Hay. Which I <laughs> very much understand. In a ship. Okay, well. Yeah. We'll do you think a ship rats. would be uh, desirable? Uh, I don't know if I'd want to do a ship. It's going to be a big ship. Yeah, but I, I did. Take, like, two weeks that's the thing. It take, I mean, I don't I don't mind the, the duration of the journey. It's just like I get I do get seasick. I, I don't know. You don't even mind planes. It's just the fact that you don't want to go overseas. Uh, yeah. You don't have to. Yeah. Anyway, what I was going to say is the. As far as far as pizza is concerned, which yes. is the topic at hand, um, I think I'm kind of with you. Although I do really like a New York style pizza. I mean, if I, that, that's just like the best slices I've had have just been from like random spots in New York City. That's just like that's that's to me that's the apex of pizza. I've had, yes, I've had very good pizza. Uh, Mitch, so I, Comet Ping Pong, New York. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not there just for the pizza. And Comet Ping Pong. That's you got other stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I also went over to. Uh, I, I want to shout out yeah, Pizzeria Regina, which is like a, like that's like the, the platonic ideal of like a cheese pizza. And we got a cheese pizza today from Amici as you know, a baseline. You know how happy I was that when, when uh, 
when Regina was good when we went. Yeah, we had a great time. It's not always like, you know, there's <laughs> some chances that sometimes it's not going to be the best version of it. You go away, you come back. What am I missing on this thing? You left, it's, oh, God, terrifying, especially when you've been talking it up. Yes. Oh, well, man, the, we, wor the worst. That may be the case with, with, with Amici Pizza and Pasta, which I, I, I imagine is a place that you grew up with. Yes, so it was my sleepover pizza. Your sleepover pizza. Yes, more than Pizza Hut or Domino's because wow. at the time Amici's was the same price. Hmm. Yeah, um, it still is. I think. I mean, I didn't pay for it, but it's still because at this point you're getting Lucifer's pizza. You're spending a hundred bucks on two pizzas. Ooh. Yes, uh, it is. Down to three. A bummer. How, how much pizza costs? It's very expensive. Um, it's I don't great. know if it's... people know this, but stuff is expensive <laughs> these days. Uh, LA markup is bad too. Yes. I mean, like you're, if, you, if you if you get anything like robotic you get, like, arm fancier, you say. Easy, you're gonna pay you're paying a lot of money for it it's just is the way it is to the point where when people offer to pay and i i do the dividing in my head i'm like they're not good they ate two slices yeah and i'm gonna ask for 20 bucks yeah but yeah. if i'm really gonna break even here that's it's um, true. but amici's was yeah it was like the same as if we were to get domino's or pizza Hut, and amici's was just like that means we're at you know we got friends over ma'am and uh <laughs> also birthday parties of course Amici is closer, uh, uh, price-wise, it's closer to like a Pizza Hut or a Domino's or a Papa John's still, as opposed to uh, Lucifer's that we reviewed uh, on the podcast, and this, that's a more LA-specific chain, but that's like a little bit more of an upscale, uh, you know, but at a higher price point. I just want to say that, speaking of the Pope, Amici sounds like the Pope talking to me. Totally. <laughs> Amici, Amici. Yeah. Sounds, sounds like he's talking to me. Yeah. <laughs> he talks, he calls you the plural for friend. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah, man. Oh. Ah. Amici's, uh, Amici. uh, yeah, Amici is friends in a mixed sex group. How about that? Wow. Amici P Pizza and Pasta was founded in 1979. Uh, Nick Andrasano, uh, who is the son of Italian immigrants, uh, he opened a sit-down restaurant, similar to the Panda Inn, Panda Express thing. Um, and then in 1984, Nick partnered with Angelo Filato, and they opened Amici Pizza and Pasta as it currently stands, which is the more um, casual sort of takeout concept. Uh, and has 40 locations across California. I've had Amici I'm before. I'm to move on to the... So I, don't, I, I, I mentioned like, this last time. But I, like, I don't like the vehicles as much as I like the... Uh, that would that so be happening? Yeah, we'd all go come running to sit around the... <laughs> or the front door. The front like, door. You know, uh, scenes. Yeah. It's Rossi. <laughs> and Il Chandler. Uh, uh, hey, there's a slice missing from my pizza. Mm -hmm. oh, we were on a break. Uh, <laughs> um, it's, uh, if my name was Angelo, I would just like license my name out of like yeah. start a pizza company with me everybody right. Right. just put my we did name it. on it i'm happy to do we it, did it. Angelo is a great. Angelo this one i bet she's uh, gonna be fun i didn't realize it was 40 but i knew it was a lot yeah and uh what i like yeah. is on the website how you doing wishy like, washers you know, locations yeah. hours menu how dare you tab for if you want to own a franchise Fra they are pushing the franchising <laughs> and i actually yeah. have a, i captured a little bit of text from here because they're franchising faq uh the fact clearly is using AI text. Let me read this paragraph. Oh, man, Amici. Amici, the W-A-G-A. Maybe it was a in America have translation the from Italian. Food technology and the advent of the two-member working family. The recent trends show that outside eating, especially fast food and outside food preparedness, will continue to increase because of increasing time constraints and overall economics. Oh, what? Salad. Women in the workforce yeah, yeah. pizza. All right, I like to get a layout first. <laughs> <laughs> Amici, let Weiger write up your fucking thing. Come on, your let I'll Weiger it do out. it. Second, <laughs> that is so bizarre and absolutely unnecessary. Totally <laughs> like, strange. None of that information makes you go like, you know what? I will right. invest in yeah. this franchise. I mean, yeah. What is that? Is that their? It's not their mission statement. It's not their franchise. Right. Oh this my is, god. As you were saying, they, <laughs> this place they are, is they are, huge. They are, they are trying to expand this place. Trying to get you people to buy franchises. Them? There's forty of them. Yeah. Okay. So part of it is like, hey, if you want to have your own need a you want to open so one in wherever, you want to open one in Culver City, uh, put, get together the franchising fee, and, and there you go. Oh, There's my God. <laughs> oh, my Pope's Jesus. Pope's <laughs> would you? Would that be like um, an um, exciting thing for you to find, to find out that you like inherited okay. a franchise? Okay, I think I might start in here. Honestly, it's, it's, gonna, be it's the most fiddly It would bit. be stressful. I would have nothing to do with it. And then the rest <laughs> um, is like... I would, I would, 
if I inherited it, I would do you know, whatever I had to do. Like a hallway like this is kind of fun. Get out of it. Got just it. like smooth so surfaces. We're not looking to get in the biz. I'm just imagine. As soon as you said it was stressful, I just imagined you with like a pizza and then this is not too hard. And then we'll end up the front door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got the cats too. It's gonna be, you know, it's it's. Well, you're not bring the cats to the pizza. Yeah, we'll end up the front door. Okay. That's pie. That you know they make biscuits. Because then you know we got all these things. That would be really cute. To end with, which have fish in them. Which would be fun. Ratatouille, two, Ratatouille. Cool. A shave or a big hairnet. That's All right. Funny. A cat just in a hairnet. That's like a, that's like a dis, that is like a Disney. Wow, cat. this is huge. This is. I feel like this is the biggest <laughs> thing I've ever cleaned. Uh, I, I'll say this. I've never. I don't think I've ever had a Michi. Hmm. When I, like we said, I was. You like, had it today. I had it today. Okay. But I was. I, I was eating it in there. I, I when I saw it when I saw the box, I was like, oh yeah, this looks familiar. And I was looking at the website and I was like, the website needs to be updated for sure. It is frozen in time it's frozen in like time which years. i kind of love but i do way. like that it's charming um but i was like have i ever it's had like a this 90s I'm website not that familiar with it if i had it's a california chain correct it's only california. Yeah. <coughs> i always picture the famous um, uh i was looking at it, i was like there, space like jam website local, when i picture like really old uh, remember, websites was it louise's tr uh, trattoria yes yes yeah. yes, yes yeah. There's which like i feel like it's like the california pasta pizza chains i've tried what do they call it the platonic ideal of right. old pizza, websites like, uh, the space like, jam website the beverly pizza place whatever uh there's like a couple pizza places oh you mean like the the um i know what you're talking about oh craiger will pretend to know it yeah <laughs> <laughs> craiger help me out here what is what the fuck was i know mulberry you're talking about mulberry street yes mulberry street so like uh, like i had good pizza in la and mulberry street's good that's and it's good. A, like a beverly hills it was like $25 back like in 2007. So I'm sure that it's like $50 per pizza now. Um, but Mulberry. seeing this, I was like, we're in for some bad pizza. <laughs> Let me tell you, I had a blast with almost everything I ate except for one. There was one entree that it was I thought was bad, but everything else I was like, this is like the perfect mid of middle of the road if i was like at some sort of like <laughs> the perfect mid pizza shit, and there was this pizza was here i would be like happy it's it, it i i was weirdly impressed by amici way more than i ever thought i would be interesting wow. uh, amici I, doesn't impress any, me amici doesn't impress anybody <laughs> this amici i was i was i was i was fucking shocked uh, i i have Mitch. had amici before amici i would never have thought to review it because i would never conceive that it could be a chain of this size because like oh yeah there's like gotta be like three of them in la or whatever but no, I had no idea that it, that it was this big. Uh, and, but when I've ordered from it, it's like, oh, I got a door hang flyer that has like a 50% off coupon. All right, yes. sure, I'll get it for that reason. And I've always thought it's fine. Like I, I've never <laughs> been, I would never fine. thought it was an exciting place. There were there, I thought there were already so many, there were so many pizza options that were readily accessible that I thought were superior. Honestly, probably rather have Domino's most of the time. Um, but it was interesting to, re to revisit it here. And I revisited it with an open mind. And uh, I talked about getting cheese pizza as a baseline, which we did. Sounds like you liked that cheese pizza. I loved it. You loved it. I think loved that it. for what it is, I think that it is like, it's like, if I uh -oh. went to, I like think I there's going to be a disagreement sort of fucking, here. Ugh, some sort of comedy bullshit meeting that we don't even do anymore. Like whatever. There was a writer's, our sketch group had a writer's meeting. We're starting a new sketch group. There's a writer's meeting and a meat sure. pizza was on the table. I would be, I would be happy. I, I, it was that sort of thing where I was like, I love Domino's, but like we said before, Domino's is different than pizza. If yeah. you're craving Domino's, you're craving Domino's. Exactly. If you're craving pizza, you're craving pizza. And this is like <laughs> such a kind yeah, of... Yeah, like I have heard him say that, and I have pizza, heard guests agree with that. that. Really Actually, well I think done. That, yeah, the like missus is a, it was a nice Domino's a fan. Slice, like you were saying. It had, it's had some weight to it. A little bready, a little carby, but I thought there was a I nice don't know how, sauce, like, you can't there, necessarily like, compare. It's not a pizza that's going to blow you away. You're not going to think that this I mean, in some cases, great, you probably can, but you can't necessarily I've compare. I've had so much worse pizza. Uh, and, and, uh, like, I've got together with people. American chains and Canadian people, uh, chains. Because I, I know like, a slice of probably the, the best, for that. example, is uh, A&W in the, in the U.S. is supposed good. to be not very good. But in Canada, it's, like, actually really good. Cheese bites were good. I... There was a lot of things I liked. I thought the cheese bites were... Uh, Except for their onion rings. They were for fun. Uh, and also, I didn't like that... They are clearly, very bad. So I'm expecting more of a tot, even though yeah. the description takes great pains to make it sound like something other than a tot. It said it was like a cheese potato blend. So so here's the thing. They called it the cheese munchers on the menu. That's munchers on the website. Munchers a fun word. <laughs> munchers now, is a fun munchers. word. I don't know why they want to take that word away from us. Yeah. 
can't say muncher anymore. I know, you can't say muncher. They're trying to We're take so- muncher away from us now. I'll say it on the podcast, muncher. Muncher. <laughs> muncher. Okay, wait, tomorrow I'll do you, or when this goes up. We're sorry it's for only saying your muncher. Career. <laughs> <laughs> Should never have used that word. That's you, but me, I'm on Rogan. I'm like, yeah, I still say muncher all the time. I love it. Rogan's- <laughs> not a comedy special? Yeah. <laughs> Totally unprepared for it. He doesn't have any material. It's like 95% is about muncher. muncher. What is muncher? We don't really know. Cheese munchers. So this is the thing. It, on the website, it says cheese munchers. Um, uh, the online ordering is pretty wonky. Mm. Amelia uh, went to the trouble of the calling. Uh, God bless her. And she asked about the cheese munchers. They, we don't have cheese munchers. You mean we like have... Chalamet wonky or? or... <laughs> you mean like, Wong, like Willy wonky. Wonka? <laughs> Yeah, I, I mean, like, said, well, oh. go on the journey for a minute, why don't you? For God's sakes. The journey. <laughs> Just trying to parse what you're saying. So, suspension of disbelief. Just, just <laughs> disbelief it. on how bad Just that joke was. Me. What a reach it was. A world of pure imagination. I did it, Ma. Oh, I forget what his, what Chalamet's Wonka line was. Wasn't, wasn't it like... I'm doing it for you, Ma. Wasn't there some sort of thing with this Yeah, mom? I think what? at the end of the movie is like, I did it, Ma. This was all for you, Ma. Ma he said that in the, 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 the movie? Um, okay, I don't so think we, I'll be seeing that. Uh, they said there are no I don't, did I see here. the Johnny like, Depp yes, one? Like, if I did, I don't remember it. But why would you... Uh, they called those cheese tots. Those were not... Tots. Because when I say cheese tots, I'm thinking the tater oh, tots with cheese Mark's on them. That's not what we received. Uh, we something I've heard over and over again, which makes total sense to me, and I don't know why it's not a uh, thing. Is why do people remake good oh, really? movies? They're like and Chocolate Factory. Why don't they take bad movies and remake them better? If they take good movies and make them worse, it seems like not smart. I thought we were going to get something closer to that, or I honestly thought what we were going to get was more of like an integrated uh, potato slash cheese sort of, you know, hybrid. That's what they were, weren't they? No, it no. Was, it was, there was no, uh, like, I thought the same thing. And when I've had those, you could still feel, so tots are almost like the particle board of potato. Yeah, sure. And <laughs> Are you leaving? <laughs> Mitch got up. I'm sorry I pissed you off. I'm so sorry I pissed you off. I was with you on the Wonka thing, bro. All right, Mitch is leaving the room. Not because of you specifically. Okay, uh, bye, Mitch. Shit. Should I keep talking about potatoes? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he's uh, no, pooping. He can't he... see him close the curtains. We close the curtains so we can't see where he's going. Is he mad because he liked the munchers so much? Or I the not munchers? The, I think uh, he left over his <laughs> she went the opposite way of the kitchen, I think. I legit don't know what just happened. Mitch just walked out of the studio. <laughs> it was kind of a bit, but then I was like, is this not a bit? It's this a is what always bit. happens. I finally get the thing. I get to come on the thing that I've been waiting for, and it all falls apart the moment I get here. He'll oh, be back because right. he left his phone. He got he it. Got okay. He got it. All right, I he got went and got them. He got the munchers. We're going to investigate the munchers. But oh. here, here's what I was really upset about <laughs> okay. with the munchers. They were clearly in a mold, and there's a little crust around them. I got this, too. Oh, yeah, and we, uh, Mitch also got some cheesecake. I don't know if you... I got a slice of cheesecake while I was out. <laughs> <laughs> while I was gone one. for a minute. They Like, did you feel this, too? They are, there's a little, like, uh, edge on them. Yes. That, to me, it's like what you see sometimes. There's, like, a fun dessert at a lot of Thai places that are made in a little mold, like a, like a waffle iron. Right, and right. That is so weird to me. It has, like, a little, like, spaceship halo around it. That is just like a crust for no Are you reason. Looking for potato in there. These, this, it is potato. This is potato and cheese. It is potato and cheese. I just want to say that. That's not just the cheese that's been kind of, uh, you know, it's congealed. A little. It's, 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 it's congealed a little bit, but that is, it is potato and cheese in here. <laughs> so we, let me taste one. Can we, yeah. give, me, give me half of that bad boy. Let's, let's, let's just throw one to Gilly too. I mean, they're you cold. They are, that. They've been in the fridge, just so you know. There you Thank go. Thank you. Tried to not touch it very much, and then in turn just touched it so much. Yeah, all right. <laughs> no, I would. Have. It's minimally potato way. This is insane. I actually like a better cold. It is a little better. Wow. Cold. I had. I thought the munchers. I thought they did a good job with the munchers. You're not supposed to call them that. Fuck. You're gonna get a call from Angelo. <laughs> Angelo <laughs> Amici. Um, I. I like that a lot better. Cold. It is better cold. Weirdly. I I liked them. I I, I knew what the, I knew it was coming though. There was there, 
The mozzarella was like mozzarella. It was like a mozzarella brick, wasn't it? Yeah, it was like, I actually it was, thought that was cool. <laughs> yeah, me too. A fun, like Why? sometimes just changing the shape of a food. All right. So, so we could have gotten it. You could have oh. had your input to the order. I'll say this. I, I um, said my input to the order. Yeah, which was get an Italian salad. That's what you wanted. Wait, you, you, you put out, an, he put out a list of food. I was just looking at the menu. I was like, hey, there's I, some big things that we, we can get. And you know what? what I, thought, I, I saw cheese munchers. I'm about to make I, I, I thought you knocked it out of the park. Thank you. <laughs> and I just, I was the one who said, how about a salad? Which is, nor that's not, it's usually the other way around. Yeah. But you listen to all the things. I thought that there was like, there was like a, an Italian sausage sub, which maybe would have been, but you're not eating pork. So. Yeah. And I'm not sure. I think the meatballs were beef meatballs, so yeah. I think you were fine. But there were a couple subs that looked interesting, but I thought that the order you put down was great. A cheese pizza, classic cheese pizza as a baseline. Mm -hmm. You were getting kind of a, a different, interesting pizza. You got a I cauliflower got crust with cheese, garlic, mushrooms, and black olives. Crust. I've had that once or twice. I got my standard taco combo, bad. not my standard below combo. Uh, I, do, I don't normally get cauliflower crust, but I think we're making headway, and I wanted to try it. I also... I am pre-diabetic, which is the most boring thing to talk about. I wish I didn't say it just now. I hate that I said it. I'm well, so sorry. Welcome it's to our world. So boring. Um, what, being boring? Oh, no, no, being pre-diabetic and oh, boring. And I mean, boring. Yes, yes. 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 Um, but, uh, so, yeah, so I was like, <laughs> yeah, what does that mean exactly? Uh, as, as we're doing this podcast, and I thought it was quite Like, if, if you're pre-diabetic, it means who that? Who's, uh, if you continue... Uh, so yes, Anya, you know, Anya the Wire Queen, eating uh, and uh, your, she uh, liked your the eating habits the way that like, they currently are. Yeah, you will become it. diabetic. She really, she really she seemed to enthusiastically no. endorse it. Is it and, and is it inevitable no. that, no. that if you're well, pre-diabetic, like you will become diabetic? Like uh, if you like stale chips, like I do, I, I'll <laughs> open a bag <laughs> and chips. walk away for a month. I just ate some chips, some tortilla chips, that like could bend if I tried to. Like, I couldn't get that, actually. I, I, <laughs> like you're losing stale. me slightly, I really like but I, 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 yeah. I can get a little bit stale. I, I thought that this pizza was very well done. Um, like, this is like stale. Almost, almost um, the regular pizza, the regular crust. Like, I thought your, yours was like, sour keys. Yours was yeah, oh, yeah. yes, yes, yes. And, and I think you have to. With yeah. That. We're like crust. Sour like, Patch Kids. Likes those. Yeah. Yeah. I was impressed. It was a cauliflower crust. I was eating it. I was like, I don't taste cauliflower that much. Mm -hmm. I thought they did a good job. I was yeah. overall. I was surprised that you guys didn't like this. The thing to me which was bad was the fettuccine alfredo. Fettuccine I alfredo, I thought tasted putrid. I just, yeah. I did, I, I don't know I, about putrid. I thought, it it, I thought it was gross. I did not like it. It just didn't taste like almost anything. Yeah. It was like kind of, so that made it gross. That yeah, I've never had like good that is constantly fast food with pasta. Fettuccine alfredo. I hate when you eat like a fried food or uh, an I will alfredo. say I've never had Jolly Bee, which, you know, it's supposed like to be good. Nothing. Yeah. yeah. Like it literally just needs maybe more salt or something. Like, have you ever had a good fettuccine? I have not. I've had good <laughs> fettuccine, but not a fettuccine alfredo is not my favorite. We basically got it because there I weren't like a lot of options that weren't red sauces, and everything else we're getting was tomato we sauce. We said that so or chicken alfredo. I thought it was fettuccine. a great order. Did you pull the? Did you? Did you? Did you pull the trigger on fettuccine alfredo? Is that? Yeah, because we already had the buffalo wings. So I was like, okay, we're trying some chicken. Yeah. Where, 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 a, where did you do this? Is this a secret side chain with Amelia? Where was it? No, we just decided we're talking in person. We're waiting for oh. you to get here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Now it's because I was late. We had to get the order together. I did want to try the mozzarella sticks because I think something flat like that, it, instead of it being like a finger, it was like a credit card. <laughs> yeah, sure. Like, I, I always get the impression that Mitch is basically yeah. always uh, late. That, like, hitting your tongue that uh, way, but then really also nice. doesn't but like being called out for it. Pizza, and the way to avoid not being called out for always being late all, is don't always be late. And I cannot do a personal pan. I think personal pan I don't, pizzas, I don't like it, no, I agree. It ruins, uh, yeah. it I'm, uh, so much more crust you know, to my brain will not allow me to be late. It's I'm such a, a sad, like, if you're not, table, you're like, I'm getting six bites that isn't crust here. Yeah. So thank you for letting me get a good one back in the day. If you're not early, you can, look, if you're not early, you're it's late like guy. It's like walking into factory. <laughs> right. You thank Ma, and then you have as many as any, you can have anything you want. Okay. All right. Thanks, Ma, for I helping me, Willy Wonky, achieve my dream. Oh, back to the wonky thing. <laughs> it's really funny when he does it. <laughs> uh, we were happy that you got your own pie because we also wanted to try some stuff. I thought the meatball sub was a good choice to try the meatballs. Yeah. Uh, Would the whale have approved? We weren't watching porno while we were eating it, so yeah. I feel like he probably would have been a little upset that we didn't have some porno on. <laughs> I don't know why right. they whale mentioned the whale so often. Whale loves watching porno and eating meatballs. So. Jacking off. Have you seen the whale? That's cute for him. 
I miss the whale. Okay, uh, well, the whale, it's like, it's like he's just, yeah, he likes to watch laps. It's, it's an okay. Movie. He, he, like, beats off and then. I mean, Brendan Fraser, it was nice to see him back. He has, then he has a heart, a heart attack. attack. Yeah. And then he's like, read my daughter's essay. And then the guy, someone reads read his, his daughter's, daughter's essay. essay about Moby Dick. And then also he floats no, at it. one point. He floats, he floats at the end. I yeah. don't like pointing out when people miss speak but yeah. you just said he watches laptop on his porno, porno. <laughs> yeah. he watches porno on his laptop yeah i was like maybe you know like for his thing is he works on a porn set and it's just a bunch of like, <laughs> it's he's just, numb to it so he's just looking at his, he's buried in his laptop yeah. he's looking at a google sheet while yeah. everyone's doing the porno you can't let the whale on a porno set he would not be able no to he would not be he'd have a heart attack <laughs> yeah I'm his heart, heart attacks are a big part of the movie yeah. anyway I think the whale actually would have approved of the meatball sub. I thought the meatball sub was good. I thought it was good. It was good. Uh, I, 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 I'm surprised that everyone. I, <laughs> okay. I ordered this. I ordered the Let me just preface and I, this I, with. I, I only eat Italian out, dressing. you know, like, once I, a week. I have a complaint here because yeah. they didn't have the Twice as unusual. The zero was times as unusual. I don't know if you guys had it. Tried it once at all. Is, it was like once is average. Very oily. Uh, I did have a really meatball sub from somewhere this week. The problem with those dressings is it comes in a little to-go container, and you're seeing all these uh, like Let me tell you my default and, subway order you know, on that note. Yeah. Twelve-inch yeah. meatball, yeah. Right. Italian herb and cheese, like toasted. And a pour, I with of course cheese on it and then for the toppings i go red onion right. so black olive green olive black pepper Ooh, you're done. No, I remember this. Um, Amici's? This was Amici's, yeah. This is Amici's. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, but yeah, if, like, if you could put the lid on and give it a good shake, but like that's risky that it's just going to come flying off. I feel like yeah. no one takes the time to do that. So you could see the going... herbs and spices in there, though. The kernel, yeah. kernel would approve. It looked good. At least 12, <laughs> and I don't think it's a secret, but it's you need to stir it before you pour it. Yes. And no one's taking the time to do that. So you're just doing pure oil. Yeah, no it was a lot, a lot of oil was coming out. Stir, stir it before you pour it. I like that. Mm. It's always better with the dressings. It just, there was too much in that container, like you were saying. I got a bit of the, I got the herbs and stuff like that. Yeah. It still was just kind of a weak, it was a weak dressing. And the salad, though, I'll say this. That salad. You think about Domino's. You think about any other place. I mean, Domino's, I don't know, you can maybe get a salad, right? But oh, like, yeah. You can. But I'm just like. That salad was comparatively. That looked like a good salad. It was a good salad. It's it looked interesting. Like you didn't try it. <laughs> you I, I, looked I, like. Bragging about how you ordered it. <laughs> I ate the cheese I off the top it of it. <laughs> I, I, I yeah, that, that's I what I thought. It, was was it, it looked like it, a it good salad. Well. I there didn't some, touch some, any uh, of it because uh, it was gross salad. Garbanzo. Yeah, things like garbanzo beans and like some Roma tomatoes. I mean, I was not impressed by the salad. I, I guess I just like I feel like there's you can get you can get a good salad so many places and I guess like it's like this kind of pizza place just has to have a salad that's the expectation that we're gonna have an Italian salad we're gonna have a Greek salad we're gonna have some but I I, I was just like this is this is not a thing I would ever I'd be, see fit to order in fact I feel like I have better luck having a, a you know a, a bag of greens from the grocery store you know what I mean like I, I don't know if I, I mean, need to pay fifteen dollars for this for a for you know no I'm in, I'm in a fine mood I'm just trying to evaluate this place and I, I think like the Italian salad and the fettuccine alfredo are the Grumpus. kind of things where you look at this place and it is like its website kind of frozen in time uh, the world has kind of passed it by in that regard you can get better pizza better pasta you can get better salads a lot of places now and so what's just kind of offered as a toss on at a pizza parlor it isn't really you know up to up to par anymore you do sound mad. I, I'm, I'm pretty mad. <laughs> I did like the salad, and it's yeah. for exactly the reason why you said it met yes. expectations. Sure. Growing up at my pizza party, whatever slumber party I'm talking about, my mom would have had a grocery bag salad kit. All she right, would not we're doing it. We're doing salad it. Salad from the pizza sure, place. Yeah. I don't think that was out. I think that was out of uh, frugality. Sure. Is there going to be a like, shark? Like the salad. Yes. A baby shark? To me, this was. Is there going to be an octopus? Is there going to be a whale? Yep. Uh, the tomato wasn't mushy. I never do the Greek salad, even though I love a Greek salad, because I don't uh, The want Mrs. and I, have probably a couple of years ago, cucumber. went to That's the Ripley's food, Aquarium in Toronto. Yeah, yeah. A lot and of fun. Would definitely recommend like, going at least one. Freshness. Well, yeah. going and once. I just thought it was like ton but of also cheese. very expensive. I think it was like $40, for a person. Through line, through the like two items. Fish ain't cheap. I love a performative amount of salad next to two to three slices of pizza. I think it is like perfect. Mm. I'm with you. I'm with you 100 percent You're a grumpus. You're no, dressed no, no, up. No, I'm not being grumpus. You dress up all salad. happy. If I if yeah, I'm it's at, not a good salad. if I'm in the writer's room and I ordered that for lunch, I'm so bummed. That would be a horrible meal. And that's yeah. 
soba, yeah. which like, are we asking ourselves to fill in as a whole meal no, all the time? You're, you're, you know that's the salad you're getting from there. I, yeah, like, I knew I knew what I was getting. I'm just saying like I'm not impressed with that kind of salad, the salad that every pizza yeah. place has. Uh, the buffalo wings, I agree, were, 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 pretty, were pretty good execution of a buffalo wing. They had a good fry to them. Uh, you know, I like mine with a little less breading, but I thought they were well sauced, and I, I like that, hey, big, big old uh, jacuzzi or ranch they gave you. Yes, yeah. I like that for the dipping. Yes, we also have a <laughs> cheesecake that we can taste. I'm surprised you went the cheesecake over the cannoli, which feels a little bit more Italian specific. I, I, didn't, I just said they had both. Amelia went with it. I don't wow, know. it was Amelia's mm-hmm. executive decision. Maybe that's what they had, because again, they, they didn't have everything they had in the menu. I do like a cheesecake better than a cannoli. Yeah. Uh, yeah, give them the choice. Uh, I'd pick you. a mm-hmm. cheesecake. Oh, yeah, we've been to Desano. We were just talking about Desano. I don't has know. A, I don't think I've ever really been a, blown away a, by it's cannoli. It's a pizza parlor um, where you can dine in, and but it, it's still like a pretty casual atmosphere. But, yeah, they, they have a uh, That's usually where I go for my birthday, Yes. Really. Oh, I that's go. such a nice – that's a great – It's a, they've got big, long tables. You can get a big group or a Big small old gathering one. there. <laughs> I don't know what your birthday would look like. I did have a – yesterday, I forgot we were watching – but we saw something with tiramisu. I'm like, oh, I come all the time. Yeah, I can go for That's some good. tiramisu. Most years. I wouldn't That's know where to go. My, my aunt makes a really good. Made in house there you go. Bringing up the way. Italian aunt again. She makes a good uh, Yeah, it's totally possible. That was just hate. Good. I'm not hating on it. I'm just saying, like a lot of these places, like a lot of these places, aren't making their own desserts in house. You're dressed up like a happy child, and you're giving <laughs> shit to fucking Amici. Why are you so defensive of Amici, a place you never had before? I liked it. It was fun. It was fine. I mean, Jesus fun. You know how I am with Italians. I'm not so sure about them. And th- this place kind of, <laughs> yeah, it impressed Mitch's me. It, it, fake, it was, uh, it's like a, fake racist to a, Italians. You know, trapped in time. It's a, you know, it's, 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 it definitely feels dated. Yeah. But I thought the quality of the food was actually what is this? Coral. pretty good. Damn it, Coral. Uh, well, let's get to our final thoughts on Amici pizza and pasta. So, Gilly, That's, here's how this will that work. That is good. I'm still like rocking on that bite. Uh, yeah, me too. Good, cheese, good cheesecake. Guys? A little bit of a different film on top. Dry? Soft in the middle. That yeah. very soft graham nice cracker bottom. Nice texture to it. This is my fork, if you guys don't care. Man, that is a... That sort of... I'm a little shocked. Yeah. It's, it's <laughs> fucking... Taking a bite. It's good. I like a cheesecake, too. Cheesecakes are hard to make, too. I feel like the chances of a pizza place baking cheese cakes in the back is probably not i'm feeling pretty firm that that was made like at a factory yeah for sure and not in a bad way let the factory make the cheesecake yeah. i don't need a grandma sweating over my cheesecake <laughs> oh, oh yeah. casey's doing the thing craig, craig, loves, oh, it. Yeah. craig, craig craig loves it craig's craig <laughs> doing it craig might be italian he's doing the he's doing the hands <laughs> i am half italian <laughs> oh wow you insulted his people <laughs> before my grandpa chose the name Nisim, my name would have been Gilly Venezia. Wow. Which is Venice. Wow. I love that. I think it's pretty great. She's like maybe a magician. Okay. She's <laughs> definitely not a comedy writer. <laughs> uh, I don't know what she is, but she's not a comedy writer. Okay, wait. Sorry. Hey, Wags, leave the gun. Get to bring the cannolis. How about leave the gun? Bring the cheesecake. There you go. <laughs> I think she you likes the cheesecake. Up. She just licked it all off. Her wow. Cute. Her opinion matters the most. Mm. Cute. I feel like Jimmy doesn't normally eat human foods. Hey, she funny, the NFL sticks season is finally it. here, and our partner Underdog Fantasy wants to make it a lot more exciting. Join the millions of fans that have played uh, on Underdog Yeah, this is the other reason why I think maybe they're, they're nearing their, money by making sports picks. their end wow. or in it for the money is Better recently been doing you some what I would call times your questionable ads or lower on player stats like touchdowns for, receiving yards interceptions uh, and much more. I think there was like a vape company NFL picks or mix and match across and your now other gambling I've seen some gambling ads. underdog is available in 30 plus states including California I mean you gotta I make live, money Florida and Texas but, those are three of our biggest states folks and they also have you know, multiple NFL I feel like I wouldn't that. Anyway, do it. Here are uh, you know, I'm, I'm in a very privileged two. position where of the walking lock I don't of have Marino. to wow. do ads. New customers <laughs> can pair our picks with this I don't have Williams to free pick. have Caleb a profitable one yard YouTube channel. I do it for fun for poops and giggles. Is a I guess if I was September, in a position so where I didn't have a job and my Underdog source of income was so sign up now and something like a YouTube channel or a podcast, maybe I would change my tune. Oh, hell, I'd say probably I would change my tune. 
Okay, we'll get to our final thoughts on Amicia Pizza and Pasta. Uh, Gilly will each but I've give often our thought, closing arguments, if you, you know, will. The odds uh, of our, 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 our of this tiny YouTube channel ever making money experiences, including this meal, and then is give it a score virtually non-existent. Also because I have no plans on doing things like turning on like ads or however that works. Necessarily Mexican food, uh, it's something else, or like Domino's isn't necessarily pizza, it's something else. To me, this is the beginning of pizza. This is when we've left the Domino's Primordial the pizza. realm of like, this is just sort of like in another category. We are now entering real pizza category. And the first stop on a long journey is Amici's Pizza. Sure. And I'm so happy to hit this stop. It's a great oh. it's a great rest stop on the journey. Mm -hmm. I'm giving it a solid three. Three forks. forks. I love it. Wow. What a great four. breakdown, too. Uh, 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 for Appreciate it. How the hell did we not have you on sooner? I can't We're believe it. Don't now. stop apologizing. Me. Don't <laughs> stop. <laughs> uh, hmm. All right, Mitch, what do you think? Your thoughts, your forks. I'm going to borrow something from my old friend, James Taylor. Mm -hmm. Winter, spring, summer, fall. <laughs> All you got to do is call, and I'll be there. Yeah, I'll be there. Are we getting DMCA yet? <laughs> you got Amici. <laughs> Amici, you got a friend. I, yes. I, I've yeah. learned that a friend is I've learned in this episode is Amici. Um, I Christ. love that this place is passing time. I really. Thought it was, I, I mean, maybe Why did so he have so much have fun? Bad lunch, and I thought that it was like quality food, and, and it was still decently hot when we were eating it. Everything about it, I like decently I hot. Place, if I, okay, if I was at a, a if I was at, uh, that's what they call like, copium, whatever, uh, a neighborhood meeting. They're complaining about me, yes, right. <laughs> <laughs> I go to this neighborhood meeting, there's a monster that burns up here. <laughs> 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 what are you guys talking about? They scream as I walk in. <laughs> and there was Amici's there, and there was slices of Amici's. I'd be like, that's pretty fucking good. I would enjoy it. That's the type of tier it is. I think it's the sort of thing too of like, if I had a if I had a big party and there was like, uh, like, I had some people over the Oscar uh, Oscars. Oscor, yeah, I don't know if you watched the Oscars this year. <laughs> I watched. I did see the Oscars. Uh, it was a great show. It was great. It was Instead really of good. a statue, they give you a rating one for ten. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, hey. I, it was a great so time. That's why she's Oscars, a writer. I ordered pizza, and I, I believe that I got, and I, and I, and I do love this pizza. Of course, this is my favorite. I believe in town right now, but prime pizza. I ordered prime pizza. Mm, I ordered like good. five or six prime pizzas. Prime pizza is great. It cost me like almost three hundred dollars yeah. with everything. Surprised all your limbs are intact because you paid an arm and a leg. Why? Because I 100% agree with you. That was the issue. I could get what? How many Amici pizzas and and uh, probably the same thing for half the price? Prime pizza. Uh, Never heard of that. Not that it's super cheap, but it still is cheaper. Is that yeah, like you know, Amazon Prime? Sarah, you, I know. <laughs> she is I know. being very funny. The issue with the show is that she is often more funny than us. She's so way more entertaining. Like, you're, I'm, uh, she like, like looks stoned, kind of too. You from the cheese day. I wonder why. She lives with me. <laughs> <laughs> you're being so passionate. Yeah, Amelia yeah, is a, and then is a I, partaker. Uh, and she drew me in. I'm so and she's sorry. She like, has her eyes like kind of half open. She looks very funny. She's being very cute. She's got her like neck pulled back a little bit. Like if I do it, that's how I would get a double chin, or how I would continue that double chin. And she's just kind of doing that and closing her eyes. She's being very cute. She's being very okay, cute. Mitch, I'm so sorry. I mean, she looks very in her eyes. Are, uh, look, I mean, I don't have that much more to say. I like, I I think that it. I think it's a damn good. I think it's a. a, a it's it's a it's a. Uh, what's it called? Uh, oh, shit. Time capsule. Mm hmm. Time capsule. Yeah. But it, it's a, it's it's stuck in time, Wags. Turtles in time. It's there. It reminds me of the Turtles 80s. in time. It reminds me of early nineties. I love it. I, oh. And I it's a first time having it. All right. I'm sure Stretch that you can have this and it cannot be good. Yeah. yeah. I've had Domino's when it hasn't been good. I've had I've had you know, oh. all these pizza chains that God damn. experienced it. We had a good You gotta stretch it out every once in a while. Three and a half forks. Three and a half forks. Wow. I, half. I, I liked it quite a bit. I like how you just threw in Turtles in Time in the middle of there. <laughs> <laughs> Reference to the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I, 
Look, I, I'll, you got pizza on the brain. I got yeah. pizza on the brain. <laughs> I, I gotta say this. I got Krang's body. We've said before. Um, <laughs> I, I, uh, if you come to LA, don't get a meat cheese pizza. No, yeah, of course really? not. Yeah, like it's like because people have been like, I'm gonna do a Doughboys tour or whatever. Don't get a meat cheese. You shouldn't get a meat cheese. Go to Quarter Sheets. If you're if you're ordering delivering pizza one night, get some prime pizza. Uh, Apollonia's go down there, try that out. Oh yeah. But don't you don't have to get a meat cheese. But if you live here, it serves a purpose. Why? It does. I think that's well argued, Mitch. Uh, I'm also waiting for some dipshit on the subreddit to be like, I went to a meat cheese like they recommended, and it wasn't good. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Fucking idiot. Listen to the show. Idiot. <laughs> that's his redditor fan voice. <laughs> uh, Sus went two and a half. Um, Anya seemed pretty positive. Yeah, piece of shit. He came in also, by the way, took a half of the meatball sub I wanted. I was like, this fucking... He, bumped, he, took, a, he took a full half of the meatball he, sub? He just came in and fucking bouldered in, fucking ate the food. The, he, he didn't put in any... He didn't, you know, he didn't put in... <laughs> ate it, he set his score and left. Which he, he was right. Yeah, that's I guess, a... we, I guess I just mentioned that Susser gave it two and a half forks, and this is the first mention that he was at, here. But people could maybe just assume that Susser was here. Susser, was Susser here. showed up. <laughs> Susser oh. texted what time is food coming and then he showed up. He showed up. <laughs> <laughs> like he doesn't work for the show. He's just like a, a, a you know, a friend, I guess. In and out for meal time. Bigger door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was, it was, look, we're always happy to see him. Always was, happy to see him. It was nice, but he was annoyed. He was like, he was like pointing at everything, trying to get me to get him everything. I was annoyed. Uh, but two and a half, I think, is a little. I think it's a little low. He went two and a half forks. Anya did really like the gluten-free crust, which I, I was I was surprised she reviewed it so favorably as someone who's had a lot of of, of GM. To what you're saying, Mitch, I got to reference our friends, the Golden Girls. Oh. Thank you the for being favorite. a Michi. <laughs> <laughs> Traveled down that road and back a Michi. <laughs> <laughs> Your sub is true. You got salad and also calzone. That's true. <laughs> and if you made some pasta, invited everyone hey, you fuck. chew. <laughs> everyone you chew? Yeah. <laughs> you would see the yeah. biggest slice would be for me. <laughs> and, and the, the cheese, cheese attached, attached would say, thank you for being a Michi. <laughs> Um, hey. All right, which one's which? <laughs> for, for being made up on the spot, you know, come on. Could you do better? Uh, yeah, I'm wait. Blanche. I'm the horny one. Yeah. Oh, wait, Blanche. Wait, I didn't mean Blanche. I meant Dorothy. Dorothy's the dumb one. I'm the no, dumb one. No, that's Rose. No. That's Rose. I'm, I was going to say, I'm oh, Rose. Oh, you're Rose. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then I may have Dorothy, yeah. But Dorothy's also tall. Fucking, he jumped on Dorothy's me being like Rose the, quick. Dorothy's like the one that keeps them all, like, alive and in check. She's kind of the mom. Yeah, she's I the B. She's the Dorothy B. Dorothy is... She's the B. Arthur. She's, the B. Arthur. she's got the little tiny mom. Yeah, I, I gotta say, she is. I think she's MVP. I, I when I was younger, I loved grandma. Rose, and she is so funny. But uh, Betty White. Uh, yeah, Betty White's great. Yeah. But uh, actually, all Golden Girls, rest in peace at this point. But uh, but B. Arthur is so funny on that. B. Arthur's show. amazing. They're, yeah, so They're all so good. I'm, I'm gonna say I'm the Sophia. I'm just gonna come You're Sophia. in and just punch you both. Uh, in who has someone has a really good? That makes, that makes uh, like, I think it's Jeff Ross. Black, yeah. He's got a really good B. Arthur it's story. It's not just that she's horny, it's that everybody wants to fuck her. <laughs> she did that face yeah. again afterwards. She's doing that face. And we're locked eyes again. <laughs> it's, it's fun to um, think of a... Uh, of Rue McClanahan in Starship and Troopers. Yeah. Oh, him, it's me. I'll shoot. And if you Google <laughs> Rue McClanahan <laughs> in Starship Troopers, you're going like to get a bit of a does. surprise. <laughs> Uh, all that said, I agree with Susser. I think this is two and a half forks. And I, I will say that because I think this place, I think two and a half on the five fork scale is right in the middle. I think this place is right in the middle. I think it's right at the top of the bell curve. This is it's exactly, exactly average pizza. And I think all a lot of the other stuff is periphery, is perfunctory, to borrow your word. Um, and uh, and and I just I just feel like there's no reason for me to ever get this place unless I have a coupon. But I'm going to indulge in pizza <laughs> even as someone who lives within delivery range of an Amici, I can just think of other options that I would get. So, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm glad some people like it, and, and I'm glad it's a decent value. For me, this is a two and a half worker. I thought you were gonna go way lower. I would not go lower than two and a half. I'm, I'm thrilled. Not, yeah. I, I maybe shouldn't have chosen a place that I have like a personal attachment to, but yeah. I yeah. did, and I do. <laughs> 
And I'm so glad you both didn't like totally hate it. I really thought it was, I thought it was fun. And I didn't bring this up before, but it just hit me when you were talking That's about, like, uh, you like know, showing your friend a movie all. that you really like. Chuck E. Cheese pizza. Yeah, no, Chuck E. Cheese not pizza, sure. It. it feels very on that level where you're like, this is better than it could have been. I'm trapped in this place right now. I thought Chuck E. Cheese pizza was like famously bad. And there was, there's those rumors. Yeah, sure. No, we, we no. Or conspiracy. That they like yeah, take have, pizza yeah. that wasn't eaten it's and serve it to the next people. <laughs> we found the two places, yeah. Italy and a Chuck E. Cheese without a child, are the two places on earth where it's actually worse for you. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I can I can flow through those spaces yeah. pretty easily. I look like a, a mom or a babysitter. Uh, but yeah, same, same <laughs> idea where it's like, it just feels good to be eating this pie. And it could be worse. <laughs> For sure. Um, hey, that was a review of could Me be Too worse. Pizza and I, 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 this, is, this is what Sus said. Yes, I'm just going to say this. Let's just say you came across any random pizza and pasta place anywhere. Uh, what are the chances it would be better, be worse? I'm sorry. What are the chances it would be worse than Amici's or better? Is this you or Sus? I think 50-50. And I think he's wrong. You think it's you, you think he's I, wrong? I think he's wrong. There's you think so half much of the pizza places are I worse than that. I think there's than this. so much bad pizza that I actually think that it's actually probably on the better side. That's kind of an indictment of pizza at large, I think. Yeah, that, sure. that's like a it's a sorry state of pizza um, that we're in. I'm not LA like the biggest more, more pizza fan. Pizza. Great pizza, like the place I mentioned like, before. I'm a, pizza, a, I a rare there's pizza a enjoyer. Pizza and it's because but I, I and I did mention this already, I know uh, my mom worked in an Italian restaurant. So growing up, she would often bring home pizza. So we had pizza very often, which sounds delightful. But with any food, if you have it too much, you start to dislike it. This is Slop Quiz, the palate palate. This is a compiled by Amelia Marino, our associate producer. Mitch and Gilly are given a palette of colors and must determine the fast food logo to which it corresponds. Note, all palettes are for fun. current logos as of May 2024, except for question number one. Question number one is the only one that's a throwback. Oh my god, fun. You said producer McDonald's. like I said. McDonald's is the throwback. Producer. Producer. Mitch, you said producer. Guess. Emmer, stop correcting me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I keep forgetting Casey's fake name, which, uh, Craig. Yeah. The Crab oh, Bay right. Marine Life Conservator <laughs> Center was open in 1904. Oh, yeah. wow. All right, this is the palette palette. Here we go. First up. Uh, and buzz in with your name if you think you know. Uh, I heard Mitch. Shit. Taco Bell. Yes, you are correct. This is no the old way. Taco Bell uh, colorway. Oh, my God, it is. I hate the new one without the color. I don't like color. the new one It as looks much. faded. It looks like the sun bleached the color out. I agree. It's less fun. Faded also is also like a word for something that looks bad, right? Like uh, like yeah. it, right? Faded. Yeah, or, or super high. Yeah, that's what I always think of it as. Oh right, that's what it is. Um, I'm pretty competitive and also bad at things, so this game is gonna really wrap <laughs> 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 up. That's a bad combo. So good at that. Which is very competitive. Dime. Next up, Jesus Christ. Oh shit. Mitch. Gilly. McDonald's. I heard Mitch. <laughs> well, no, we'll give it to Gilly. No, okay, Gilly, I said it a minute after you. You have to go. Uh, I want to give. I want to give our guests a chance. Oh, I know what it is. one. Okay, I think it is it A and W. A W whatever. So not not A W. Say one. Yeah, go ahead. Burger King. It is Burger King. Nice. Mitch takes oh my it. God. I don't know uh, if you saw this, Mitch, but I just realized that the clue was in the corner when I opened it. It says Burger King. Oh, I didn't. I did not see that. <laughs> well, now I, I can't even read that with glasses on. But okay, I'm gonna, cool. I, now I'm going to try to cheat. I moved it off screen so this shouldn't happen again. <laughs> Burger King. But yeah, okay, next Burger. up. Wow. Gilly. I heard Gilly. Um, Chevron. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. They sell food. <laughs> it's true. Well, I'm bad at this game. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if What's it's the Chevron store. Fast food restaurant. <laughs> no, I just don't want to lose, even though I'm bad at this. I think I know what this is too. Go ahead, Mitch. It is. This is a little tricky. Don't is it Domino's? Me. Not Domino's. No, oh. this is the current colorway for Wendy's. Uh, oh my God! Okay. Of this course. Is, this is uh -huh. tough because these blocks have no respect for ratio. Yeah, I should oh. describe. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that, <laughs> that's exactly what I was thinking. Let's go to the next one. So what we have here is, uh, you know, five or six different vertical really? blocks of color. It's like a paint swab. Um, and a, a, a yeah, I don't know. Colors and they break I don't down know. the individual um, uh, components of a logo. I heard Gilly buzzing on this one. I think I cheated by doing that. Is it 
Del Taco. It is Del Taco. Wow. Gilly's on the board. It is two to one. I don't think I've ever seen. Yeah, I've never seen a Del Taco sign. That one was a little Irishy to me. I was gonna guess some fucking Irish shit. It is a little bit. Oh, yeah, it does. I'm going to. Where are you there? Where are you going? I'm gonna get really drunk. I'm going with Betsy, Mono, and Tony. Oh, that's fine. What a crew. I know. I and I I really hope I can survive it. Yeah, we're just going to. Yeah, Betsy and Mono. Can I come? Yeah, you want to come? I'm gonna get $130 of Taco Bell. It would be funny if you if I went next week. Party, pretty pretty animals. Apparently. Okay. Sorry, I feel good that I got one. Where should we go? Where are you going to Dublin? We're going to Dublin. We're going to. I already forget all the names. Killarney yeah. Pork, yeah. Kill Kenny. You're doing that. You're doing the southern route. This is what I did. You're going to where the my family is from. Really? Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm. I mean, anyone we should say hi to. There, you could go to the to the Donovan Farm if you want to. Wait, that's so cool. What do yeah. they do on the farm? Gus, this guy Gus works there. Just Gus on the farm. I don't think you know he's, what they do. He's like a guy, like a. They grow gusses. <laughs> it was like a, it was a cow farm, I believe. Oh. I don't know how much, but like we went there and it was like kind of like a big. Irish version of me, basically, that awesome. was there, that lived uh, lived in the house with his mom, and I think he lives there alone now, uh, but a very nice man. I, I think the men and women of Ireland, I think I'm going to go over very well uh, in Ireland, and I'm really excited to give them a <laughs> chance to. Are you going to the Cliffs of Moher? We're going, going to the Cliffs of Moher. We're not sl- sleeping in Galway, but we're going to hit it on our way to Killarney. Okay. Are, are you going to Kinsale? I don't think so. We're doing something called Dingle, or yeah. uh, at the Isle of Circle of Dingle or Circle of Carrie? Dingle? I need to know this because we're going in less than a week. Is there any sort of uh, agenda for this or are you just going for funsies? Um, it will be Betsy's birthday while we're there. Oh, that's fine. Mm. She's going to have her birthday in Cork. Yeah. Um, but in general, like, we're my hometown. Yeah, very, very lucky, but we we all travel and now we're going to yeah. do it together. And How fun. That's yeah. so exciting. And if you just what a crew. cross your arms over your chest and let us pack you into a box. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> We'll feed you rats. <laughs> Let us put a bunch of chains around the box. <laughs> All right. 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 with the crane. This could be you, right. too. Am I going to have to get up there? I think okay. I'm in a grave, finally. Yeah. Ah, here we go. You, sh- you should be shipped with, like, some sarcophagus that's going from, like, the British Museum. <laughs> <laughs> or from here back there. We get back from the trip, like, how do I go? He's like, he stayed in the fucking crate the whole time. Yeah, he <laughs> loved it. Crate. We kept telling him how good the buffet was, and he said, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Came out at night occasionally. Um, I, uh, I, you're gonna have a, you're gonna have a blast. Kinsale is a very nice, but it's very laid back. I think you guys are gonna be wanting to party more. I mean, uh, there's only so much partying we can do to the point where I'm actually starting to have. I don't know if you have this sometimes. We're like, I'm excited to party, but I'm getting anxious that I won't be able to take a break. Yeah. And I might need to be like, yeah. on someone's sleep and be like, I'm going to go by myself for two That's hours. one of the yeah, worries sure, yeah. and then I have of traveling and <clears> why <throat> I, my, I kind of don't. But you're all adults, is like, I need yeah, those. I need like home right. relaxing time. <laughs> it's I, I like have, it's what helps of, me uh, not my, uh, freak out. What are these levels? Hold on here. I got I got my ferritin levels back, which are my level, liver, like for my oh, liver. Oh yeah. They're oh, pretty okay. high. Hmm. Two fifty. That's what I scored. What's the normal range? Two seventy four. It's two oh, twenty twenty one point eight to two hundred seventy four is the normal range. So I'm, oh, so you're on the high oh, end of normal. Uh, yeah. uh, it's not. Not good. My wish, IGA is high too. I wish we all had like the way you could use a breathalyzer to test. I wish we had like a thermostat for the liver of just like I should take a break tonight. But tomorrow yeah. I'm good to go. Sure. Yes. That'd be nice to not I, have to go to a doctor for that. I'm borderline fatty liver. I do a show about fast food and chain restaurants, but the doctor did <laughs> say he was like, he's like, you know, when you like drink booze, it's gonna like fuck you up so much more. I was like, oh, that like makes so much sense, uh-huh. right? Because I've been like killing myself yeah. for like a decade. But anyways. Ireland, you're getting it's a lot, but you're, it is yeah. going to be very fun. I'm from Cork and Munster, Munster Island, Monster Island, right? <laughs> we were right. <laughs> uh, all right, cool. that was number four of ten. Let's go to the next we're one. Get, get, oh, that, four that's of ten. Oh, jeez. Uh, Ooh, this is tricky. Oh, I know it. Mitch. Uh, yeah. White Castle. Uh, White Castle. Mitch is correct. Hey, hey I got one. Right. Next colorway after this. Ooh. <laughs> Gilly? No idea. Gilly? I think I already guessed this, so I feel crazy. But is it A and W? It's not A and W. God, why am I guessing that for everything? It's not Arby's because of the pink. White, it's orange, a pretty strong indicator. Tan, here. pink, and brown. There's a strong indicator. Yeah. Um, Gilly. Am I allowed to say? Yeah, why, yeah, why not? not? I was gonna say Baskin Robbins, but that's not a fast food chain. So I'm just guessing 
Is Random it not? Shit. Well, Baskin Robbins would qualify as a guest. That we, we have reviewed Baskin Robbins. It's not that Baskin is, Robbins. You put me in my head with the. You said there's a strong indicator. You're also here. closer than Baskin Robbins. Yeah, you Robbins are pretty. You're you pretty think. close because it is the same company these days. Dunkin' Donuts. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah, it is Dunkin' Donuts. That I can't, much pink. I can't believe there's that. There's an I didn't apostrophe get it. of pink. I do think the donuts used to. When it was yeah, Dunkin' donuts, donuts, was more. donuts was in pink. This is the coffee logo, which yeah. is a little different. Is that what you're saying? That the pink was the indicator. Yeah, the pink, that, yeah, yeah. that was such a tricky thing because I was thinking, whatever. That was yeah. tough. I, I'm also. It's my hometown. Oh, oh. oh. Okay, we've got you're another one. What were you gonna say? You're also what? What were you gonna say? I was gonna say do, I'm I also give, do I give Mitch a point for that? Uh, one? East Side Marios. I'll give him a point. Yeah, he gets. I was going to say, I'm like pretending like I know all versions of these logos. I know. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we've got another one. This is like uh, a mint, a white, a uh, forest green, and a red. Gilly. All right, Gilly. Sbarro. It's not Sbarro, but that's a good guess. Yes, that is a great guess. It looks guess. very Italian. That's. I can't believe it's not Sbarro. Duncan Knows is my hometown place. I should know it. Um, Cork and Munster. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where's my ladder at? No, this isn't Starbucks. This is Krispy Kreme. Oh, okay. oh. This is Krispy wow. Kreme color. I was wondering if there was like if the Little Mermaid had like like yeah. hot red lips or something. I knew a guy who worked at the first Krispy Kreme in my hometown. I'm not, not saying the first Krispy Kreme, just oh, the one. First my. one uh, near Taft High School in <laughs> SoCal. Wow. And um, he put a spoon under the wall, uh, the waterfall of Blaze for me. That's cool. I th nothing better has happened since. <laughs> <laughs> nothing, like just in life. How'd it taste? Um, too much. Yeah. Uh, but just seeing the like wall uh, get interrupted by a spoon. Yeah. Was and then there's like a little gap of like you could see through. That's maybe one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. <laughs> Wags I, Wags I okay, come on, wall. We both fell in and we got sucked up the tube. Oh, um, yeah. I, okay, I need Wait, to do I, this. I know Wonka's ma. <laughs> w w w Willy Wonka came out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wonky. <laughs> Thanked his mom. Nice little Wonky. That it was for her. Uh, uh, next up. All right, we've got a couple of shades of blue. We got a red. We got a white. Uh, we got uh, a, a no gold idea. or a, a kind of. Uh, hey, I'm happy I got one. Oh wait, does yeah, this orange yellow good? maybe? God, oh, I'm, I want to be good. I would not get this one. I will say, knowing what it is. Oh. Uh, but it wants to just take a wild guess. I was like Foster's Freeze or something crazy, but I don't think it's that. Sonic. It's not Sonic. Good That's a good guess. guess. And honestly, guess. Foster's Freeze is a good guess, You guys too. keep telling me it's a good guess. It's You know what a good guess is? Being right. <laughs> oh, I just don't know. Foster's Freeze right? and Sabaro are both okay. good guesses. I, I, I'm, 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 I, they were good. We're mad at you. They were good, right, Wags? Okay, Lags? fine. We're fine. Although you guessed Foster's Freeze, so you're complimenting yourself. Uh-oh. Yeah. Uh -oh, <laughs> bad luck. Um, I'm going to go with... Uh, hmm. I mean, Damn, I, yeah, I don't really... I don't. This one is De uh, Krager Emery. Oh, Dairy, you know it? Sorry, it. No, it's okay. This is Dairy Queen. Did he, uh, you know this one? I would not, I would not have gotten this one. No. Honestly, just, the, just, the orange color the orange is, is really, really The orange is the one that got me. Because it's such a small yeah. element of the overall logo, but when it's given that equal was the weight, Duncan it really issue. misdirects I wonder yeah. if it were a pie chart. If, I, I bet you I would do just as poorly. Yeah, where it's like a, the same portion of the pie yeah. chart. Oh, the color. So the biggest logo. slice would be yeah. the darker blue, the next bit. Yeah, I, I wonder if fun. that would be more of a, a hint. All right, next up. Uh, Mitch. A&W. Uh, Arby's? Not Arby's. Good guess. <laughs> she wants to say it. Oh, my God. Gilly, is it A&W? Gilly, it is A&W. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, it was bound to happen. If she didn't get that, that would have been bad, actually. I would have actually would have seen me cry. You would have been like, I'm surprised Gilly's crying. And I'd be like, no, this is what makes me cry. I, got, I went to Quebec in December and ate uh, just for fun. I like was wasting time in an airport and got everything on the A&W menu. And it's really fucking good. Uh, so do, do you know oh. the, the distinction between A&W America and A&W Canada? That they're separate brands? I did know that they were separate brands, yeah, yeah. And, and I heard that it was better in Canada. It is better, yeah. I've never it's had it. It's weird, though, that we were just talking about that. were shaped like a drumstick, which is so great because it's shaped like something else. Right. <laughs> like a nugget is what a nugget is shaped like. That's fun. And they were really great. And actually, the shape makes it really great to dip in those little sauce cups. Yeah. A lot of How far is Montreal from Toronto? Um, I said Quebec. Five I don't hours? know. <laughs> <laughs> Montreal is Quebec, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, oh. I don't know if it's that long. Oh, it's a bit I of a hike. Quebec City, um, oh, okay. but, but uh, I, I really don't know Canada. I don't. And I think they're opposite ends. No? I don't Quebec, know. Why am I Quebec guessing? Quebec is like a, a province, I believe, in Canada, and it's large, so it could be. 
and is Toronto right together. next to it? Toronto is, no. is drivable from Boston, so is Mon Montreal is closer to I don't know anything. I know in my head that uh, that Canada is like a vastly larger land area than the U.S., but when I think of it, I'm just like, everything's like a half hour drive. Same. Like, fucking, no. I don't know. <laughs> right I know it's big, but I just always think of like, oh yeah, Vancouver, Toronto, they're right next to That's each other, you know? such okay, an American exactly, thing. Yeah. I'm just like, well, they're the people are like friendly, so yeah. I guess the place is they got one NBA team for the whole country. It can't be that. Yeah, I I'll respect. do it on my phone. Because I don't want to stop the recording. <laughs> oh, my timer's about to go off, too. Wow. It's a little ride. bit of a haul. Yeah, LA to San Francisco. Yeah. Uh, okay, we have, uh, we have a couple more. Next oh, up. That felt so good. Ooh. Oh, you know what? I'm going to do this Wait, one. I know this. Tropical Starburst. How long a drive between <laughs> Toronto and Montreal? Not Wait, Tropical Starburst. This is a this, food brand. I? But you're in the, 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 you're in the correct <laughs> vicinity with your... With your Kind Mitch. of yes. Is it um, five hours? Oh, look at five hours, nine minutes. Oh, okay, shit. so I was uh, nine uh, minutes uh, off. Um, that was pretty good. Oh, fucking the bee. Uh, the bee. Billy. The bee. Go ahead. <laughs> Baja Fresh. It's not Baja Fresh. It's not Jolly Bee, which is what you're thinking. Oh, there is a. Uh, what the is this one? There's a train no, though. Uh, this is, uh, I, we can, we did can I ever do it? I don't think I ever did it, but I had. Uh, Friends, actually, the missus used to occasionally do it, like Very much not so, on the regs, yeah. but you know, point, maybe <laughs> half a dozen we'll times from uh, Toronto to Montreal. Oh. The we're looking at, we have I do recall the drinking age is different. Uh, kind of have the like it's a I took a sip for the last several. Well, this is not an easy exercise. Because, again, this isn't how we normally look at these logos, and some of them, color is not the strongest element. We think of something else. I guess I... I'm trying to um, sort of, like... Yeah, I, I, for some reason, I think the bit, like, drinking yeah. age is 18 in, in Montreal, where it's 19 my here. Brain into having seen it. You know, when you sometimes... Do Americans? I assume generation. Americans must... <laughs> sure. Like, 19-year-old Americans must this, come this to Canada Sparrow? to drink? I was going to say the same thing. It's not tomorrow, but this is an Italian chain. Ooh. Amici's? Mitch is correct. This is Amici Pizza. <laughs> oh, that's where they just. Mitch eat. wins. Oh, this was a really smart game, honestly. Like maybe too smart for me, but for the show, for sure. <laughs> uh, that was Slop Quiz the Palette Palette, just like a restaurant via your feedback. Right. Let's open up the feedback. Like and today's email is from Nick, not me, wow. though. That is my name. Nick writes, "Hey, Doe Crew. One of my pet peeves is when products like Gatorade don't actually describe the flavor of the bottle." Things like Glacier Freeze, Cool Blue, and Ice Punch. My question is, do you have any food-based pet peeves? Hope to see y'all okay, sometime soon in Texas. How about that? Yeah, how about that? Nick is wondering about flavors that don't describe the flavor. I will argue second. that Glacier am I Freeze here? does a pretty good job of I evoking so what oh, it tastes like. Oh, okay. I, think I didn't get what I was looking at, like why it was still showing my yeah. missed so, spot. Yes. Yeah. So I'm yeah. seeing the other um, side. I mean, so this goes up and down and around. I guess just general food based pet, pet peeves. I didn't get it. Related. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. I guess I kind of got this. This feels like old hat now, but just to say, to get to get the ball rolling, I feel like I'm just kind of exasperated this by This makes it kind of hard, actually, because like, then when I do this, I'm like, seeing we've the got, other we've side. We've done this too many times. Oh. Too many people have done this trick. I'm just kind of, I've just kind of burned out on it. Sure. Also, as someone who doesn't eat pork anymore, but it's also like, just even when I was, I was like, I feel like five years ago that was a dated thing. Oh yeah, I yeah. feel I feel pretty passionately about um, sandwiches not being wet enough. Okay. Uh, if we're <laughs> there, just uh, there are sandwiches that are wet enough, and there's many that are not. Yeah. Cheese is a dry item, and we're putting lettuce and we're putting you know veggies. Hopefully, when then we've got like our this. meats. Uh, bread is dry. I'm, I'd, yeah. Yeah, so to be honest, I don't know if I've mustard, really had like a enough. wet sandwich. No, I agree with it's, you. it's a great. Flavor addition. I guess the meatball sub is a kind of a sandwich. I'm like talking that. a vinaigrette, an olive oil, um, really? maybe an aioli, and hopefully two. Avocado sometimes can be a little slippery. I need my sandwiches to be wet and slippery. I and I wish there were. <laughs> Both, it's a, it's a take. Used to describe that, but um, yeah, just getting take. like meat, cheese, and bread is is absolutely. You're not done with your sandwich. You, you need to keep going. Fully agree with yeah. you. The only things I get yeah, wet are sandwiches, it. basically. <laughs> um, I, uh, I, I have a pet peeve. I got a good one for you. And it, it, it was with pizza. When, you're, when your baseline cheese pizza is a margarita, 
give me a cheese pizza as well. When it's like, yeah, I think oh, I'm gonna default yeah. cheese. You, you know what I'm saying? It's like, or oh, you can get this margarita. I'm like, there should be a default cheese. That's a little a small pet peeve. Here's another pet peeve. We said probably, maybe not a great guy. Definitely sounds like a bad guy, uh, but also too young to die. Morgan Sporlock, he's passed away. Here's my pet peeve. Bring back Super Size. I did like Super Size. I want the fucking Super Size. Yeah. Yeah. The witch is dead. <laughs> <laughs> what did he die? He didn't die of like something like related to that sort of that thing, dude. If you're unfamiliar with Super Size, he, uh, Morgan Spurlock, documentarian, I guess. Um, and he ate McDonald's exclusively for every meal for a month. And the health consequences were not great. It, I think it was basically like being an alcoholic. Or, or maybe it was even worse. What else is new? Here's one. This again, kind of, kind of, kind of a, a thing that I people people have brought up in the past. A uh, house ketchup. I don't need a house ketchup. No. Just give me, just give me good, like a ketchup out of a bottle. I don't need whatever fancy concoction you have that you want to call your own brew ketchup. Okay. ketchup. This it's might be a pain. Never, I don't, yeah, I don't know if my satisfying. taste buds are blown out or what, but just like a house ketchup. Is, I'm gonna have trouble telling what's clean versus not clean. We all agree here. what ketchup tastes like. Yes, Never mind. Don't, yeah, don't do that. Yeah, don't I do think that they that were a little out. lenient there. I Maybe they knew. I like a cheese. I'm going back to cheese pizza again. When people put like, I'm just realizing I sound like a child. When people put the hot pepper and the and the and the and the, 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 the Parmesan cheese on, I like it just cheese. I want a cheese pizza. It's, it's situational. There's there are times when I might want to plus it up with a little red pepper. I'm trying to think of pet peeves, things that like annoy you. And, I mean, for me, it's just that my order is wrong. That's yeah. the only thing that will really not really annoy a picky me, eater. Like, uh, I got a pet peeve when my bowl is empty. <laughs> Jimmy. 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 <laughs> You southern harlot. <laughs> There's got to be other pet peeves yeah. that we... That, I mean, you've listened to the podcast. I think we named a few good ones. I'm trying yeah, to think, a few. like, his, the one he said specifically being about colors as flavors, like... I've actually really accepted that. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I don't mind that. That, that. that does not bother me at all. I get that that's 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 his thing, but it's, it's not a big thing for me. I don't like that you can't find the blue Gatorade in the mini. Ooh, I, I that's a good one. The other ones in the like, is it uh, six I'm, or twelve? I'm buying Gatorade lately, actually. Like, like, Gatorade Zero, which is like the sugar-free, uh, zero-calorie ones, the and they're actually the like pretty good. Yeah. I, I, I think I like yes, them more than normal Gatorade. Because like, when I want college, something like yeah. that, like I want it kind of watery, and they're definitely more watery. More watery, uh, less syrupy. Yeah. It blues my favorite flavor, and they're like, "This one we won't do in a small." I was so you run into that. I, that actually is a great one when there's a, there's a there's configuration of something yeah, that's I, available, I don't know, but it's I not available. Don't think in the, like in the way that you want okay, it, the well, mechanism that you want it. I found that with the the, the specifically um, the Gator Light cooking. zeros because the Gator Lights have too much sugar. But the Gator Light zeros the are kitchen, flavorful. But the Gator well, other I people are also like, cooking. The, the Gatorade zeros enjoy. were regularly at the liquor store I was going No, am I that's referring to the misses? The yeah, exactly. Necessarily? Yeah. I'll leave that up to the United That was good. That's one of my, that's my big go-to. Yes, I am. <laughs> I forgot that it was the zero in addition Too many cooks to in the, the kitchen. Yeah. Yeah. To me, I assume it's the most popular flavor. Right. It's very different because it is, it's, it's, it's like a Pedialyte. It's like baby yeah. juice. It's still pretty good. Oh, <laughs> baby juice. Uh, let us know what yours is. Hashtag my food pet pee. And if you have a question or comment about the world of chain restaurants, you can email us at feedback. <laughs> Normally he comes up with a funny saying. Or a funny way of doing it. But I guess maybe he's tired of putting up with the Mitchell bullshit. Our entire feature 2018 back catalog. Subscribe at patreon.com slash doughboys. Our producer is Emma Erdbrink. Our associate producer is Emma Okay, I forget what's next. Oh, you know what I didn't mention? So with these sort of videos in mind, I made myself like a playlist. Thank you so much for being here. What a treat. I'm a big you know, uh, YouTube like. playlist so maker. Awesome. Like I, I make overdue. one Thank you. Is there anything you'd with, like to plug? Uh, like I make one a week with the date <laughs> as the playlist Twisted name, metal. the date of the oh, Saturday. I guess you want to plug it. Twisted metal. And yeah. I've done it for, <laughs> geez, I don't know how many years. 
Who knows when that? Who knows when season two? Will but come, it's but because I watch. Season one is available. Like, like I, I watch YouTube more than any did. other streaming uh, service. Yeah. Season two is gonna be great. I can't wait. That's like my number one go-to watch. To check out what y'all do. I can't wait to bring your words to life. Yes, my little puppet. Dance. And with anything on the internet, if you take some time. No, with anything, but with most things on the internet, if you take some time to... Hey, buddy, want Doughboy's merch? We're talking hats. I guess you would say format it in a way that is pleasing to you. Uh, it's going to be very beneficial. So by that I mean on social media, take some time to find people to follow who you like. Take some time, time to block people who you don't like. You're gonna have to do some. You're gonna have to do some admin. It's sort of how I look at it. To make the internet's not horrible. <laughs> yeah, that's actually a good way to, to remove some of the internet horribleness. You're gonna have to do some admin for yourself. Hey everybody. Hi. Currently, uh, this is going to be very quick. We're oh yeah, what uh, I, I forget what he's what is he doing? doing? Good to see you. Yeah, we're, we're a few minutes, five minutes early. So it's this is Leafle minutes. Company with Stir Poke and Vinny. We got uh, a Germa Vinny. stream. Uh, I enjoy Poke, poke but he doesn't stir. really post much in the Leafle way of company. like full streams that we could watch here. Maybe I Never could go on before. Twitch and watch some no, VODs or something, on. but I kind of want to keep it to YouTube. It's easier. Again, with the playlist. I did hear that it's, 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 quite a, it's quite a scary game. It's quite a fun experience is what I've heard. Um, so, having some poke... Uh, go, I'm going no cam, too. I want to get totally immersed. With uh, German. You know, it's a good combo. I'm going no cam to start. But I thought we can enjoy it together. Ideally, yeah. So uh, these are the playlists that I have: the uh, weekly one, okay. which usually <sighs> by the end of the week is about a hundred videos, plus or minus some amount. Uh, and then I have a, a playlist called "Fun Long Plays," which is any video that is over an hour ends up Was on the fun long play just playlist I mean, just because you know i might not finish so, them in one yeah, sitting these are things i'm probably going to come back to no, more it's often it's where you know like crit down, roll ends it's up longer longer things oh, and you know they're not necessarily long like, plays but i'm just using the word long plays so for a lot of this uh, then i have uh yeah. two Sleepy Long Play playlists. Uh, one is called Sleepy Long Play Talkies, and one is called oh, yeah. Sleepy Long Play Toonies. Stir, stir. The talky one is like Where's the you know, a 12 hour Skyrim re a retrospective, for That's example. So you, you, you play this game a lot. The Toonie ones no, are things with music no, no or, oh, you know, really? uh, I've, yeah. uh, I've the one sort of go to every once in a while is like a train at night while it's raining. You know, sort of ambience. Ambiance, if you prefer. Uh, and then this new one I just added is Long Plays Potential. Uh, potentially streamable. So. That Doughboys. Damn. And um, now this. Chat, we're keeping this vanilla today. We may eventually do non-vanilla and expand the lobby and get different... Oh, uh, then... I didn't even... I totally forgot about this one. Uh, I have one named after the misses, and that's our playlist of stuff that we watch together. And then, with that one, once we watch things on the playlist, I take them off. And I put them on their own separate playlist so, Paul, of already watched things that we watched together. So, you know, in the future, uh, I'll tell you 
if we ever wanted to like sort of scroll through and see the things that we've watched, uh, we could do so. It's kind of fun, right? How do I turn the lights back on? Uh, where's that on the so wall? yeah, I'm a big uh, YouTube playlist uh, user. Hello. Uh, and the other thing is, I actually pay for YouTube uh, premium, just because again, it's my most watched. He said he. I don't believe him, but he said he was only in the lobby for like hours. Stuff. I, I played like so, three hours. if I had to watch ads, okay. that would be like a, I feel like it'd be like a significant portion of my life watching YouTube ads. I'm, I'm kind of a liar. How do we turn the lights back on? That's a, if that's you can spend a, um, you can spend money to remove, to add quality of life and <laughs> to your life. I'm, I'm usually not averse to that. I need to turn the lights off my, in my whole entire house. Hey, I'm back, y'all. I'm ready to go. Oh, hey, where, where's the lights? Let me turn the lights on. Oh, it's so dark. I, I turned them um, on. Okay. I'm sorry. It should be on the wall. Oh. I'll find it. Right here. Oh, yeah, you go. Oh. Right here. How loud is this game? Is this game loud? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, no. How loud is it right now? I mean, like, our voice. Is how loud the game is. I'm just, I mean, Chad, how does, how does my audio sound? <laughs> Alright, we're done with the clan. Alright, well, just be aware, because there's going to be some oh, screams in your ears, probably. I'm being pre I'm prepared <laughs> there for There's, like, Freddy Fazbear when he comes at you. It gets pretty loud. Have you seen the movie? I can hear my my voice through someone's mic. Is it me, still? I think it might be you. Uh, audio oh, is, let oh, me oh, test. Let me test. That's, that's no, it has to be game, Chad. Ah! Dude, have you, have you seen the Five Nights at Freddy's movie? No, but I've been trying to cheese on Yeah, I, I, do people... I'm, I'm actually a little curious about that movie. Like, who is that for? Do, do the people who enjoyed Five Nights at Freddy's... Will, do they, did they enjoy the movie? Will they enjoy the movie? If you press one, you can, like, do jazz hands, I think. One? Uh, hey, hey, hey. So, you can press two, and you can point. What? And here, check out uh, this manual over here. You can grab this, broken. and you can do a little reading if you want to read before we start. Okay. Uh, there should be another manual for the new recruits. I think. Okay. You guys might have to share. You can turn the pages, yeah. Um, I got we have How much reading do we have to do? Lovely. Hey, you don't have to, but there is some, some valuable company information in there. Okay. All right, so this dodge roll is a melee attack. What else is there? Hide that over there. I'm changing my headphones to in ears so there's no echo. Okay. In ear? Let's see. Using your echo scanner, the company's patented echo scanner. Is this is a cool introductory um, video okay. as well. Scanner to fix an object. Is there? Um, a chat member told me. So just realized, like, like, starting out about uh, a half an hour, I had to go to wash it. Read. Okay. We are part of a company. They're sending us oh. down here to get items from inside the local base. <laughs> the combination of drinking water and so the sound of a power here. washer probably going to mean, up here, you, can see up here, our you know, washroom trips are inevitable, right? We've got to get 130 worth, otherwise the company will fire us. $130! All right, it takes three days. We've got three days to get 130 Okay. Okay, y'all hear me now good? I'm ready to go. This All right. game did look pretty fun. Uh, uh, do we just walk out the door? I don't really play Wait, did you, a lot of did you explain to them the beginning? online games with friends. Oh, yeah, it to them. We land somewhere? Which, this is funny, yeah, coming think? from someone who okay. Okay. whose okay. most played game is Rust. <laughs> but a lot of that is yeah, solo. Right, right, mouse okay. I do have a friend who I play that way. But we're not like setting aside a time to meet up online and play. We just sort of, you know, if we're both online, we're playing together. But I haven't really been playing with Russ lately since I've been Fallout 76 in here. Ready? Okay. I can do it. Ow! Dude! Oh, my finger! We have so much fun at the sleepover. 
Try right finger, butthole. Okay, um, I'm ready when, when you guys are. I don't, wait, fuck, I don't think we landed anywhere. Right. Open the door. Yeah, but I have, you know, uh, have I have had the desire. Uh, just I don't know enough gamers. Oh, so if I go to start game, okay, I see, I really. see. Alright, so I go to start game, wait. Uh oh. To play, like, games like this, or, like, Among Us, or Phasmophobia. Hey, I no, bet he would be fine. Guys, yo, there's, like, a little video. I'm Gold Mask. Where? Where do you see video? It's just, video, you know, people like my age. Yeah, you got a camera. When people are inside the base, they sort of the tend to go two ways. Like, not good with computers at all. This <laughs> is often one of the ways. Which I guess that's why I have a fair amount of younger friends, but that, those are like D and D friends. Uh, this one is gonna be a, a pain to do once we get to the end and clean everything. I think what I'll probably do is do a room and then see how much stuff I have at like 90 some odd percent. Yeah, that's about it. We just go in, we scavenge, and we pull. Jesus Christ! That's how I did the, the villa, right? Or no? Whatever I did last episode. Right, we'll all go together. <laughs> yeah, what should I call these? I, I gotta make a template. The first one was like an experiment one of, so I just sort of called it whatever, but... I find with these sorts of things, you get a template, you throw it in your, uh... Uh, I'm talking description. Description and title template. I, got a box here. I, got I a throw box it in my uh, my Google Sheet with all my other oh, long play description cool. templates, and then I just copy and paste. Okay, Control C, Control V. Yeah, we have no flashlight, so I think we should not be able to see anything. Oh, okay. And that way, when I load it up, the, uh, basically for me the shortest amount of time I can spend doing the behind the scenes stuff, the better. So I avoid editing. So I have templates for everything. You do the job once, and then you don't gotta worry about it again. Stop grab and roll. You have to roll. Why can't we pull it off his head? What do we do? So you not see alien? Which, oddly enough, the missus and I watched last night. Is it on you? Who's it on? What? Um, we're working our way through the uh, alien franchise, and we're gonna do it. We do. We're doing it in chronological order. So we watched uh, Prometheus and then Covenant. Last night we watched Alien. Then I forget. Uh, I have to check my list. I haven't written down. Uh, again, not surprisingly. Um, if uh, Aliens is next, or the new one, uh, Romulus, is next. I don't. There's nothing here. All right. Well, you want to make yourself useful and take the generator back to the ship. Uh, alone? Can you handle that? Yeah. Well, like there's nothing outside. Okay, so what I think I should do now is go to the washroom. Um, be careful. Guess what I could do is just leave this on like I did last time. Normally I have, uh, I think I mentioned, normally I have this. But, you know, we can do it a little differently. You just watch, uh, watch a little German. Alright, I'll be back in a sec. Scan it. It's just walk. It's just walking around over there. Watch out! Watch it. It's on the ceiling right up here. It's right there. Can I scan it? Okay. 
Whoa. Oh Are my. We gotta, bring, we, gotta, oh. we gotta bring the guy back. You get the generator. It's coming. Oh, it's coming after me. 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 It's coming. Got help? Anybody here? Oh, ow! My body. Yeah. Ow. Anyone that's, <laughs> that snaps the neck. I don't know all of them yet. I only uh, know. Two. It's like fall you're, damage. He's, like, he's literally Wait, right behind me. I didn't know which fall he's, damage there was. He's literally like right there. I, 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 I saw. Okay, I saw him. I think German's gonna, gonna die back. <laughs> they, they don't. He's dead. Do you want to go back and leave him? Take the generator. German. They, they don't know. German. They don't know. Oh. German. You're right! I think he's here. dead, I think he's dead, I think he's what dead. What the oh fuck? Let's take this shit back. That, that's my, my doll from Generation Oh, that's, Lost. that's you. Oh, yeah. Doesn't, it doesn't seem like a lot of... Like, it was just the dead end down there. I don't oh know. my How god. How did you die? You fell off? I, I, the thing was chasing me and it freaked oh. me out and I jumped off the thing and I, I didn't know it was a hundred foot drop. Oh. That was horrible. Yeah, we come here I don't and understand we get this one game, I still don't get it. Kind of embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, we died. Oh. Well, they, they brought back a generator, so that's good. Let's see if you want to go back in. Vine sauce for you, you five dollars. What the fuck? Ooh. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. <laughs> he fell. <laughs> he fell. Oh, this is this. Yeah, is he fell. fell down. This is the embarrassing part. Okay. Do we go back? They have. How are they gonna ever find me? You go back. Kind oh, of how back. did he die? I mean, Sounds like you fell in a pit. A bit, perhaps. Yeah, one thirty. Yeah, we, they're dead. It's their first we, time. We died so early. Yeah. Yeah, we died very early. Well, I didn't know there was monsters that early. I thought it was like I thought this. Was, yeah. Same. Well, I I wish them luck. Well. <laughs> I wish them luck. Wasn't that yeah. crazy? Well, that happened. Okay. Most paranoid. I, oh, I was. I think I've been most paranoid employee every run I've ever done. Yeah, what does that mean? Like, uh, what, what, what is, the, I, I did, uh, what is judging the paranoia the of the players? The I always see that, and I always wonder, but no one's ever explained it. You, you want to you tip recruits? I could yeah. look it up, yeah, but so I you, you kind of don't care enough to do so. Terminal? Yeah. And you could type in a uh, bestiary. And it'll tell you like the thing that you scan. It'll tell so you like you a beast here. Uh, that bug. Snare fleas. Ooh. Snare How fleas. Five bucks. Uh, we That's one thing I do uh, enjoy of this game is there oh, seems to be a lot of uh, baddies yeah, with different yeah, mechanics, which is kind of oh, cool. So it not, I mean, it's not a bad day. Like they all have different in, behaviors like, and. Stuff like that. Strengths and weaknesses. Well, we and... Right so this is like more like phasmophobia than I thought it was. Uh, I don't know what that is. Okay, look, Turn. a shovel is on sale. Uh, somebody use the computer. A store. A shovel is on sale. Yeah, oh, on sale. I see. Yeah, shovel's thirty bucks. A so we have forty-four dollars. <laughs> we could buy maybe. What do you do with the shovel? Oh, I think you just whack things with it. Here. I'm not sure, man. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna leave it up to you. There's also a romantic table and pajama suit. Save up for that. Mm. You should get rich first, yeah. All right. Cool. Did you buy anything? No. No, I'm letting you guys do the work because you, you, you're like ensigns. And it's actually, it actually goes the other <laughs> way because <laughs> you're superior. You're supposed to be doing the work. Yeah, we, yeah. We Star Trek terms. Okay, so you know, the whole point of becoming like manager? Alright, I, so, I checked into my favorite, uh, animal is rock. Good choice. Is that a good first day? That's company property. Hey, you want to get a little fucking closer? See what happens? Flashlight. What? Let's go. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Alright. Oh, good. We have two flashlights now. Nice. Uh, I don't know where they are, though. Where, where okay. do they appear? I think we okay, got a land. Okay, now, Jerma, could you check for a good planet for us to land to? Absolutely. Okay, what, how do I do that? <laughs> We're gonna need to go to the computer and type moons. Moons? And look for a good planet of the top three that has. Okay. That looks clear. Looking at. Uh, what are the. Uh, are they uh, procedurally 
which is a word I have to say slowly if I want to say it correctly, procedurally generated uh, planets? Or is there like a certain amount? How about assurance? Is it clear? Assurance looks it looks like there's nothing there. Should I type in assurance? Do it. Oh. Okay. Cost to route to 220 assurance is zero dollars. It is currently mild weather on this moon. Press confirm or deny. Confirm, please. Ship is currently autopiloting to 220 assurance. Uh, we now assurance. have a balance of fourteen dollars. Please enjoy the flight. Nice, 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 nice. Alright, I'm gonna land us. You guys ready? Yeah. I am ready. I am ready. Okay. We've All got right. SpongeBob yeah, levels of readiness, you yeah, might say. When you do okay. the ice cream truck. Um, are there, and I like do occasionally say. Is that gonna hurt us? Probably. What? Cool. I would avoid the bees as well. <laughs> Not the bees. <laughs> I mean, the bees are, oh, are the locusts. bees are coming over here right now. Oh yeah, these are bad. These will, these will I feel like wait, of wait, wait, the wait. things I have seen kill people oh, in this game, bees yeah, is yeah, probably yeah. at the top of the yeah. list. Yeah, this bug is kind of a coward. <laughs> There's a beehive right there. That's good money though. Good money. Here's the thing. Uh, I'll get it. No, 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 no. What do you mean no? To recruit. That's the last thing we get. On your way back before we leave, you get it. Not now. Okay. Oh, bother. Oh, uh, ice cream truck. What's, why is there an ice cream truck? <laughs> because it's hot. Oh, wait, those are our flashlights, right? Ice cream! Ice cream! Did he say flash or flashlight? Wait, why ice cream music? Alright. Thermal. Okay. okay. Thermal. It's got a little funk to the music, though. Right, that they funked it up about. I'm right below you. Green on the floor. Put a little beat on it. How do I it. use it? That's royalty free, that song? Probably, yes. right? Yes, you want to charge it at the ship. Okay. Okay. We gotta get a move on. So. Uh, Wait, can you go in here? Ah! No. Okay. This ball damage gonna hurt? Uh, I think it's the other way. It's, the, it's this way right here. Is it? Yes. Alright, following you. That way. Mm, I'm probably gonna need to get up there at some point, right? Oh, that's right, there's fall damage. We know that from Turbo. Uh, I love the fucking heavy metal version oh, of that song. <laughs> Be careful. Strange winged creature above us. Just be careful, everybody. Oh, yeah. several more. We're okay, we're fine. We getting doors? Yeah, let's go. Alright. Whoa. Parkour, parkour. Thank you. I oh, this is all sort of one uniform piece, all right, let's go. which I think makes it Entry easier. Building. Okay, we only got one item last time. Here, we got we got a screw in this. We found a strange doohickey on the floor. Are we like three inches oh. tall? No. What? Huh? Look at how big that fucking screw is. This thing is huge. Oh yeah. Screw. <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a future screw. It's like it's for like future things. Are you sure we're not in Toy screw. Story? <laughs> Alright, alright, let's go. I'm, uh, I'm gonna Focus up. I got a jar of pickles. Let's go two by two. Turn with me and you this way. Okay. Uh, I got a flashlight, so we can go in the dark area. Alright. You, you got the flashlight. Scream if you guys need any help. Uh, let's go down. There will be screams. Bob. Bob. Beer. I'll bring it back. Bob, here, here. Should I get to you? Trob. Yeah, give me. Don't we just put everything out? How do, I, how do I get my inventory? Oh, there we go. Um, a scroll. Let me read more things. Alright, nothing. Oh, well, we got a bell. Nice, okay. Really that's gonna good. be worth That's worth something. Okay, so I, got the screw. I think. Should I just dump the screw over here? We go up top There's now. Using a ladder of some sort. Alright, let's go in the door. It's locked. Yeah, if I go right to the top, time. right to the tippity to top. Yeah, I think they went that way, so we can. Oh, there's something right here. Pickles. There you go, pickles. Dude, this is gonna be a huge haul. How come every time I come back, you also come back? I don't know, cause it's scary. I don't wanna get killed by something. I don't know what's in this game. <laughs> this ain't a game, bud. 
Oh, Rubik's Cube. What, 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 what? Whoa! That's the bank system. Okay. Um. <laughs> Behind you, it's more important. There's tea, kettle, and bottles. We need those. Okay, um, I have... What did I just pick up? I got a Rubik's Cube. Do you think I can beat... Do you see in the corner of the room the red door? Yeah. As well? Yep. That's, uh, there's a fire exit on a level. Okay. You um. Can, like, it's a second exit. Uh... You're gonna get lit up by that thing. Should I... Warning, oh. increased levels of radiation. Uh, rats. So can you move rats? I don't... Okay, I got the I got the tea kettle. I got half. Oh! We got a lot of stuff. Oh, I just had the. Okay, I got I got full inventory. It's like a, it's, it's a hot flash feeling, but it's not temperature. Ooh, okay, this is cool. I like this. Um, it's like an anxiety thing, I think. And it's, uh, I get them some Sundays back. where the realization that I have but to can, uh, work tomorrow and have a week full now. of work, it just sort of hits you in a wave of dread. You ever have that? Wait, dude, can we not get back up that way? <laughs> the emergency exit might have been better. We can probably go this way. I love how the hall is pickles and beer. I got, no, I got a Rubik's Cube. I got a teapot, pickles, and a Rubik's Cube. Dub, watch out for the bees. Watch out! Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Not the bees. <laughs> <laughs> you, are you okay? <laughs> uh, nice. I, I might need you to do a maneuver here. A maneuver? Okay. I'm hurt. Listen. Yeah? Jimmy <laughs> sounds so scared he doesn't want to do a maneuver. But I don't have any spots. Okay, pick up the beehive and run and drop the beehive and then run away. Yeah, I'm gone. It's, I, we can't walk by it. God damn it! I Ow. think he's dead. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Okay. okay. Did, I, did I do it? You did it. Oh, you didn't you're, die. <laughs> you're gonna get uh -huh. promoted. Uh, Holy definitely shit! Definitely gonna watch out for that, that <laughs> vampire bug beast. <laughs> that thing. Is that far enough away? Okay. We have um, right now. Hold on, wait, I got this pickles over here that I didn't... What happened to the pickles? Ships right here. Oh, he's far away. I got your pickles. The bees are right there, man. I can't... Well, help! But the bees, All the right. bees are right I think here. we might be good I'm coming, I'm coming, here, but let's see. <laughs> so... <laughs> fucking, like, oh, here. so much. Ah. Help, 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 help! How do this. I get up? How do I get up on the ship? How do I get 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 on the ship? All right, I'm on the ship. Where are you? Lovely. Sir? Sir? <laughs> Sir? Fence. Sir, follow my voice! He's got the bottle! Sir, follow my voice! I'm here, behind you, I'm oh. behind you. <laughs> he took the fucking bottle, right. man. Yeah, so the game plan is <laughs> okay. get right, everything right, in good. here. Drop the stuff inside? Yeah. Which we can find. Uh, tank, yeah. So this is 50 because I've only done one side of it. What's that worth? So that makes sense. Three. That makes sense because it's just started. We're looking for high numbers, which there's none left, so that means we're done in here. Hey, like there's friggin' some levels that are this big, and this is just one room. It's pretty crazy. All right, cool though. If we have money, we can get a teleporter, and we can teleport them back. I feel like everything else we're gonna do is gonna be easier. I think, uh, Which I'm happy guys. about. Oh no, are they just right out here? No, they're in the base somewhere. Oh no. He just scanned it. <laughs> we can... Hold on. Wait, what, what happened? He just scanned it so we can figure out what's killing him. <laughs> uh, Monitoring uh, coke. Bug? Yeah, he's being chased. It's literally like a game oh, of fucking... Oh, okay. Pac-Man? This isn't like an Atari game. Bugs. Oh, I think I've seen a clip of what is about to happen here. Oh. I think they're fighting some um I think Vinny took its thing. I don't know if it's gonna happen right now, but there's a clip of this. I'm fairly sure I've seen a clip of this session. There's some really scary stuff out here though. Uh 
uh, that big. You money, or you want to fucking cry and wet your pants, your little diaper, your little baby? Do you want to cry and wet your little diaper? This is enough. This is like, this is enough, isn't it, for level one? It's getting late. Yeah, but the more that we get, the more flashlights and stuff we can get. At how, what time is it? Isn't it like eight o'clock at night? It's like nine. What time, is there like, Does is it like, matter? okay, is it like Minecraft? Are the creepers gonna come out at 10 o'clock or something? Poke is dead. Oh no. Oh, he's not, oh my God. Okay. Wait, no, Poke might be dead. <laughs> Wait, well, do you hear a scream? Scream? No. I'm like half watching. <laughs> is that you? Is that you walking get around? No, get inside. Get inside. Is that you? Wa I heard something walking around. Someone was just walking around. We're leaving. We're leaving. But does that? Did we get money? Did hey, they get look, money? Look at, the, look at the map. Do you see that big red? Uh huh. <laughs> you see how big that is? Uh huh. Do you, see, do you see the situation? Where? Which? Which one of those is us? Oh. It, oh. We're the little blue circle. Oh, so there's something mm -hmm. horrible out here. Do you want to go out there? Should can I, What if you just open the door? What happens? <laughs> you can go it's going to be a giant. I just want to see it. The, uh, the monsters in, this, in that game are, like, pretty freaky to behold. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Really funny. Oh! 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 oh, oh I got killed! Good one, good one, good one. Let's go. So we made some money, though. I think that's good. Yeah, we, yeah, that was, that was a good run. That was a nice haul. Oh. Proud of you. Dude, I can't wait to you pick know, all four streams and watch every perspective and see what the heck happened out there. <laughs> I don't think he's going to do that. The laziest employee, why? Jarma, it was bad out there, buddy. There's a, um, sometimes Bruce Green and APL Fisher and Mr. Sark have played this. The only thing we had to deal with was a beehive. And they've got something, what's it called? It's like stream sharing. Uh, no, that's not what it's called. There's a word for it. Where, like, they all sort of sync their streams up. Um, I don't normally go on Twitch, so I don't get to experience it. But it is a fun feature, and I, I did do it once or twice. And then you, like, watch all their streams simultaneously. And for a game like this, it's, like, really good. I think when I watched it, it was Phasmophobia that they were playing with. How much money we got? We have... Ten dollars, and it is. No, yeah, we need to. Uh, we need to. We have no money. We have, we have no money. This one is just going to be. Uh, we got to go to an easy moon. Get as e much money as we can. That's we no easy moon. Uh, how do I charge the flashlight? Wait. Oh, right here. Oh, Jesus! That scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> so why Jerry? Uh, Jerry. Gary was a race car driver. Ah. That's cool. Does anybody else want to take the flashlight? What the fuck? What just happened? Yeah, that you was just, weird. You what can happened? move that? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Hey, cut it out! The, the feng shui is just not good here right now. Feng yeah, shui. Not, I, don't, I don't... You need to chill. I'm trying to like return these <laughs> to their natural position so Come we can get good cheat. <laughs> we got a prankster on board. Wait, you, you can you can move the switch away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what moon? Right, ready? Where are we going? Cut it out! <laughs> we, we, got... we went to Val. Uh oh, this is bad. What? What's bad? Uh, just look at all of them. Huh? Just look at them. Look at the reports on the computer. Look at the Hot moons on this. Oh, man. So body this 56 is the Val. Val. Population Val is abandoned. This is foggy. It's humid and windy. Hazard level C. Humid and windy? Hmm. Storm. 
That means the storms are coming. Hot wind. It's hazy too. It's, it's a little too hazy. Um, I'm, I couldn't see the ground, a little but there is ground. too hazy. Be careful, because you could just fall and die here. What? That's not, yeah, that's, uh, that's not good. Oh, and we can't see more than three feet in front of us. I don't like that. We, we, hold hands, hold hands, get a leash. Yeah, yeah. don't go too far. <laughs> out of our is that a surrender. thing that is available? What, 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 what? Oh, is that you? Yeah, I'm making a noise. All right. <laughs> oh, I lost you already. There you are. Uh, let's do a check. Uh-oh. Boop, I'm boop, falling in something. Boop, boop. Looks like a way down. Must have light. See? That's why you check. This is just mist. I can't see anything. I, I think we went in the wrong direction. I don't know. No oh, big wait. hair! Sorry. Oh, God. Oh, no. We're going to be just fine. I know we are. Um, okay. Um, I'm thinking so I do... Yes. How are we going to find our way back to our ship? <laughs> Just scan. Hey, Paul, where'd you go? Oh, the scan. That's right. There's a ship scan. Okay. The, the ship shows up. Uh -oh. you do still have to kind of be so I have to get the other okay. side of this light, oh. though? How am I going to do that? Oh. Maybe you go? from standing down there? Poke, are you down or up? Oh, I don't know. Oh, here I don't you. know. I don't follow, know. Follow. Oh, there you are. Follow. Oh, I see. Poke is in a crevasse. Wait, can you see this the light? This, this could be a bad crevasse, though. This looks oh. like a bad crevasse. Oh, hey. Yeah, this is a dead <laughs> crevasse. As opposed to a good crevasse? Any shit on the ground? We went like totally the wrong way. Okay. Let me try signaling the moon. You're, that shit's gonna run out of batteries. That's, oh, I have a hundred percent. Um, past this tree, perhaps, we, where we were before. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm past the tree. Well, I. Now you're like mom before going to the airport. Like, how much ba battery percentage do you have? Uh, ninety-eight percent. That's not enough. <laughs> okay, we, you can see where the ship is with a scan. We That's to... not a oh, sentence my mother has ever sent to me. There, though, no? uh oh. Hello, Jerry. We're fine. Uh, but we, uh, Pope, sir? Uh oh. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Uh. Oak! Stir! <laughs> Dead. Look for the bat signal! Guys? Guys! Uh, that's Deadzo? Oh no, alright. What the fuck was that? Uh, oh, shit. I, I don't know why that just made me think of it, circle. but <clears throat> it, was, it was interesting to go from maybe this way. Maybe this way. Alien, maybe this uh, way. Prometheus, and Covenant, and then go back to the okay, original well, Alien. I'm going down to um, this and seeing like some of the differences, uh, uh, I feel like one of the I'm one of the first ship. things that'll pop out at you is like pacing ah, of a I movie from 1979 versus 2000 and whatever the other two are oh, hey, uh, is okay. pronounced. Let's say. He went off in another direction. <laughs> I don't know how he moved this. Here, come over here. You can charge your flashlight in this. You press B to move it. I do feel like uh, so in a lot of the cases, maybe not 100% across the board, but in a lot of the cases, uh, right. the practical Everyone effects this direction? in the original, let's they kind of just look better. And let's I think it's the ships. The ships and the sh the, like when they're using models and harmony. all the tricks they uh, you go low, they employ you to make the models appear, you know, real. It's just very impressive. One thing I think maybe is the alien itself, uh, like when it's like in a, it's sort of like fetal kind of state. I don't know, it didn't look right. <laughs> I, I, my memory of it was that it looked better than it did. Where are you? I think. Where are you? All right, so I'm starting to think maybe if I. I hear you're down, you're down a cliff, man. I'm like right here. Can you see the light? I might just die, guys. You good? <laughs> no. Well. Like, of course not. <laughs> hey, man, we throw some, we're gonna throw some Doritos down there in a small sub. You'll be all right. No all right. <laughs> just, just go on without me. I'm good. If I don't. If you don't hear me in four seconds, I'm dead. Right. Oh, huh? Hey, <laughs> I think I fell down here with you. <laughs> he did too. <laughs> Am I 
drowning? How do I how do I not drown? How do you not how do I not drown? Am I drowning? Yeah, that's another thing I've seen oh. a number of people do. You sort of just oh. fall into these pits and die. Poke's Poke dead. Him. Oh, he's dead! He's dead! He's dead! Well, it's gonna be hey, you in I a second. Poke. He died in the water! How do I get out of here? How do I get out? How do I get, how do I get out? How do I get out of the water? This is the panic. <laughs> it feels like the panic is <laughs> sinking in. I think we're doing yeah. <laughs> uh, I fell down with you and I just it's it's walking around. Oh, god damn it. It's 5 p.m. Uh, ship, this way is the ship. You're going right How are you place. supposed to know where you go? Is there like a right. place to go? Like uh, a building? No, I think you just died. <laughs> I hope they see our two dead bodies Not floating nice. in the water. I, I'm fairly sure I've seen like whole teams like wiped out they, by. They're, they're both down the same ravine. The lack of being able to see combined with one of these pets and just like one after another. And the fun thing too about it is like when you're dead, you can talk to the other people who are dead, like they're like Book and Dream we're doing right now. <laughs> so they're all like saying, "Oh no, here they come! Don't do it! Don't do it!" Um, it's funny on the note of not having people really who play yeah, this sort of game I found that I know that I keep getting like worst planet. a fair number of uh, steam friend requests for some reason I'm not really sure why or how I think maybe it's Fallout 76 related I guess it could be this channel related I don't know I'm kind of not accepting them though because I don't know. <laughs> I'm like weary. I'm weary of doing so. So what you're saying is we did good. Access file. Yes. There are, they're from Williamsburg, Brooklyn. What do you, what do you want, Batman? All right, so what, what's the deal now? We're going, we're looking for... Uh, this is the company. We gotta take all oh, the yeah. stuff we got and put it on the, uh, the counter over there. Okay. Okay. This, this, this place is a mess. So you have more money for next quota, says a chat member. Um, well, actually, no. One of them was from Rust. Uh, somehow. Which I haven't played in a minute. His, the person's name was Restoria.co, which is like the official Restoria website. I, went, I actually went to it. And, uh... He like complimented my profile, which I will admit I did put some, you know, took a day and spent some time and made it look really nice. At least how I like it. My Rust profile, that is. Actually, I finally just changed my name. I, I've been, uh, I've been Pickles McGee on Steam for so long, but, uh... I decided I was finally going to make the change to the librarian Sorry, I, since, you I know, I'm playing all these games and sometimes your name shows up. It's like, it's like a lot more engagement. Yeah, maybe you should turn on a webcam then. Nah, I don't, I don't give a fuck about that. German, my chat said you were doing the Yoinky Sploinky. Yeah, I was. Okay. I'm doing the Yoinky <laughs> Sploinky. It's okay. a very different dance. Uh, we just, we go to the new moon now? New moon? Yes. Or do we do a store? <laughs> new moon? Oh, we, no, we gotta go to the store and buy some stuff. It'll drop it here for us while we're here. We could spot up our, our cabinet. Hey, uh, I feel like, uh... Cookies do we need? No. Um, at I'm least I'm gonna close two. up while I'm in here. We can just stock up 
too. You can get like a bunch. Here, 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 here. Hand, hand me it. Here, here, here. He just he oh. gets he gets loud, and he thinks that's gonna that people are gonna listen when he does that. I let him do it though. It want you want. He moved the computer away. From I already got one walkie talkie. So if you get more. Here. Then he can you put Markiplier in the corner for engagement? <laughs> Just like a realistic Markiplier VTuber that you just have there. And then, like, Mr. Beast smile face. <laughs> Guys, I dealt with Stern. I don't really know much about Markiplier. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Yeah, I very rarely have <laughs> seen Stern, any of his, his stuff. What did you seems buy? like a nice guy, I think. Mr. Beast, on the other hand. <laughs> Gone? Gone. Our stuff is here. Gone. What happened? What'd you buy? Uh, he bought, one. He the bought the song. song. The licensing? <laughs> Did you buy one walkie talkie? Uh -oh. He bought one. There's, there's Dude, a the ship, the ship fucking landed on me. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Here, get him out. Did he die? Yeah, like you did, yeah. Bring the body back to the ship. <laughs> I kind of stepped in. I didn't know what was happening. I just heard a loud noise. I looked up, and it's just bright. <laughs> is he trying to sell? <laughs> what? Yeah. You gotta press the bell a bunch of times. Am yeah. I worried? What about, am I no, worried? I know. I, I know what that does, and I'm not gonna do it. Sorry. What do you mean? I know what happens. Why did it come back twice? That's inefficient. You could have put that in one package. I don't think they want them. They want them. Trust me. Give them a minute. Let them cook. Okay, they... Wait. Wow. Wow. I took them. Yeah, it's gone. Wow, it was just worthless. What? Well, what? So now what? Did they turn me into, like, juice back there? Uh, you guys got... How many walkies are there? What happens to me? Three. Oh, I have... There you go. Monitoring Jerry. Uh, do we want more stuff or you just want to go? We can all this. I think we're good. Maybe one shovel to deal with that parasite thing, but maybe, I don't know. You know what I mean? Maybe one shovel not. while we're here. Yeah. Oh, wait, I'm just, wait, I'm just dead. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not a song I you want in your head. It's like the worst song to have here. This is the song that never ends. Probably that one. Which, fortunately, I don't know well enough to sing it. And oh, they, when they leave, okay. For that reason, right. to go, I'm not going to torture you with it. It's getting a German song. Right? So, um, how do you how do you do this? So you go moons. And then, um, uh oh. Just look the word route. Learn about moons. <laughs> um, rend. Hey, you might have to, like, move me. Dude, when I come back, I can already watch Stop. the Stop. Area. Nice. Right. Hey, you're back. We heard you. Dude, you just oh, got a oh, line of 27. I, I can't. Oh. Ooh, $12. Well, it's, not, it's not moving. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh, thank God. Oh, Alright, we're doing it, we're doing it. That is scary. The cost of the running? route to 61 March is zero. It is currently mild weather on this moon. Is that where we just were or no? No, we were on a different one. That sounds good. Okay. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. How do you use the walkie-talkie? Oh, like this? Uh, top right of your screen has all the buttons in, uh, in turn. Okay. So is it a push to hold or walk push to talk? Anyone get it? You, you, you gotta turn it on, and then you hold the button to talk. And if you don't, okay, you don't okay. Fire. Okay. Over. Okay, over. Try it out. Where's my, where's my one? Frame. Trying it out, over. Uh, hello? Over. Right. Hey, over, you hear me, over? This is under, over. <laughs> So here's the thing. 
What's your vector vector? Oh, come on, what am I missing here? My flashlight is still somewhere in that place where we died. Yeah, I got to I got I hate it when it's so picky like this. What's trouble do? Um, I don't know what like what can you actually um, I think I might need to. Like that thing that killed Germa or Vinny? The eye the head thing. One of you guys take it. I'll be the no, melee no, fighter. No, yeah, no, did, you can have that. The moon? I'll be the melee um, fighter. I, I, I pressed it and then something happened, but I don't know what's okay, going on. Come on, man. Uh-huh. Oh. I'll be the melee top. fighter. All right, all right. And make sure you guys charge the more items right you have, the less inventory you have for, for valuables. So, I'll, 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 okay, I'm going to put the flashlight down. So okay, I, I have a flashlight and I don't have a walkie. Mm -hmm, I have a walkie, mm -hmm, no flashlight, mm -hmm. and the shovel. How, uh, hazard level B. Right. So what's what's better? The uh, is the two better with the shovel or the three? The the whirlwind spin. What do you mean? Hey, don't, all, don't go down there guys, it's a, oh, they're dead. <laughs> oh my I'm glad I didn't jump down there. <laughs> it's, it's, that was not me and you this time. <laughs> hey, uh I say you guys fell down over. I see a dead body over. Oh, they actually <laughs> dead. <laughs> they dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we didn't He's last really fast. We didn't even last ten seconds. <laughs> oh my fucking god! All right, well, can we at least go get like a, like a right. burrito on the ground or something. Like okay, okay, we're thing. doing good. So um, just speed run it five seconds. Okay. That's a lot of money. Oh, like put this out of the way somewhere. <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. Mm -hmm. What the fuck's that? Mm -hmm. Poke, help, poke! It's a... It's me, it's oh. No, 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 there's bats everywhere. I'm sorry, I'm, I, I, I have my high blood pressure. I can't play this game. <laughs> <laughs> it's just me. Uh, timer. All right, all right, all right, all right. Mm -hmm. so we just gotta get like one thing, something valuable. Whoa. What the, what the heck? What is it? It's weird. What's weird? I don't like it. Be careful. There's, a, there's like bombs in here. Uh, uh, on the one hand, I do kind of want Poke to die yeah, so that Jerma, who's oh, scared God, of this game, is left alone by himself. Because that has potential Shouldn't for amusement. I will admit. Uh, it's funny too because these are horn. both people, Poke and Jerma, who I enjoy watch playing scary games because oh, they're both so terrified by them. Which I do enjoy. There's one that Poke plays here. called uh, Voices in the Void, which I really like. It, it's actually it's a game, despite the fact that it looks oh kind of creepy and unnerving. It's one that I actually want to play. But it's oh, not like it. nice. Okay, it's we like, actually have. Stuff. It's not even early access. Well, I guess it kind of is. Like it's not on Steam. They're gonna be so proud of us. I don't know if it's free or like how you get your hands on it. Watch out for those bugs. Which I'm not 100 percent averse to. Like on this channel okay. is a okay. uh, Cataclysm Dark Can Days Ahead. Uh, pounds. Forty-five pounds. Playthrough. Yeah, it's a For example, <laughs> if you know anything of that game, oh, wait, that hurts you. you got, you're gonna have to do some work to play it. I was seeing what happened. <laughs> Sorry, I, I played okay. Dwarf Fortress before it was on Steam, for example. Back in the day, so I'm not averse necessarily <laughs> to non-Steam. Uh -oh. You're gonna have to work a little to play the game games. <laughs> One of the issues, well, I guess it's the same yeah, with the other ones, but one of the issues is it definitely failure. seems like a game where you need like a guide. <laughs> Either a written guide or someone to actually help you.
What the hell was that? It's so funny they, they died the same way we died. It's so funny. <laughs> Dude, there was like an animal in here for a second. That was weird. All right, so now we're profitable. How, 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 is, how, is profitable. how did you make more money than us? Doesn't make any sense. Now you guys need to step it up. <laughs> hey, we, yeah, it turns out you can't swim. Yeah, yeah we got two oxygen tanks on our back, and we can't survive underwater for more than three seconds. I was one second away from hitting you with the shovel. <laughs> I was about to hit him with the shovel. Why is this fat not okay. I definitely should not have this because I'm going to comedy oh. hit somebody and it's going to be bad for everything. Can you recharge okay. health in between uh, missions? I don't know, actually. Uh, I think you do automatically. I think when we land, mm -hmm. you your health will be back. Lovely, lovely. Yeah, I profusely apologize. Profusely? I mean, it's okay. Just check your uh, DMs I sent you. Let me see. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, dude. Make sure all your stuff is charged. You can sleep in the bunk if you're injured, says a chat member. Oh. Oh, what? There's a, there's a bunk? You can sleep on the bunk. Bunk? Wait, really? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna grab a walkie-talkie. I'm gonna stay behind and give you guys advice <laughs> from here. Because I don't have a flashlight. I prefer right a so city talking myself, be but... Your guide. Okay. Needs oh, must the, sometimes. Did you heal the Alright, this side's on. easier. I, I can't heal. I don't know, I can see yeah, through. I don't know what to do with yeah. this oh, maybe the chat member lied. Shit, now I feel, I actually feel really bad about hitting you now. It's, it's, it's a scratch, man. It's just, okay. Yeah. It's you want to hit Tis me? but a scratch. <laughs> I have had a desire <laughs> recently to do a, some sort of Monty Python, uh, watching. What's happening? Maybe Life whoa, 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 of Brian, though. That was weird. What? Is it quicksand? What was that? That was weird. That's when I don't oh, think I could quicksand. or would try to convince the missus to watch. Uh, it said rainy, it didn't say flooded. Where's Vinny? You know what, uh, I was talking before about that feeling of showing your friend, you know, your favorite on Doughboys it was restaurant, but like your favorite movie or whatever and the feeling of them not liking it. I do have a very early memory of trying to show friends uh, Monty Python and them not liking it <laughs> and being like devastated as a strong word, but definitely disappointed. And sort of from then on, really being a little more picky about what I share with whom. It's, it's kind of easy with the misses just because, you know, you live with someone for long enough, you spend enough time with someone, and you can pretty much tell what they're gonna like and what they're not gonna like, based on, you know, dozens and hundreds and thousands of hours of experience. It certainly helps. It's not gonna be foolproof, but, yeah, more than a, more than a stranger, obviously. Uh, so what we often do <laughs> is, uh, when trying to decide what movie to watch, is I'll make a list of potentials, and then she'll choose from it. We occasionally do it the other way around, where she makes the lists, but she's not as good. <laughs> she's not as good at it. I think it's because I'm choosing movies that I think she might like. And she choo she's choosing movies that she knows she oh, will shit. like. <laughs> Not necessarily ones that she thinks I will like. So. You okay? <laughs> what the hell, man? Oh. Oh. Uh, with the alien ones, that was Good definitely work. like my choice. Um, and asked, uh, basically that, said along the lines of, I'm gonna... Anything? I want to watch this new one, but then I also want to rewatch all the old ones, sort of before I do. If you'd care to join me in this uh, uh, this journey, I would, you know, it would make me happy, but you don't have to. What? 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 
And if she had said no, totally understandable. Not everyone's going to want to watch every Alien movie. She's only ever seen the first one, which I was surprised by. I don't think you had your walkie-talkie on. You want to put the loot bring the loot outside because that bug might come take our shit. Hmm. I'm looking forward to the second one. Aliens. That's I, I think that's my favorite one. It's they say that, you know, the first one's sort of more a horror movie than it is an action movie. Whereas the second one is more an action movie than it is a horror movie, which I think is very accurate. I have a shovel, not a machine gun. So, giant spider, machine gun. Hey, I, I don't know. How big is it? I thought how you picked that thing up. That thing must have been like 300 pounds. Should I attack this thing? Do, it, do whatever you feel is best. I don't know Scan what's it. best. Scan it. You got a walkie? I do have a walkie. Bunker Scan spider. It. Call it in. Call it in. Hey, uh, Vinny or Poke, I've got a bunker spider down here in the bunker, and I just want to know if you could look that up and let me know where I should hit this motherfucker. <laughs> Say the whole oh, thing again. On. You want me to repeat the whole thing? <laughs> hey, anyone there? Yeah, yeah, over here. There's a bunker spider down here. Hey, there's a bunker spider oh. over here. I'm not see oh, okay. <laughs> That's one of the fucking bullshit ones where I'm not seeing anything and I just accidentally finish it. Did I hit it? Is it dead? I think it said you if you piss it off, it gets pissed type shit. Hey, 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 careful there, monster. Hey, put the light on it for a second. Hey, hey, bunker spider, I got my mom on the phone. You got anything to say? Got my mom on the phone. Anything you gotta say? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Why was he saying his mom was on the phone? Holy shit. Oh my god, I've never seen that. Uh, I think that's one of the one of the games and, and you see this more and more now where it has the ability to turn off um, spiders for people with arachnophobia. Yeah, yeah, pretty nice. But they uh, they offer that. It's not not a thing I particularly suffer right, from. I'm getting, I'm getting a grab from. But, uh, but for those who sometimes. do, you know why not? I I, it's not working. Just, just whack it. You have to whack it. Wait, no, I think I have it. You got killed by the quicksand. <laughs> it's probably not possible <laughs> universally in every game, and, but. Um, I was trying to avoid the locust, and there's quicksand. Oh, that's why you weren't responding. <laughs> Okay, because we were trying to talk yeah, to you through the walkie. Yeah, this like, hey, game gives me a hand cramp. Hey, that's so funny. Which doesn't make sense. Like, I'm not even holding down the, uh, <laughs> the mouse key. <laughs> you can toggle it on and off. You can hold it. But you can also toggle it. Like, there is no way you are dead to them. Like, it's impossible. Let me try the shovel. Because how could I be? They are just hitting me in the head over and over. I ain't going to wake up from this. This is like it. If I wasn't dead, this I'm like a, like a break room. You just take out all your frustration. What happened to this place, anyways? Oh, I guess that's a little wonder, and, and, it, and it actually does where, usually explain if you pay attention. Well, like, why is why why does this happen to this aquarium? That's so funny. This game is insane. This game is outrageous. Yeah, it's, it's really good. Outrageous. Yeah, there's the, the spider right there. The, the rest of the compound's behind him. What do you think Vinny's doing? <laughs> Wait. Hey, Vinny, what are you doing? I can't, I can't help him. You there? <laughs> Are you able to clear the web with the shovel? Oh, uh, they probably just think you don't know that the walkie-talkie's off or something, right? Yeah, because that happened to me earlier. <laughs> I was trying to talk to you guys, and your walkie-talkies were off. Oh my god, why would he do that? <laughs> it doesn't like that. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out! <laughs> Are you good? <laughs> you made it up? Hmm, I love a man doing yeah, a, yeah, uh, a high-pitched screen. 
Is the is it ever not amusing? I suppose it. This hey, possibility is it's not, but those are rare. Yeah. I'm getting past like leave. You, uh, we, you we got good. A back here. We can't see shit. Okay, it's the left. I'm gonna run to the right. I'm going for it. Are you sure? Here. Are you sure? Uh, should I keep the walkie? Do you want it? Here, take me. Yeah, the running animation is so funny. Good luck. Both to leave early, so that way they have to leave. <laughs> he didn't move. He got. He got by it. He got through it. Wow. Hello? Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm half done. I think we'll, uh, I'll be able to finish this today. I don't think he is either. So this is Muckingham 3. And then there's Muckingham 4, which that'll probably, uh, we'll do that next episode. Also gonna die in the of whatever these are. Yeah, let's go back to that. What, what could I call these? Alright, folks, going for it. Let's see. <sighs> Relaxing Wait, game going back. Going back. and stream. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Stream laxing, Urs. Maybe there's a clumsy like portmanteau like of some sort yeah, you can come up with. Oh, God, isn't he? Uh. <laughs> Media. <laughs> Consumption. It's right there. It's right there. That's the quick dance. What? <laughs> uh, oh wait, react. What they they call this react content. Uh, R and R. What? Re react and relaxation. Oh yeah. Okay. There's something there. Reason why he wasn't reactalization so fucking early uh, from the exact same way you did yep. uh, it a coup. and now stir has no idea stir thinks you're completely safe he's gonna do the exact same thing on his way back yep he's gonna go straight to the quicksand just like i did and you did oh <laughs> is this the one that i <laughs> was talking about maybe it was what is this, like, new like i i, I i've seen clips of a lot of these kind of games and maybe this is one that i saw clips of he might pull this off but he's probably just gonna die to the quicksand yeah he might not make it out of the building though what time is it in the game kind of fucking sucks ship leaving in one hour oh wait Oh, so he's gone. Yeah. Oh no. Ah! Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh, you both, you died? Yeah. <laughs> there's so, a... uh, stir, there's yeah. quicksand. Yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. Yeah, that's how me and Poke died. They both died the Did same, you, same you didn't exact get way. Back. No, Not I tried to walk it back. I walked slow walk and I just drowned. I did it my nose, and then that happened. And now we got this big streak here. Well, let's just go to the easy level and just go pick up a bunch of, like, tea kettles. We can make, we can make, we can easy day. We have to get 200 from this place. Get that finger out of my face. We can do it. We can do it. We just grab a bunch of quick stuff. Quick mission in and out, five minutes. Yeah, um, all okay. We're all gonna sprint together. We're all gonna run and pick up this stuff, run back and pause it. That's it. Yes. Yes. That's it. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't sound convinced. Don't do anything fancy. Just run in and run out. Oh, we have to take off. Or do we? Re re relaxing reacts number uh, I and then I put the number and then in what brackets the <laughs> well I'd want the game okay power wash simulator re relaxing relax and then in brackets whatever we watch Power oh, wash simulator, relaxing, and then I'll make a playlist of relaxing, relaxing. Relax. I think is here. 
Yeah, one thing I do put some some <laughs> time and effort into is well, I guess it's not surprising if you've been listening, uh, is the playlist on the channel. So everything's like neat and organized. All long play series are in their own playlist. There's a, uh, a clip playlist, clips for me <laughs> playlist. Those are like clips that, you know, for myself that others might not find interesting, but I would. There's a relaxing rust playlist, actually. There's a sleepy tunes. Which has got some of my music on it, my okay, song right, attempts. I poke him with you. Hey. Okay, broke. Up with you. <laughs> Scooby Is that Luigi? Yeah. It's about Luigi. He's not gonna hurt us. Wait, who are you talking about? What about the Oh god, wait. I got a ta I got a Ooh. Okay, well, we need stuff. This is do or die. Here, Vinny, come on. Vinny. Yeah. Vinny, 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 yeah, come on. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Do or die. Okay, okay. Oh, God damn it. You just work. Three, two, three, two, three. Oh, my God, you're crazy. Yes. You're stalling. I'm not going to get to the spider. Hey, watch out, boys. I got myself a shovel. Let's go, motherfucker. <laughs> Where is he? Uh, <laughs> no jokes. This is for the company or do or die. Yeah. Ah! Oh, sh <coughs> no jokes. Yeah. Shouldn't have said that. We have to go. Now it's going to be all you jokes. Break these on the left. What's that? Whoa! What's that? Uh, it's a, hey. He's coming, he's coming, okay. Uh, ceiling. The floor. <laughs> Alright, what's the what's the trick with ceiling? Just this one? Oh, uh, is this the longest? We supposed yeah. to run. He's really hurt. I hit him I whacked him in the head. That was go like crazy. This one actually works better the further away you are. I will finish his job. At least bring the sign back and get like four bucks. It's right. actually, I think, a good good move here. See how quick we're doing it. It's nice knowing you guys. Where are you? Hello? I don't know where I am. I'm stuck in a web. I'm stuck in a web. Luigi. Stuck in a web. I killed it. I killed it. No, no, I did. I, hey, that. Excuse me. I. They can't hear me. I'm a fucking ghost. I did all the work. I did all the work. That was me that did that. <laughs> I have a fucking ghost. You got him. You got him. One, one hit in the head. I was told that he's really easy. Uh, I feel like all these games I, I, I the should have a mechanic that, you know that I mean? when, you're when you're dead, the ability to watch is cool. But I feel like they should all have some sort of mechanic where you should be able to, like, subtly influence what's going on. Like, subtly help in some way. So that even if you are dead, you can contribute. Like, what would it be be a good one for this one? Uh, highlight loot. So you die, and then you go find loot. Still, you can't pick it up. You can't interact with it. But you can like sort of ping it, so that others can then find it. Yeah, there you go. That's just off the top of my head, so. Okay, okay. I feel like that's well, working. Like ten more of those. Sort of. Hey, dude, you're gonna play WWE 2K23. Feeling a little heavy. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. This area is clear. <laughs> That's a weird thing to ask. 
such a specific range. I did. Where is it? Oh god. Do you think that's someone who works for WWE? Asking on behalf. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, just imagine this in real life. Like, this is what they're saying in real life. This is Jim Shovel Man. The company fires us after this. Hey, I enchanted it with my soul. Plus five damage. Oh! <laughs> you missed the key. You're fired. Yeah, Scorn was Man, ridiculous. I'm gonna. Well, look. Scorn. <laughs> I have, uh. Coming up in not too long. Uh, Scorn entered my first attempt at ASMR. Of course, I did it for the video game Scorn. As soon as the uh, Fallout 4 long play series is done, I am pretty sure that, you know, yeah, that that is what happens next is that, that episode. Yeah. Life or death? Holding that shit in. I went to see Oppenheimer. I think we're doing. I held a fart for like three hours. Because <laughs> I didn't need another bomb to go off. In the There's another one. That's not a joke. That's real. Another fighter? Dude, it's. I. Are you are one of those non public farters, huh? What's that noise? Do you hear this? I mean. I do. I don't see it. Yeah, for the most part. Yes. <laughs> I don't know. Let's, let's get out of here. I feel like this is a crazy Okay, so this this one I th feel like overall it does good, but it's definitely leaves some spots. So. What is it? So let's maybe switch it. I'm thinking I need a new job. What was it? What was it? I don't know. I've never seen it. There's there's one of those fuckers on the ceiling right here though. Pick or something. Oh. Wow, what a fucking chat. Holy shit, he, he's killing everything. Oh man, I don't know, it had like this big circular toothy face. I think it's straight I think it's straight this way. Wait, did we come from here? Uh, mm -hmm. yeah, I feel like we've been everywhere. Ceiling shark do 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 do. Well, okay, do, 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 do. They don't have much time, though. I think no. probably another. Are you gonna carry the big thing? Or... Oh my god! I'm so jumping down. That's you. It's me. It's me. Mm, the ceiling's gotta be almost done. <laughs> we could save the company. Whoop. No, 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 no. What is that? What? 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 The blob, the blob monster coming. Oh, blob. Okay, we gotta find the fire exit. <laughs> the blob always sort of reminds me of a uh, gelatinous cube a little dollars. bit. Oh, yeah. this will save like it's the whole slow, yeah, it's but it can, you know, back you in a corner and you're in trouble. Oh, God. And then left. Oh, God. And then, oh, crap. Okay. They box themselves um, in over here. Um, I should have dropped the key for one of the other, other items. Oh, oh, I don't like this noise, man. Blob is following them. I'd oh, much no. rather do a... Oh, yeah, let's do no. this thing. Uh, do I mean, a floor than a ceiling. The murder pile is left. I don't know, something yeah. about a ceiling that does not oh, appeal as much. Nice. We're all, we're all, we're all okay. tired. They're almost there. They're almost home free. All right, let's make it back. We How might much, be able to save this. How much time do they have? Probably just, um... Three weeks oh, it's now, nighttime, it's though. Night. Yeah, I'm gonna drop a key. Good. Oh, they're so close. I'm 84 pounds. Oh no. Remember, there's uh, there's bolts by the <laughs> the fire exit. One I don't think I have a single picture of myself in anything like, like one of these things God, where you stick your head. Is it that way? And that's oh, disappointing yeah, to me. Oh, Not one oh, in there. my entire Can life. All right, throw it on the bucket list. Come on. Nice. Oh, that's good. Value 52. Dude, that's not bad. Okay, okay. 27, oh. 26. Yeah. Okay, I'm going back to the bolt. Oh, hell yeah. 
that, uh, that might just be enough if oh, if Sturt can get that. <laughs> this is this is risky. Uh, yeah, no, I'm just gonna grab the bolts and we probably gotta go. It's not gonna be enough time. He's gonna get sniped by one of the monsters. Uh, man, I can't believe we're gonna get fired on like quota two. We don't have enough money. Actually, we need forty dollars. <laughs> that sucks. We need forty dollars. That's too much. Stir better make it. Keep Is that stir dead? Come on, stir. I mean, oh, no, the fate of the ocean. company depends on you right now making it to the beginning ship. of a mission, and then they just left. Come on. Oh, oh my god. No. It's within reach. Oh my god. I, if I don't make it, I'm gonna scream. Oh no! no. <laughs> get on! Get on! Oh my god! He made it! Oh my god, he actually got on. Wow. Sir, we made it! Oh my god. Oh wow. <laughs> Dude, that was Claps. insane. I've oh never seen a like that in the, my life. The train started going, I just grabbed the ladder. That was Sir, unbelievable. That was Holy that shit, dude. Both of you. Both of you were incredible. Sir. Yeah. That was but, but unbelievable. Sir, that was a movie. <laughs> that was a movie. You both saved us. You saved the company. You saved the ship. You saved our careers. Mm, that's the one thing I would feel like I would have trouble finding the motivation. I think somebody uh, is gonna you know, get trying to uh, risk my life for a giant corporation. Wow, I can get half of like a donut. Even even in a game. Let's <laughs> go. What are you what are you lackeys doing? I've done enough work. We were all all right. I'll like do it. Okay. How many did you put on the poke? Most kills? Oh man, I killed so many you. you got like four kills. That was... <laughs> I had to run back to Jerma's body to get the shovel. What did I say? Uh, die? <laughs> what do I type in? Uh, you go to moons, and then it's the top one, the uh, base. Uh, uh, company building? Whatever it is. You guys missed yeah, the company. during the chaos, but a fucking sandworm from Dune almost ate him as he jumped onto the ship. I saw that. It was yeah, crazy. On the ladder, why on you, as you jumped on the ladder, you should have died. Is what I'm saying. You should have yeah, died. Let me check the clip. Someone. It was it a Dune sandworm or a Beetlejuice sandworm? I think it was closer it to a Beetlejuice to sandworm. Like an that was or like a actually, probably closer to a Graboid. You should have died. Yeah, you should have died. Sandworm, a Dune sandworm was like the size of a ship. I just want to live, man. I hear you, brother. I just want to live. I just want to do my own thing. I don't want to be beholden to anyone. We'll take care of it. You, you, I take a load off for a little while. <sighs> One day, right? Because you're gonna have, you're gonna have to do that exact same thing in like ten minutes. Running away from. I would retire. Should we keep tomorrow? I would retire today. I would retire. Yes, I would have retired when I was born. actually signed up for you know and it's not so much okay well let me just tell you first i signed up for like the automatic uh, i don't know if they have this everywhere but they do in ontario where you can just sort of automatically be in every uh, lottery draw so I, I did it for Lotto Max, which is like our. I think that's the national uh, lottery. Like we have uh, Lotto 649 here in Ontario. 
which I think is just Ontario based, I want to say. But then there's Lotto Max, which I think is the whole country. Um, so I, I, I su subscribed, I guess you would say. I actually did that yesterday. And it's not so much with the thought of, oh yeah, I'm going to win the lottery. Oh, yeah, that's great. It's so that I can picture what would happen if I win the lottery and live that sort of fantasy vicariously almost. It sort of aids in that. It's a weird thing. I know. Does what I'm saying make sense at all? I don't know. I actually did win the lottery once. Um, it was probably early 20s. I don't think I was still a teen. And I won like uh, almost $6,000 I think it was, if I do recall. Uh, and the weird thing about it... Well, that's weird in itself. But the weird thing about it was like I dreamt that I won the lottery yeah, I think we're fine. and then I won the lottery Where's yeah How can we find it? that's weird right that didn't even count for anything. Zero. I am uh, sort of <laughs> in general <laughs> very much like, sure like just in terms of like things that you can you know be lucky at like games of chance and just like weird little coincidences and stuff like that I, I find I am very lucky like just actual, my luck stat is, is actually high. I feel like. Yeah, things that would be affected by my luck stat in a video game. Where did the bolts go? They already sold. Sell the shelf. Which is nice. <laughs> Uh, that's saying, you know, it's better to be lucky than good. I kind of actually believe that. That's what happened. Oh, so you died or something. But I was on the ship. I think the cutscene was... Oh, okay. Well, I get it. Oh, he did die? Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, we, we, we all know how to play now. Yeah, now I'm very aware of how the game is played. Have you gone to the other planets or no? Uh, I've never made it past like the first three. Yeah. I want to get there. Yeah, no, like how far can you go in this? Uh, I haven't seen like. Do I don't even know if you call it like okay, end game like content. I guess maybe some of it have like when you can get a teleporter. I know. All right, are we done in this room? Oh wow, I think we are. Huh. It ejects you. I uh, don't normally get it in one go without having a check. Uh, Happy with do that? Do we all get ejected? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. 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 This is cool. Okay, let's do it again. Welcome to your first day. Up. I'm ready. This is your very own auto Yeah, well, you're ready this time. You, you know the things. I know not to go in quicksand. Oh, you guys, come on. Chill. Make yourself at home. Chill, guys. You will want to check the instruction manual to assign you to your ship's computer terminal. Oh, yeah, you, you mooning us? Um, I just went to experimentation. What's this music? Great asset. You guys keep typing in the moon, and then you ever land the ship. But well, we want the person that's the leader to pull the lever. I think we've so much, clearly. The weather for experimentation is stormy. Don't go there. Uh-oh. Well, did we really just... Holy shit. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm ready. What? If I die, I'm ready. <coughs> oh, because of uh, electricity, right, yeah. So if you're holding anything metal, you'll uh, get hit, struck by lightning. <laughs> I think there's like a warning though. Like I think you can like, at least I saw somebody do it once. You like pick up something metal, run for a bit, you're warned somehow about the lightning, you put it down. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, the other thing I've been uh, thinking about 
with regards to these recordings um, is what other games I should play. Like I've got the Muckingham Palace. Um, I've had the DLCs in my uh, on my wish list for a long time, waiting for them to be on sale. But you know, I'm not averse to just buying them. Uh, but then after that, I'm not sure. Uh, I do have uh, some ideas for relaxing games or sort of grindy games. I don't even know how you would describe it. Um, internet, internet cafe simulator is what I have. I feel like that would be a good one. Maybe one of those pop one, uh, pot ones, pot shop simulator. There's nothing in here. Hobo simulator. A lot of simulators, apparently. There's nothing in this. There's nothing here. You could do like driving, like the truck driving ones. I've, I've never played any of those. They kind of don't look like I would like them, but I don't know. Maybe they would suit for this. Okay. Well. I mean, <laughs> lightning that kills you if you're holding metal things. Uh, I feel like that's a little What's concerning. Wrong? Rockwell's being picky. You know how I feel about that. I'm doing all right. I'm okay. I'm just gonna get up this thing. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, all right. We got all our. We got everything. Items. That's everything. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. This is good. I think we're ready to leave this one. Is that the best you can do? Is that the best you can do? Oh. See, sometimes you, you just gotta look at things from. But that's a good life that's advice. You well. Sometimes you just gotta look at things from a different Sweet angle. God. Are these all the? It's just Ed Harris. I challenge you. Cool, <laughs> cool. Cool. All right, I'm good. Uh, is that a poke gun? Where's poke? Light switch is behind the shelf. Oh God! All right, I, I um, got it. I got it. All right. Uh, I am might be not. dead. Really? No, he's moving, he's moving. He looks like it says puke. Oh, that's just fun. Oh, hey, are poke. we going back for more? Uh, well, I think we, uh, we no, got a lot, go, right? Let's go. I think we're good. We're going to yeah, you know already from that. Ha ha. Good call. Ha ha ha. Doesn't it feel good when, like, everyone lives? Yeah, it's my first time. Hey, get inside. I am inside. 151 value of everything. Pretty good. Why the door is open? Oh. It's a, uh, what do they call that? Horsefish? Uh, Seahorse? <laughs> Horsefish. Yeah, 
I bet you there's a fish called the horsefish. Uh, seahorse. It's one of those. Uh, is it the only one where it's the the male that gives birth? And is it universal of all seahorses, or is it just like a certain species? These are the questions. I have. Am I a, mean, a marine biologist? A little bit. Boris. Boris. I, am I mean, no. Is that Dreamer doing the hay? That's a good impression of the uh, the scientist. <laughs> that's one of my uh, of the long plays I've done. That's, those are maybe my favorite ones, and seemingly somehow well liked as well. Half Life ones. I've done Half Life one and two so far. Um, they're all in playlists on the channel, of course. Um, and that was me. I think that was his Yoda impression. I think I'll probably go over there and then work my way back. And uh, I do plan on doing the rest of them. I think what I'm going to do, because I looked into uh, like how long. There's a, there's a website, I, I, I think I always type how long to beat, but I think it, the website's actually called, called something else. That will sort of tell you, you know, roughly how long it takes to beat uh, whatever video game you search up on the site. <laughs> and um, Half-Life 2 Episode 1 and Half-Life 2 Episode 2 have sort of a comparable light uh, length to Half-Life, you know, one and two. Like if you if you play them together, so I'll probably do that. And then of course I'll play Half-Life Three, which I'm really looking forward to playing. That just came out yesterday, so it'll be fun. <laughs> um, but seriously, but seriously, folks. Uh, I played Half-Life Alex. It's yeah. one of the most incredible video all. game experiences I've ever had in my life. Uh, definitely the best VR experience I've ever had. But I, I w like, I feel like it would be tricky to record it. I think it went down this way. It's quiet down here. Hmm. Maybe it would be, maybe it wouldn't be. Can you, no. Uh, I was gonna say, could you play it? Probably not that game. Some games you can play oh, okay, both in and out of VR, but uh, I, I don't think with that game it would be possible, or definitely not desirable and probably not possible. All right, clownfish. See, I'm a marine biologist. I told you. Let's see if I can name all the fish. Angelfish, I think. Oh yeah, these jumps I don't like the looks of ever. I uh nothing even here. I was gonna say famously. <laughs> but to who? Uh I famously do not like platforming in games. Makes my hands sweaty. Maybe it's my dislike of heights. Transferring over. I have a sort, or at least what I think is maybe sort of a weird fear of heights in that. Like I can go up on a super tall building and look down, 
you know, uh, looking down from a plane, down. that doesn't bother me. But if I'm on like a fucking three step step ladder, <laughs> then I really don't like it. Your legs start to shake. What way? So I'm like a medium, I'm scared of medium heights, not super heights. That's weird, right? Maybe it's not, I don't know. Just seems weird. Are we running by this? <clears throat> okay. Someone by chance said don't look in the eye. Oh, some, some, somebody, something happened. Uh, there's people getting killed in here. Oh, this is locked. I think it is. Oh my god, oh my god, it's an Enderman! It's an Enderman! It's an Enderman! Don't look at it! Don't look at it! Enderman! Oh my god, it's an Enderman! Don't look at him! Oh! <laughs> that was a good death sound. Whoa! <laughs> I haven't heard many better death sounds than that. What? Did I fall through? Top tier, top tier Holy death zone. Right. What happened to me? I walked off the uh, ledge. Dermot. Dermot. <laughs> Dermot. Hey, Dermot. <laughs> oh, shit. Comes the copium. Hell, I do it too. I'm sure. Yeah, I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna talk about how I fought the monster, and I found a, I found like a, a sign or a shovel in the ground, and it was so insane. I was like jumping around. And I hit it five times, and then I ran into another room. What the hell is that? <laughs> Uh, isn't this one of the games, uh, some of these games now, and I, I really want to know about, like, the mechanics of it, but they have, like, mimics, so, like, if someone dies, then it, like, spawns in someone who looks just like the person who died, which, that's cool right there, but I think some of the games even go so far as to... It like records so like pissed. snippets of the person's voice <laughs> and then like plays it back. That's insane if so. the pumpkin. You got punished by the lightning god. <laughs> I was just so scared. Oh, they're not real. Lovely, lovely. Does that teleporter? I've seen it in action a little you have to bit. Make up a monster attack. It, like if you're alive <laughs> and you teleport it back, I'm fairly sure that if you're carrying anything, it comes back with you, which is great. Right but what if you're dead? Like does it bring back the things that were on your body? Got me times. Oh, did you scan it? I don't think I scanned it, but I got I got fucked up by it pretty badly. Oh man. That was rough. That was really yeah, rough. I was up way too early in this morning. So that, that Enderman thing was looking at me, and I turned and looked the other way. Yeah, to get I find on the weekends. And another monster was in the hallway. I often so I by that don't monster. sleep well. And at that point, I was just surrounded. So I, I banged and right as fast as I could. 
the reason and that I think that jump happens jump is ground, because I don't want to waste a goddamn second of the weekend. So I have like so many things I want to do. Oh, there he is. Yeah, in every level. He's somewhere. Um, yeah, so because I wanted to, you know, record this, I got other things I want to do. And because when it comes to the weekend, every goddamn second counts. I find that, like, I'll wake up. And I'll see, for example, this morning is 2.30 in the morning. Yeah, there was a gap in the floor that we were running around. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> and, what did you, say? you know, consciously I realize, okay, I really do shouldn't be getting up now. I should go back to sleep. Yeah, I think you should get some. You know, this is ridiculous. Way too early to be getting up. Oh, no, because we haven't spent money. But then. Parts of my brain are like, yeah, but you want to do this, you want to do this, you want to have fun, and then you got to work tomorrow, and you won't be able to do this, this, and this. So if you don't do it today, you won't be able to do it. Get it done, get it done, get it done. And every once in a while, I can fight through that and go back to sleep. But a lot of the times, there's this feeling I get. It's the feeling of, okay. There's no way I'm getting back to sleep. I may as well get back up. I should potentially try to ignore that thought. But I can't always do that. <laughs> I'm not strong enough to do that. That's, I think, one of the other reasons that I have this dream of retiring. It's because if I remove that feeling of, oh, okay, well, you don't have to work tomorrow, so take your time, sleep in a little bit, why don't you? I'd probably be healthier, because they do say, you know, I'm not getting enough, fuck, he really does that voice good. <laughs> what was I saying? He distracted me. Yeah, they do say, you know, not sleeping enough. That's gonna the kill you. What's in there? I don't know, not sure. What's wrong? <laughs> I just sort of zoned out there for a bit. And then my other issue is I'm like incapable of napping. And I think it's kind of for the same reason. It feels like I'm like wasting, I'm wasting time where I could be doing fun things. I heard a weird noise. It was like a like a bigger cracking noise. There's something poking here. There's something straight ahead here. Are you sure? Yeah, oh, I'm positive. What the hell was that? That's uh probably one of the main differences between the misses and I. She will sleep and sleep and sleep and sleep. We're in here. Four of us. Uh, in this door right here, there's a monster behind you. Uh, on the weekends, like, I don't know what it is. getting up at, you know, 2 o'clock in the afternoon is not at all unusual. <laughs> Whereas I am up at 2, th two in, the, in the morning, she's up at 2 in the afternoon. It actually works out, though, because it gives me time to do stuff like this yeah. guilt-free of, What's the deal you know, I could be hanging out with the missus, but I'm doing this. this There's virtually 0% of the time when I am recording a long play or stuff like this or doing any D&D or anything where, uh, like, I, I'm doing almost 100% of the time while she is asleep anyway, so it's not like we could be hanging out. And I, I do that on purpose. Okay. I trust you. Like one time I I do do something uh, is Tuesdays after work. Every other Tuesday I have D and D. Which would be normally be time where we hang out together, but Tuesdays she goes to the gym, so Oh. Where'd Benny go? Oh. Tank frame. <laughs> I 
thought you told me to come. Oh! Oh, God so damn it, man. Vinny, you literally walked around that door. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Kind of yeah, ignored is, the round ones, it. apparently. Um... I have a key, but I don't know. Moving, grooving, what percent are we at? 80? Oh, wow. Let's find a door. Let's see. <sighs> yeah, what do we have left? Yeah, oh, shit. Just this. As well. How long is this going to be? Four right, hours and long. change? All right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, good. Yep, I'm ready. Come on, come on, come on. And it looks like... Hmm, what am I going to do when, when I'm done? I think I'll probably oh, do right. some... Uh, well, it's 76 and it's a double XP weekend. And I really do want to get to 300. Because I want a legendary perk for my endurance. My endurance is currently like, is it two or one? It's very low. Needless to say. Which, not too much of an issue, but there's been times where it would be nice to have some points on it. I've already saved up enough perk points to do uh, two levels as well. Uh, so that means i got to decide what perks to put in. Currently I have the... I forget what it's called, but it's... If you're fully fed, you get a better bonus than you would otherwise. Two points on that. Bingo. So I'm thinking I might do either a fireproof or two. Really? I don't know. I gotta sort of play around with it. What else is in here? I'm too, I, I have a uh, saying all this as if you know, but you may not. I have a good commando build, sneaky commando build. On the floor in this strange David Lynchian room. I can't pick that up. Hold on. Okay. Okay, we're gonna find the exit. And I have a. Uh, we're all very heavy. Uh, fixer with uh, explosive. Uh, max ammo, or okay. sorry, three hundred percent ammo, one. whatever they call it, and uh, reduced vats. Twenty-five percent reduced vats. It's, to me, I think, the best fixer I could hope for is this combination. And then when it comes it? to uh, armor, I've got a full set of Secret Service armor. Uh, shielded, deep pocketed, and like sort of perfectly how I want. It, I got a lot of over... I think I've got was it, three or overeaters. Okay, I'll take the bottle. Um, there's, there's up there. Some are like the they sneaky ones. I've got, I've got a chameleon on the chest one, so I'm like really hard to hear, or hard to see. Like, I could, I could and have like been hidden directly in front of the Scorch Beast Queen on more than one occasion, and she like can't see me. Almost nothing can. There's a few things that even if I'm right in front of them, they can't see me. I somewhat recently got one of each magazine. That felt good. I like collecting in games like that. Uh, I've got all the, the monster cards. Those are eight of them, I think. I've been debating sort of playing with a uh, alien disintegrator. I want an explosive on that though, so I'm sort of been on the prowl. And even if I do, I I, I kind of think it might not be as good as the fixer. Like you just can't beat it, kind of. But I think it might be fun to try. And the, like look cool, and everyone does a fixer just because it's so good. Well, not everyone, obviously, yeah, but people who do commando builds 
most are doing fixers. Uh, Especially people who are doing stealth like commando builds. Chill, 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 it's fine, it's fine. Okay, this is C6. We're close. Okay. Actually, hold on. I think it's this way. Or is that the way we came in? We came in this way. Okay, I'm stupid. Ah, no, uh, 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 uh. Get out of here. <laughs> How are you guys? And it must be this way through the door. Go on, get. Uh, what ring? Oh, oh. Nice. Uh, That's gonna be worth a lot, right? Yeah. This is but this is here we go. This is the biggest hall yet. This right, is the biggest careful. hall yet. Don't trust the trees. Don't trust the trees. Don't trust the trees. Oh my. You never want to hear that. Don't. What do you mean the trees? Is. <laughs> what do you oh, mean the trees? There's a, there's a, oh, there's a thing. There's oh, my a thing oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! There's T Rexes. Oh my god! Oh, those are the oh ones god. that oh hear god. you. <laughs> I don't think he knows about that. Yeah, there's certain ones, I'm 90 some odd percent sure it's those ones, that if you're talking, they hear you. There's so much shit. <laughs> That's funny too. He's really just saying how good they were doing. Shouldn't have said that. Oh, yeah, they hear. I did. I did not know that. <laughs> oh no, we lost all the money. Wait, I mean, that's the type of thing you should, you know, maybe uh, consider uh, explaining oh, to new no. players. On the other hand, fun not to. You stay completely quiet. They won't attack you. Ah. Uh. So what happened to you guys in there? Anything crazy? We got so much stuff. It's all gone. Yeah, I was surrounded. It was so bad. I thought we had stuff. What happened? They say Didn't they all we bring back a ton of stuff? Oh. Am I crazy? What the hell? Team everything. white means everything is gone? Yeah. Really? Yep. Yep. Oh. I think you can, uh, you can do restart. Because everybody died. Really? Apparently. If, if we all die, it happens. I saw, I saw in the patch notes <laughs> that you can, like, restart, because now we have to, like, go die. Oh, man. That was Early after 3 p.m. you need to be quiet outside. <laughs> oh, shit. 3 p.m. be quiet outside. Mm. What do you mean not go? Hey chat, what did you have for uh, just lunch today? A fucking bologna sandwich? Uh... <laughs> Why is he asking his chat what they had for lunch? Yeah, so we can make like 200 bucks. 300. Type scan. Someone type scans. Oh, well, yeah. it? How much? It's zero days, not one day. Uh oh. Did we get a day? Oh yeah, we're, we are dead actually. We're dead. Crap. Are we? Because we landed on a planet. Yeah, yeah we landed. Yeah, we should just, uh... Yeah, I guess there's got to be a point where you're, like, so in the hole. If there's no point. It's too late to sell. Oh, that's what... Yeah, yeah. Alright, we got this. We got this now. We got this. Alright. I wish we had walkie-talkies. Oh, that was too that situation right there. Yeah, maybe I'm crazy. I, I swore there was a restart or something at it. Mister, how did you get all those accolades when we didn't even leave the ship? I'm kind of incredible. Slappers only. <laughs> Slappers only. Some gold mine there. <clears throat> that was one of those games. Where, I, I don't know if that... I don't think that will ever be repeated but there was a time where you your way of playing <laughs> games with others was by doing it in person <laughs> that was the option and i was happy right. uh, luckily to be fortunate enough to be alive during those times oh, yeah, hey, 
uh, and being a young gamer during those times. And having just like hours and hours of, you know, we never, I, we, we very rarely did we do slappers only of, of, of playing GoldenEye. Uh, and our, our two go tos were GoldenEye and uh, Mario Kart. Usually battle mode. We would we would do battle mode more than then we would do races. Oh, we can. Do you start with money? Uh, my favorite yeah, golden eye is proximity uh, with uh, proximity mines complex. And, uh, that was my that was my favorite. There's one spot where you could like wait, 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 sort of hold up and be trees. virtually immortal. What's that from? Great asset, great, great asset. I've heard 39 Daft say that a bunch of times. I, All right. I thought shuffle, it was just something shuffle. she like, was from a song shuffle. or something. I'll take the flashlight. Uh, I don't, I don't want to be responsible. Remember, that's here. Which I, I have added some 39 Daft to my uh, playlist here, so I'll get, get, get to her at some point. Try to mix it up a little bit. It's not always going to be the oh, same, uh, same people. One thing I, I put on, which I'm wondering if Over here. there is interest of, is I uh, put on the uh, OTK. Uh, Scary to be on this bridge. They did like a murder mystery party, which Maybe looked like there was the definitely bridge. some oh, some hijinks. Nice. Looked interesting. Right, dude. It looks like maybe Emaru got drunk, yeah. <laughs> which yeah. is amusing to me. The sprained ankle. I don't know if she was acting or actually was it. drunk. Maybe a bit of both. That's kind of cool. Uh, how much health do you have? Uh, red. Okay. <laughs> How much health do you have? Hey, hey, folks, how much do you have? I'm, I'm great. I feel healthy. Take this. Because I am a monster breathing on me away from dying. Yeah, same here. <laughs> I will protect you guys. Thank you, Poke. Just look for a Down the Hey, when Poke's got your back. Nothing to worry about. Other than him, you know, being paralyzed with fear and running away and leaving you to die. But other than that, I don't know what that sound is. What is that sound? Oh, a dead end. Nice. Oh, come on. What's wrong? Can you carry these bottles? Uh, I have a light. Do you have a flashlight? Do you want to take a flashlight? You can use both. Oh, you can. How do I turn it on before I pick it up? Yeah. Oh. I see. Okay. Oh, nice. Chemical jug. Oh, what's that? Propane? I think we're rich already, guys. Propane, propane accessories. Yeah. Where's Stir? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I saw that. That was funny. Oh god. What was that? What was that? Oh, oh. 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 I, hear, uh, I hear a clicking. Got him? I wasn't watching. Uh, <laughs> Vinny, no. Is 
Should I pick him up? Oh, we have so many items. I'll pick him up. Someone take the show. It was pretty far back this way with the, uh, the main entrance. Oh, God. What's right, is the fire exit close? 77. Uh, 77. The body dies. I mean, this is worth more than the bottles. I'll pick this. I'll take this. You came from this way, sir, right? So it should be this way, though. Uh, oh. from, my neck's yeah. starting to go. I need a I need a good stretch. Well, we'll finish this. Where you guys go? And then, uh, come, 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 come. Oh, well, yeah, we'll yeah, be yeah, done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's how finishing things work, traditionally. And then I can go do my shit, ropes, stretch, etc. Fall out. I know the missus is actually getting up early-ish hey, hey, today hey, hey, hey. and going Windows shopping with her mother. She gave me the shovel Boy. The dam. <laughs> it's funny that uh, a thing like that, shopping with your mother, it's something that the missus, you know, looks forward to. Something I would what? dread, <laughs> shopping with my mother. Hey, something I did dread back in the here. day. What is it? Yeah. There's, um, a, uh, there's a beehive near the ship. You said we grab the beehive and leave. Why don't we deposit this be, stuff be first? Alright, come on, beer. There we go. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about. Alright, you know what might actually work here? Let's get the long boy out. Maybe even get the... I like backup to do this. You know what? My alarm went off and I forgot to take a sip. It's too late now. There's no going back. What the? Oh, it was a giant. Grab my shovel! Don't leave! What happened? Why did you scream? You screamed and he killed me! <laughs> wait, I... Okay, we gotta... Wait a minute, wait a minute. who screamed, sir? <laughs> that, like... I wasn't paying attention to so that got me a little bit. Oh my god. I, I need to, um... Pass you up the heavy stuff. <laughs> The door opens. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's so that sad. Was did, did you see what that looked like? I, the, the yeah, they're, I, I don't really get why they look how they look. It's like a giant... Oh, you know what they look like? Uh, what are they called oh, in so like Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom? Not Octroy. Like the, the big rock the guys that don't have a head. Kind of look like that. And, and the guy grabbed me. Has vision. Oh. Okay, let's get rid of this. Get in my way. He's fucked. He's fucked. He's fucked. Oh god. I don't like that. Dude, I think that's that's the loudest I've screamed. Jesus Christ. He can't get in now. I think he can get in. Blasphemer. Tank. It was worth 77 bucks. No. Oh, no. Oh, we have, no, these guys are scared. Man. We just can't. Everyone was so quiet. It doesn't seem at all safe. But there's like a hundred dollars worth of stuff right there. <laughs> they left most of the loot outside. Oh, that's so funny. He's just gonna grab me through the wall somehow, and we're just gonna die. Yeah, <clears throat> I have seen a number of these monsters seemingly clip through yeah, walls. This is dangerous. It's totally dangerous. Wario you know waterproof. You know what these are called? I'll scan it right now. I'm trying to get a scan, it wasn't working. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded real. <laughs> so I have a scientist scream. No. Hey. <laughs> the fuck? Hey, come here! I, I think we got time. I'm gonna pass this up. Bro, I'm telling you, he probably ate. 
He's coming back. Oh, he's running now. He's sprinting. Holy shit. That was so funny, Poke. I like I thought we all had to be quiet and I get right to the, the, the banister and I just hear you scream, Get in here. <laughs> just like, oh my god. No, but you know, he was chasing you before, is that that's so funny though. I thought I was being quiet and good. There's the other no, 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 so some one some enemies can see far away and not, you know, that's not hearing based. That's oh. so goddamn funny. <laughs> Yeah, these, those, those ones can see. Yeah. <laughs> the ones without the heads? Very good eyesight. You wouldn't think so. Maybe it's some sort of... Uh, yeah, that was 4 o'clock. What was going on there? there was that's something. called... Uh, not echo sense. Brown <laughs> sense. No. Where's the lens? Oh, what is the D&D &D term? Right, if you know you're yelling it out. And you're Dead furious with here. me for like, not remembering so echo like, hey, oh, I'm being so quiet and no. sneaking. It's like the guy can Tremor see sense. you. He's coming after you right now. Nice. It's, it's very hard when your hands like are full. Like a... Uh, Mulet, for example. So the map geometry is like lower than the floor. Which is I like a shark, like, but underground. Something. At least somebody <laughs> here. Somebody brought a hairbrush sort of. back. That's good at least. Yeah, that's what I got. Alright, um, we found the pumpkin patch. Jeez. What, what does this mean? Uh, I think it means the Halloween's over. <laughs> it's the great pumpkin patch, Charlie Brown. It's true. <clears throat> this was the Halloween update. Oh, better explain. Mm, so I was, uh, before I started, kind of scoping out right. the DLCs for this. There's the Spongebob one, which came out a while ago. Uh, I think that was maybe, if not the first DLC, one of the first ones. And then there's like a Back to the Future one. I gotta assume you're gonna be cleaning the DeLorean and the clock tower, right? I wonder what else is there. Uh, there's a Warhammer one. I don't really know what would be. I'm kind of curious about that one, actually. I don't really know. Uh, my my Warhammer knowledge is by no means exist, uh, extensive. Rather. There's a Pac-Man ghost chasing me. They're all uh, like eleven dollars, though. I feel like. To me. Uh, Power Wash Simulator DLC should be five dollars. Really? It's the price I have in my like head. Four trees and dogs around the base. Who has nothing? I have, I have nothing. I'm, oh, no. it was. Uh, All right. I will say it, <laughs> this makes me a little dizzy doing this, but we're gonna do it anyways. Quick stand here, anything, right? Avert your eyes. No. What if I get knocked away? Micro strats there. Watch. Just run and jump. Thank. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was pretty good. So this is worth a lot then. That's worth eighty, so I would excellent. Okay, cool. That's really good. Um, right, come back. I'm gonna stay. No, you know what? Uh, no, you're coming. Okay, you're an intern. But my legs are almost come. broke. <clears throat> I'm coming too. Oh wait, uh, I think this poke is this you? Hey. All right. Is it this last little nook? Jeremiah, I fell, and I thought that I wasn't going to take fall damage, and I took like eighty percent damage. Oh awful. no! Yeah, that's okay. Shallow sign letters. 
forgot the tea. Are they in here? Um, uh, yeah. and they clearly. Oops. We're coming in here with uh, no light, we no walkie-talkies, no nothing. Stand. Nothing. Any? I don't know why. It's got really quiet. Yeah. Stand. Got we got. Is that you? A wall. There. Oak. Oh boy. Um, I, I, I don't know. They're not in here. Are they outside? I'm just gonna oh, look around, okay. I guess. Uh, oh, damn it. Be careful. Make you do this. I'm just gonna get a little death turn. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, oh, God. Okay. I'm not gonna get that way. Uh, what? Was cool. Alright. I'm, th I'm thinking this is it. You, Star, or Pope? Uh, let's, let's just go back. Let's double go back check. The There's nothing. I didn't miss this one. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go, go, go back in front. No, no, no. Give shot. This doesn't open. Okay. Right? No. Anybody out here? Hello? Hello? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Why, cool. Why would they do this to us? Where? Fuck. All right, maybe we'll just go back. It's fine. Just, just go back. All right, I enjoyed this one. I think it's going to be hard to take away my favorite, the skate yeah, we, we can look on the, uh, in the ship, right? Yeah, I'm just going to go into the ship, and uh, that's fine. We can just go there, because I think we're getting real close to the um, enemies appearing. Yeah, and I, I don't want to mess around with that again. We already made so much money, we don't even need to be here. This is stupid. I don't think they're in here. <laughs> Where did they go? Are they dead? Are they? Um... See, they are inside currently. It looks like, and they're picking up yet green Doritos, which means that they're, you know, they're doing God's work. Okay, so they're all right. How do we unlock that door? There's a door. It's oh yeah. How do we right on the terminal? Mother, oh, we're gonna scare the shit out of them. By the way, they're gonna hear that. Freak out. is going. Oh, nice. I switch cameras. Crab Bay Aquarium. I almost just started the yeah. ship. Oh, the white button. The white button. So if they, if there's a door that like has a number, like um, and it's red, we can open it by typing press open and the door number. Oh, okay. <laughs> I almost pressed start ship. That would have been so awful. Oh my god. <laughs> nice. I, ooh, ooh, wow. You came ooh, plenty. You, just, you did it. Yeah, I did that. <laughs> Stir's out there like a hero. Yeah. How do we ping Stir? Is there a way? You see the, you see the Doritos? That's blue. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's, oh, is that weird on. that they both <laughs> called them Doritos? Yeah, They're triangles, yes? <laughs> We actually didn't all die. Yeah, we, we kind of ran back to the ship because it was getting late and we were like, no, this is bad. All right, we what afraid. should we say for last? Yeah. The door? Just, yeah, no, let's do the door. That's all right. No. The door last. Which means I want to get it. The doors can't open or close without the apparatus. Oh. Six o'clock. Get a nice border going. No sign of stir. No, no, no. That stir is kind of getting lost. What is he doing? He said he needs to come home now. All right, we'll do that last. This, this, this square. The... I, I always like to do that, like saving something for last. Oh, wait, 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 he's he's well, not on the beach, because I don't. Ooh, satisfying. We might, we might, all right. We might be all right. Stir, stir, just find the ship. Come on, stir. You can do it. Come on. I don't know much about stir. Him with the teleporter? 
Did I do that? Counts. Yeah. Which is so good because uh, you lose money for not recovering bodies. Hey, you guys are rich. Almost. All right, let's, let's get yeah. out of here. Oh, hell yeah. All right, let's go. Hey, uh, do you guys mind if this next round uh, I sit in the base with the, with the walkie talkie and eat my Chipotle? <laughs> that, yeah. That's fine by me. Yeah. What's your order? What did you get? I don't know. I got a burrito. I haven't had one for a long time. <laughs> Alright. A burrito? A burrito with like, just, I don't know. I'm craving a burrito. Wait, so you don't have it yet? No, it just got here. Well, what's in it? Well, yeah, what's in it? Uh, just, I think it's rice and stuff. Like, just, I don't know. Did you order it? I didn't order it. <laughs> it's a surprise. I'll let you get it though. Surprise burrito. Nothing wrong with that. Should we sell like <coughs> so uh, we, can guide us we had uh, last night actually. Uh, Wait, how much money do we have actually? It's like these uh, panko. Can you check the store? Oh, we have no money. Panko covered yeah, shrimp. Sell, get some, taco then, things. Then, um, it's like a kit if, from if Costco. Now, though, it's less money if it's not oh, God. They're very oh. good and easy. Good and easy? I mean, we gotta not like crazy though, expensive. Then you can eat and uh, guide us, right? Did yeah, we just land back on the same planet as the only one that doesn't isn't eclipsed and like something? Check. It's always dark. People saying. I mean, fuck yeah! I'm just gonna speed run this burrito while we're in there. <laughs> oh, no. Well, I mean, enjoy your meal. You can open doors for us, and then when you're done, you can come back. Yeah, you can, yeah, you're right. Enjoy your food. You, we'll, we'll be good. Alright. Just, okay, at the, leave loot at the front and I'll go pick it up. Okay. Okay. Alright. Good luck, gentlemen. Do not die. Enjoy your burritos. <laughs> we'll do our best. The burrito. That's kind of a <clears throat> nice thing about this game is, uh... I mean, I guess you wouldn't want someone right doing that all the time. Unless sure maybe they're really good at it. Uh, hey, hey, and they, they like staying in base. It's like a rest thing as well. The they call them, uh, the so, well, yeah, and not a very nice term. But so, uh, people who just like stay in base and, 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 and take care of things for the people who go out and roam and bring back the loot. Which, you know, I wouldn't mind that necessarily. Sort of keeping everything organized. Actually, I would like it. Actually, I have done it. Uh, I mentioned playing with my buddy there. Uh, we don't often share a base. We have, but we don't often. Uh, not because of him, but because of me. Uh, I, I can't. <laughs> I need a, everything in a place and a place for everything. Strike that and reverse it. Um, But when we were uh, living in the same base, I would be like the sort of organizer. <laughs> this is a, this is actually like the room. I was gonna say this is like a David Lynch room. It's just like some weird meat baby exists in there. Uh, by the way, in a week or so, I'm gonna be setting up some teams for the House Flipper Two Invitational. Oh, that's a good one. I don't know if I w would want to rewatch that. <coughs> but if you uh, haven't watched Jerma's House Flipper 2 Invitational, I would recommend. That's good. Actually, oh, you know what? Play House Flipper. Uh, I, I have played it. I, I think I've beaten all the levels, though. I guess, do, uh, is there DLC for that? Maybe there is. There is a, a home that I've been working on, and I haven't really touched it in a while. I was actually going to record a base tour of it at some point, but it's not quite done yet. The rules will be... Oh, this one of those things, you don't look at them. 
Slenderman is, you know, scary to behold. What do I do? Can I get it off him? Is he, he's got a, it's on his head. One of those things is on his head. Stuart, where are you? Can you hit Stuart, when that happens? I, I feel like I saw someone, Stuart, like, hit you? it off. I can't help you. I can't help you. You gotta... You're dead, dude. Stuart, where are you? Woo! Oh, 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 oh. Hey, um, this is a... Uh, he's dead. Then he's dead. But don't come in here. This is one of those things that's behind me. What is what? what? One of those things is behind me. The things that you don't look at. It's right behind me. Just be careful. Right next to me, to the right behind me, to my right. Don't put that flashlight in here. Cool. Oh, he actually did get it. <laughs> yeah, Vinny is uh, Vinny's dead. We gotta bring his body back. Okay. You wanna grab his body? Uh, yeah. Door window. Jump with the body though. Office doors. Uh, I think it's all. Oh wait. Do you have any items? Balls. No, I, I haven't found anything. Okay, well. There's a key here. Can, okay, can you, do, can you do anything if somebody has one of those things on their head? Uh, I don't know. Maybe you can shovel hit it. Oh. Interest room, well. You'd have to scan the hook behind the fine. Don't look uh -huh. at it. Yep, yep, yeah. I'm not looking anywhere. I'm looking right at you. Look at me. You and me. We're here together. We're going forward. We're working here. All right. We're gonna get some stuff. We're gonna bring Should this back. be this? Bring back life. Let's go back. Let's try and find our way back. I got a metal sheet. But back up. Yep. Yeah, don't look. Back up. <sighs> okay. Okay. Satisfaction. Um, should we back up and not look? Um. If I back up. Endorphins it's incoming. It's, it will you see me? Keep going. You're good. Turn around and run to the door. Oh, I didn't scan it. Shit. It's it's all okay. We're out. I was afraid. I was too afraid to scan it. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, we're gonna leave the body for Pope. Uh, are you going back <laughs> in? Should we go back in? I mean, that's kind of funny. That's very funny. He's gonna come. He's gonna be eating his burrito. He's gonna come to do a collection, and he's gonna be like, "Oh, fuck. Okay." Up to you, you boss. You wanna go back in? I think we're already over quota. Mm -hmm. That's true. We are. All right, let's go. <laughs> what am I missing here? Hey, hey we did it. What about the beehive? Let's have a look at the old. Uh, we can try oh. and get that. Yeah, they. I feel like they haven't quite figured out the replays for large areas like this. But I would like to just do quota one so we can get some money. <laughs> because it just shows one area, but still, Wait, yeah, but still. All right, let's just have a look at what's going to be next. Yeah, we lost him. Mansion plane. Yeah, go All right, so probably what I would do uh, is, as we did today, I'll, I'll uh, do another episode where we clean the plane and then we clean the mansion. And then, TBD. TBD. Nice. But we're going to catch that as an episode, I guess, of whatever this thing ends up being called. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, uh-huh, mm -hmm. Thank you for having it on in the background, I assume. <laughs> uh, I do appreciate it. You know, that's what I, uh, I make this for. I make it because I like making them. I make it because seemingly people don't hate them with the white-hot passion of a thousand suns, so that's nice. And, uh, you know, it's something to, to have on and fill the silence, fill that dreaded silence. Ooh, don't you hate that? Hey, I I consume things like this, so I get it. I get it. Uh, end of YouTube video things, blah, blah, blah. It's nice to be nice to the nice.